Hi, chat. Hello. What up? How you guys doing? Sorry, I like hard AFK. Oh, intro's not even long. It's only five minutes. What up? How you guys doing? Good morning? Kind of good morning? Sort of good morning? Maybe good morning? I need a new intro chat. Ugh, this door. Tired? Have you not been sleeping too? I woke up this morning. Uh, I fucking ran an errand. And then I came back home. And then I was thinking about getting on, but then I laid in bed. And then I sat on my computer. And then I dicked around in people's streams. Hi. Hi, hey, hi. People, hey. Suspicious activity at 2142. What the fuck is 2142 UTC? Clinics. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Thank you so much for gifting a sub. Oh, we're about to fall under that 1K. It's making me nervous. I'm not going to look at it. Hamilton and Riley, currently stationed in Strawberry, looking for Deputy Claymore. These seem kind of old. An hour ago? Is it? Thank you, clinics. Appreciate you, dude. I'm gonna go check my telegrams real fast. Hello. What do you say? Oh, no, I didn't hear what he said. Percy! No, dude. I mean, like, dude, I am. It's just my schedule is so fucked up. Fixing sleep schedule soon, copium. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's midnight for you right now, clinics? Oh my god, I'm sorry. I want to go change my outfit. I realized I, okay, so you know how yesterday we made this outfit? Because he was like, all right, you can't wear a white shirt. So I made this fucking outfit. Yeah, that's right. I realized Goldie has the same exact fucking outfit. Same as fuck Halloween, but I mean, we can work that out, I guess, when it comes to that. Yeah, either of each other knocks each other out. Yeah, that's right. If we're both standing at the end of it, that means yeah, we both lose. No, that means we both win. That was, yeah, I mean, that means we both win. All right, then we share the corn's beef in the newspaper in, in, in the bottle. Deal. Fine. Okay, George, let's go. Wins. Yeah, let's do this. Fucking guy with his goddamn titty milk. Oh, I'm just a big fan of my mom. She's really cool, and you remind me of her. I'm leaving that telegram on red.
Is that how you spell insinuating? Hey, Miss Dusk. You remind me of my mom. You remind me of my mom. I like to drink my mom's titty milk. Elmo, um, well, thank you so much for the two months. I don't know what you're insinuating, but if you would like to chat, I can be available. Let me know what uh, time. Let me know. Hello, Dusk. It Klaus, it's nice to meet you at City earlier. I hope you get your poker training soon, even if not from Klaus. Jack was correct about group poker player, not all pleasant as Klaus. Haha, ha, okay, my telegram is DL6. Maybe we should start a command shit for the fucking telegrams. DL670. Uh, telegram. Boom. What the fuck's the horse chat? Do 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 do. Is that the horse? They really, they really do need more uh, hitching posts around the Saint Denis station. Let's go change out of this all black attire. There's like barely any etching posts, man. There's like, oh, there's one on this side. Lauded and hitch? Fuck. <sighs> 
simply magic. Bro! It's because I've been playing so late. I hate it. But also, at the same time, uh, there's not like a whole lot of stuff and people on the server in the morning, so... I guess it doesn't really matter that I'm like late night now. Today, we are getting our first bank robbery. I'm calling it now. We need to manifest this bank robbery. Has it really, Uni? Well, shit. All day? Even this morning, I I, uh, I was so tired, I didn't even, I tried for a second, I was like, I, I can't, words, sentences, can't form. How coordinated I was trying to, I can't just tip them off. I'm reading the tip line. It seemed like that. I was kind of watching the server numbers. Hi, Canadian. Oh, it is Memorial Day weekend. Do you guys have Memorial Day plans? Oh, that's why my neighbor asked me if I want to go on the boat this weekend. My neighbor's so nice. He always invites me to, like, go outside and shit. Hey, you don't know, have a boat. You want to come hang out? I made that sound strange. Um, no, he's nice, dude. I, no wonder everyone's outside is mostly the point. I didn't, I didn't realize... I mean, they go out all the time anyways. It is Austin, right? And the weather's been really good, but it's been hot. I realize that sometimes you can hear... I know you can always kind of hear, like, a slight humming. But lately, I think it's been more because the AC, like, never stops running because it's fucking so hot here now. Just leave this shit running. She doesn't want to murder me? No! Dude, my neighbor's so great. He saw that I had wasp and he took care of it for me. Let's check this out. Summer's gang, Pip's still out there, the Red Hoods. Dude, I don't I don't know how to find any of the Red Hoods. I'm gonna, I might read the Red Hood dossier since there's a lot of them outstanding. Danny of Decenzos, Sam Bass and Barry Bjornsson, Emerald Ranch Cartel, and Rick. And Isaac Creed. Awkward Johnson's wanted for assault and battery. Moxie. Why your fan armadillo on the telegram so you're from the let's see the song uh, proclamation dead I Jack and the Bloody Hoods gang. A man with a bandit wait. Wait. Hold on. <laughs> Wasn't there like an old meme where a gang was uh recruiting people through the yellow pages? Is this like Kind of the same thing. They're recruiting through flyers. A man with bandages had had water blind couple on the street. He was treated and said that he cannot remember anything. He did not know his name. The only information provided that he was in Cisco three years ago and was released. So that's so long that one has been all over. Yeah. Okay. I want I want the character descriptions though. Oh, oh, oh here we go. Jack, dead eye Jack. Oh, there's so many Jacks. Black shirt, red tinges, black hat with gold spaces around it, red accents, white, okay. Bald, thin build, pale skin, dark, okay, dark brighton. I'm not gonna remember any of this. I'm not gonna remember any of this until I can see them. I'm changing. Yep, bank robbery. Hi there. Right, cool. 
need to use the changing room? Yeah, yeah. I thought you, I thought you was gonna be the first. No, it's fine. Yeah, you... my ho my horse is like you know going on nuts because you know unless you uh, tie these things down, you know how they like to you know go on nuts. Yeah, that's. As it is. She she kind of jumping right now. Yeah, that makes sense. What's your name? Uh, my name's Johnny. How you doing? Hi, Johnny. Uh, I'm fine. You can use it first. I don't mind. Yeah, right. Well, you know, I'm just trying to get my horse to you know settle down first, and then uh, come down, horse. Damn. Hey, you know, Johnny. She, 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 she just asked some questions. Just chill out, right? <laughs> Are you yeah, a criminal, yeah. sir? Uh, no. Okay, Why? good. Do I look like one? No, because I just need to make sure that you're not a criminal. Because uh, every time, oh shit, never, never mind. I'm gonna change. Oh. Uh, I'll, just, I'll just be here patting on my hole. This dude's suspicious. This dude is suspicious as fuck. Wait, I want the white outfit. Oh, we are at insanity. Let's wear a fancy outfit. Fuck it. What's your full name, sir? Uh, Johnny Badman. Johnny Badman? Yeah. Your last name is Badman. Yeah. But you're not a bad man? I mean, I'm, I'm a member of the Badman family, so technically I am a uh, bad man. What do you do around here, Johnny Badman? Uh, mainly fish and play the hop. And you're not planning on doing any crime soon, right? Uh, no, I didn't have none on my itinerary like that. Okay, good. Because the last couple people that I talked to that didn't do crime, they suddenly became criminals after I talked to them. And I need to make sure you're not going to do crime because I don't want you to be cursed by that. Hmm. Yeah, they do sound interesting. You know, maybe it's something about the way you're asking people if they're doing crime. Maybe it lead them to do crime. You know, a lot of times when you accuse people, they start to believe it, what they hear. Listen here, sir. I'm really not trying to manipulate people into becoming criminals because then I'd have to arrest you, which I don't want to do. I mean, what? Why would you want to arrest me when when I'm not the one encouraging people to do crime? I'm not encouraging anyone to do crime, sir. Well, I didn't say you was, but I'm you just saying maybe you might want to. You might want to look into like how you have your delivery. <sighs> All right. How do you think that I should, you know, talk to people then? I mean, maybe like the first few questions you ask them is, you know, them being a criminal or not. Maybe, maybe like might want to like wait until like the ass a little more broken before you open up with that, you know. So you think that I should might want to like be like, how your day that? going? Hey, uh, hey, what you do for a living? Hey, uh, you got any uh, kids? You married? You know, uh, what's your favorite color? What's your favorite song? You know, that type of thing. Okay. And then he's into the, hey, you ever do any crime recently? You know, like somewhere, like maybe second or third day into the uh, relationship. Okay. You know, not on the first date. Not on the first date. I feel that's like that's I'm the saying. most important question, though. I should lead up to that and then find out more about, you know, your love life and all of that. Yeah, we're going to get to know somebody a little more. And then, you know, be like, hey. I mean, you know, I've been, you know, milling this out for the past few days, and I've been wondering, are you a crimer? You know, and then you, you know, after you, you know, you, you've broken down the defenses a little bit, you know, gain their trust a little bit, then you go. Uh, are yeah? you a crime user? All right, but would you not say that that was a good conversation starter? Because look at how much we talked since then. I mean, it's me talking about how Thank people you so much for the 15 months. tend to do crime after they meet you. But, uh, I'm not accusing anything, or anything. I think you're accusing something, sir. I'm not accusing. I'm not correlating or collaborating. Okay, all right, Johnny Badman. Uh, you can change. Then I'll just go back to my office and not encourage any crime from happening. Excellent, excellent. You have a wonderful morning. <laughs> you too, sir. I don't know. To be honest, I feel like, you know, the awkward conversation starter is a really good awkward conversation starter. Because they're going to respond one way or another, and it always works, because then they just talk to you for, like, five minutes about, like, really anything. <gasps> Whoa! 30 minutes 
time we're going. We're going. We're gonna go get Jonathan. All right. Um. He sent that at six thirty. Six minutes ago. Twenty-five minutes from now. How do I do what? <laughs> Mick. Hey, try it on Tinder and then let me know how it goes. All right. I, I would love to hear it. There has to be worse. No, there are worse. Trust me. When I used to use Tinder, there were definitely some fucking people that... You know what? Maybe that's how I should talk on her is like how dudes on Tinder talk. And they think it's like really smooth. Hi Chi, what up dude? No, it's not bank robbery time. It's fucking Sissica transport time. It's it's Hoops character. It's Jonathan Redding. The cannibal killer. Tinder I haven't been to on Tinder in so fucking long. I don't know if I could do dating apps. I mean I don't I don't need to. Currently. But I'm saying, you know. Post Telegram, Anon, Sunder Dusk, Jessica Transport. Get in a. You ain't uh, caused anyone to do any crime, have you? No, I haven't caused anyone to do no, any uh, crime. Just checking. I'm just checking. I'm just checking, you know. It's been five minutes. How would I have encouraged anyone besides That's you to do crime? Five whole minutes. That's a lot of seconds within <laughs> those five stacked minutes right there. I'm just, you know, I just want to check out, making sure. Have a good morning. Uh, he said 30 by 6 o'clock, so that would be 40, 20 minutes. What did that guy say? <laughs> he said, have you caused anyone to do any crime yet? Have tickets, oh, that's so cute. Oh, the telegram? Uh, yeah, I read them earlier. You'd have to go back. One is from Klaus, and it's like, hey, let's play poker. And one was like, uh, one was from West Shield saying, hey, uh, let's meet up sometime. So both of, both of them were basically the same. And then one was from Tommy that basically said, you remind me of my mom. Uh, basically, <laughs> I like my mom's titty milk, and I like my mom, and you remind me of my mom, by the way. So, that's kind of what that was about. Uh, <laughs> so I didn't respond to it yet. I need to figure out, like, how I want to respond to something like that. I don't know, man. I feel like... 
I feel like just it's, this motherfucker made us drink titty milk. We fucking his mom's breast milk yesterday. Like I, I don't know. I don't know how. I don't know how I want her to ha like respond to that. Really. Ask him for more milk. If I was on Goldie, I'd probably like try to purchase a bunch of his mom's titty milk and then like give it to people. I'm gonna leave that unread. Was it chocolate milk? No, dude, but I like how both of his characters. Okay, so I think the chocolate milk thing developed on Phil because, you know, it developed from Goldie liking the chalky milk that the sheriff gave her. Um, and now his new character, I, I think, liked milk. But, and then it like developed that like his character ended up liking his mom's titty milk because he was like a man child or something. So like both of his characters are now like weirdly obsessed with milk. But one was shit milk and one's like his mom's titty milk. Fucking gross. Fucking disgusting. Plus on Tommy's mom's milk too. Oh no. Stop it. Klaus likes that milk too. I didn't know when he liked all milk, it was like all milk. It wouldn't surprise me if, if, if Klaus was into that. But also, what the fuck, man? <laughs> no! Parasite! Fuck! You know, the thing is, is like, on Goldie, if we met Tommy and Tommy gave us the milk, you know for sure we drink it, right? It's not, it, unless it's like, eh, I'm like kind of whatever about like regular milk, but I really do like cho chalky milk and the flavored milk, and then we like deny it, right? But most likely, I'm gonna go with the RP, so it's gonna be a two for two. Did you practice my Goldie voice a little bit? No, I think I lost it, chat, if I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't think I know how to do the Goldie voice anymore. It's been a week. Has it been a week? Four days? I don't know if I know how to do it anymore. I, I feel like I'm kind of talking more back to normal, but my pacing is still fucking weird. Ice tea's wife Coco still breastfeeds. What? You're lying. I think I have to be like on the character to be honest with you. Try it now, ask Miss Vu. <coughs> Hi, Miss Vivian. I was wondering if he's got the chalky milk for me. For me? Shit, dude. I don't know how to do it. I've been into Sicily. I've been real hurt for quite some time now. I don't think I could do it, dude. It, I, it needs more like fucking swing. Been into Sicily. I've been real hurt. I've been sitting at Miss Effie's house, sleeping. Yeah, there was lots of ugly babies there. Okay, it's kind of coming back. I can, I can do it. TG and tip lines. It's hard to do, like, not on the character. Now, for some reason, I feel like the first time I talk is Audrey, it's gonna... <clears throat> I'm gonna end up talking like that again. You talk all strange voice for the most part. Yeah, it, 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 dude, I feel like I've done it for so long, it's easy to flip back into. It's just I need to butcher it up a little bit. Like, start uh, making the grammar all fucked up again. Yeah, I know. I know you guys miss Goldie. I know there's a lot of crim viewers that are like, ew, law. I know. I know, everyone's like, think of your, think of your phrases. 
God, I hope she has her eyebrows on today. I don't know why he was doing that. I asked Kano. I was like, dude, it's, it, it was the first time it's happened to me where people don't fucking see my eyebrows. I don't know what to do. And we were just laughing about it because I was like, God damn it, am I too textured? He's like, God damn it, why are you so textured? You're just too textured now. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. We'd have to see. If it happens again today, it might be something with, like, the way that I tweaked her, like, uh, makeup for some reason. So, I might have to swap out, like, her eyeliner or eyeshadow. That's the only thing that I think, that, like, I changed is I made her eyeshadow uh, less bag heavy. Like, the eyeshadow doesn't go on her bags as much. Selfish on both. Yeah, trust me. I feel the same way, Parasite. I want both. I want to be able to, like, uh, I want to be able to swap between them. There's some days I just like, damn, I would love to have the chaotic energy of Krim. And some days I'm like, damn, I'm really enjoying law. You know what I mean? And started coughing to cover it up. Uh, <clears throat> yesterday I yelled Boyd. I don't think he heard that I yelled Boyd. And then I didn't want him to know that I yelled Boyd out of excitement because they're having, they're like, you know, they have like this strange friendship. There was that. Um, last night I OOC gas pop mic'd when I saw Klaus. Because it was an auto response to get excited to see Klaus. Uh, that too. And then I was like, ah, oh, shit. I hope you didn't hear it. I walked away, though. Sometimes I get really excited to see characters that, um, you know, like Goldie would like. Because I, I like, like, our ping with them and, and, and stuff. Um, and I'm used to responding. Uh, so sometimes it's a habit to just, like, run up to those characters. This is kind of what happened with Klaus. I was just like, <gasps> I can never fucking tell the this okay you see that hair hairstyle he had I feel like all the fucking uh, law blonde law guys have that hairstyle but all of, like the new players get the one that Victor has it's gonna be like why are you pacing You're up. Yeah. What are you? Uh, what are you up to? I was thinking of going and helping you with that transport here in a second. We can probably leave pretty soon. Yeah, I think we should leave pretty soon. Uh, maybe give it like seven. More. He he isn't out. He's in, in <laughs> seven. Why seven? <laughs> well, cause he ha he's not getting released until you know the hour. So might yeah, as well go did, on the hour. No, I'm just I'm just wondering why you picked seven. Oh, seven minutes. Target? Yeah, oh, but why seven because minutes? Because like, I don't. Why not seven minutes? It's longer than five, and it's less than ten. <laughs> <laughs> right, I was, I can see a little bit of logic there. Okay, so that you don't all. see any logic. Well, I don't know. It just seemed weird that you said seven minutes. I feel like seven minutes is a good number. It gives okay. people enough time to read the tip. Has anyone responded to the tip line that they're coming besides us? No, I don't think so. Why am I always, I, am I the only one that likes to transport people from Sissica? Oh, I don't mind it, I'm gonna, I'm about three. Oh, your horse. Oh. Uh, I hope so, clinics. I think he needs to get OOC approved. Might, uh, if we're gonna wait seven minutes, we should probably go get some cigarettes or something. Maybe bring a few cigarettes to some peeps over there. If they're struggling a bit. All right, wait, the prisoners? Yeah. Marty says we shouldn't treat the prisoners nicely because they deserve to be in there and we shouldn't cater to them. Yeah, well, Marty's a bit of an asshole. Not everyone has to be an asshole. All right. I mean, I'm fine with that. Can you buy me uh, 20 cigarettes while you go yeah. and I'll just wait here? Yeah, right. Uh. Thanks. Hell yeah. I know, dude. I think he made a kid. Wait, is that spoilers? I'm not spoiling it. I'm not spoiling. He fucking spoiled it for me yesterday. I was like, you mother. Ugh, I hate him, dude. I want him to play law so bad, but I don't know if he's, um, I don't know if he's going to get approved to get his badge back. I'm not too sure how that's going. I'm not a bear. B bitch. It wasn't my fault. He told me. He sent me a photo. It's like, hey, 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 my kid character. Fucking ass. I know about like two or three characters that he has tabled. Oh, he did? Okay, dope. 
Amazing. Glad I didn't spoil it for him. Fake Farlap. I know it is fake Farlap. Yeah, I really do like seeing Denise. The thing with her story, though, is uh, depending on how things go, I have a feeling that... I have a feeling that she'll end up being like... Well, I don't know. I don't know if it's spoilers or not. I also don't know if that's going to how it's going. It depends on how the RP is, right? Um, I think she's going to end up wanting to go to Blackwater with Boyd. That's how I always play Chi. That's how I always play. That's why it really depends on like how the situation goes. But I think like where the story is right now, it's just a matter of time before like she decides. I feel like she would be like, I'm gonna go to go to Blackwater. The fuck? You should know better. You've watched me for so long. Who do you think I am? You need to know more about this holding your- Oh my god. Egwa, thank you so much for the five bomb. Dude, I appreciate you. Thank you. I really do like walking the streets of St. Denis though. Yeah, Boyd's inside. I'm just pacing and like talking to you guys. I just started up. Hello? Yes, boy? I mean, what do you mean, yes, boy? <laughs> you didn't say anything. Uh, wait. Oh, God. Rip. What? What are my you wearing? Eyebrows? What are you wearing? What do you mean, what am I wearing? What are you wearing? What you are you wearing? Me. No, you, no, you have, copied me. What do you mean? This is... I've had this outfit. You got the red as well? Oh, fuck me. Boy, you're copying my outfits now at this I point. Did, no, no, I didn't, I didn't mean to, though. I what? didn't fucking mean to. All right. Well, the other one that I wear sometimes, I didn't mean to copy you either. I had that too, so I think that I'm on to you now. You're copying everything that I want to wear. I'm not... I'm... At least the shirt's different. You had you to the choose pens? the tie? You still got the pants? You still got the... I like the tie. But it pattern, matches see? the color. Oh, God. Did you do this on purpose? I really didn't. I really didn't. I really didn't. I'm actually... Uh... Fuck. Why do you always have to match me? No, we mean you fucking copied me last time. I didn't mean this. Hey, the pants are different though. I didn't the pants know. Are I have never copied you one time. The only thing that I got accidentally the same as you is the same horse, and that's only because you said thoroughbred. And I got a thoroughbred that looked nice, and then I realized it was the same color as yours. It looks very similar to Bandit. No, it's it's yeah, I know. Well, look look at the price side. I got a hat. Okay. Yeah. The shirt's got patterns on it. Yours don't. The only thing that's the same is we got the same color tie and, and the vest is the same. That's it. That's the only thing that's the same. Pants are different. You got black and red. I've got gray. Okay. <sighs> plus I look. Plus I I pull it off a little bit better. I look better. No. Nah. Not a chance. Get that. Not a chance. I hate you. I don't like it with a hat as much, though. He did this on purpose. Oh! What's why? going on? Anything? Yeah, we're doing a prison transport. Let's go. Oh, right now? Okay. Hold on. All right. You locked the door. I 
I need to go to the stable off stream and I need to fix some things on the horse that I didn't have time to do yesterday. You're gonna need to change. No, I'm not changing. It's your fault that you wanted to match me anyways. Did you not see your outfit the other day and now your horse? Really? I, I've worn this since I've known you, boy. I honestly, I, don't, I haven't looked at you that much. Well, I haven't, I haven't looked at you that much either. That's why, that's why I don't plan my outfits around you, Boyd. Son of a bitch. Where is this prisoner? In Sisica. Oh, we're going to pick him up. Right, okay. Yeah, it's that a makes sense. cannibal killer. Why are we picking up a fucking cannibal? No, the cannibal killer. Remember Jonathan Redding? Oh, him. Right. Uh, yeah, all right. Yeah. Fuck me. Great. <laughs> KG talking. No. I, I'm, let, I'm letting you two fucking go. He's ignoring go. us. We, he ignored me for the first five minutes that I was in the office with him. Asshole. <clears throat> I didn't say that. Is this a partner thing you guys just decided? No! What do you call yourself? Do you have like a team name? That's not what ha that's not what's happening here. Okay, let's get the boat, will you? Hi, Miss Wisteria. Oh, you can hitch right there? Make sure you clock off. We need to clock off? Why Good thing I wasn't clocked on. <laughs> Why do we need to clock off for Cisco Transports? I feel like Monroe told that me That way, this. no, that way, you know, people know that we're not available for doing things. We're out there. Yeah. Mm. Well, All right. let me forget to clock back on then. Let me get back. Okay, are you gonna remember? Yes. Sometimes you forget to clock on. Wait, you keeping track of me? No, I'm just saying because I do the same thing. Cage, why the hell are you so quiet today? Oh, well, I mean, I couldn't, can't fit a fucking word in at the moment. Wake up, you two, sir. You, you two bicker like fucking uh, brother and sister or something. Uh, I don't think I want that. I don't want to be related to Boyd. Wow. <laughs> what what do that? you mean, wow? That's good. What? You want to be related to me? No, I know I didn't say that. Okay. I didn't say that. But yeah, you're, you're talking like what? Well, I'm you're, just, you're talking like I'm some some kind of fucking you know. <laughs> All 
Uh, no, 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 fuck. Just, just get us the fuck. Why the hell would I want to be related to you, Boyd? Have you, have you? Do you know where you're going, by the way? Yeah, Cage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah. right, all right, good. You're gross. Stop bothering what? me. What? So, how no. was Blackwater last night? Um, uh, it was good. I got myself a little house there. Oh. Little house, that's, the prairie. That's nice. So it's, yeah, it's not bad. It's pretty official then that you're gonna be stationed out there. Oh, I don't, I don't know yet. Probably, but I, I don't know. But they, they did tell me that when I put my, you know, request in that that doesn't mean it's going to happen. It's still up to them. Who's up to them? Who's them exactly? The marshals. Oh. They put you where they want to put you. All you're doing is uh, tell them what you'd prefer. That doesn't mean they're going to grant that request. You understand? Hmm. So I have to put in a request? Yes. With Ortega. Hmm. So I should be pretty certain about staying in San Denis before I submit that request then? Yeah, you need to be sure what you want. Yeah, of course. So did you already submit your... Not yet. I'm probably going to do it today. <clears throat> yes, San Denis last night was... Uh, it was it was alright. I went off duty for a bit. Lots of stuff happening. Fuck. Hi, Jonathan! Come here. Yeah, I'm here to get you out. Okay, I'm gonna get my normal, my normal clothes on. All right. Get, get down here, turd. There he is. Have you reformed, son? Yep. I learned a whole lot of things in here, like never talk to the law. What is the that hell? what you learned? That's uh -huh. what you learned in your yeah, time here. I, I made a lot of friends here. I made friends with these people. His name is these the, the Genzos and and other people. And, and they says like the law is really nice to you if you don't talk to them. Oh, I see. Is that what they told you? Uh huh. See, it seems to me they're corrupting you, Busk. sir. Uh, what do you mean? Wait, why sounds is that kind of good? Sounds to me they want you to be a permanent resident here in Sisica Penitentiary. Uh, I I don't think so. Why why they why would they do that? Oh, I know so, because they're a bunch of degenerates, and they want nothing more but to have another plaything in here. Is that what uh, you want with your life? Uh, I, I, but to be fair, I did have That's a good fun time in here to be honest I had, uh, well, it was really bad most of the time but there's a few times I look back and smile yeah I'm sure you're doing a lot of looking back are you ready to leave sir uh huh then let's fucking leave then come on bye uh, when are you released um not sure have we met before how you doing sweet egg I'm not too sure I don't think we have. 
Uh, my name is Cesare DiCenzo. Nice to meet you. Oh, Boyd told me about you. Yeah, you mind, you mind, you mind bringing him back this way? I want to kind of talk to him a little bit. He's got something in mind that I'm uh, want to beg. Yeah, let me, uh, let me go get him. Actually, I heard Grazie. you. Uh, I heard you guys really like chunky milk. Oh, you got some? No, uh, unfortunately, I don't. God Give me a second. It. Let me grab yeah, Boyd. No, hey, Boyd. Yes, Dusk. Uh, Mr. DeCenzo wants to have a word with you. Oh, what's this? Oh, I, I don't really need these. I'm not leaving. He's living here. He was right Over there. Here. Over here. See? Okay. I meant to be cleaning the fucking floors of South Black Bay, you understand? You understand? Now wait, now listen. You got a couple of things in mind, yeah? Yes, yeah, I'm assuming, assuming you're talking about the reading material that I read when I'm taking a shit. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that, okay? I'm just gonna pretend I didn't fucking hear, just... Give me a second, hold up. Okay. All right. About that. Um. You got them on you? Can I have them back? I'm gonna continue writing. No, I do not have them on me. They are put away safely next to the outhouse in Saint Denis. Outhouse. Give me a second. Hold up. Fuck off. You never know when you might need some spare paper if we run out. So it's there just in case. Maron! <laughs> Maron! Right, um, so what's it gonna take, eh? Getting those, uh, those papers back. Well, it's gonna take you to reform, change your way of life. Be a nice, honest man when you get out of here. Show that you're 100%. a solid citizen. 100%. I'm a, you know what? I'm out here and getting plans, get a big foundation for the kids that can't read good, write good, all of that. It's, I'm, I'm all for it. Then good. When you get out of here, show me that you've been reformed and you're behaving yourself. And uh, we can talk. Maybe I can give you that reading material back. All right. Okay, yeah, sounds good. Yeah, I appreciate it, you know? I appreciate it. Just, mm -hmm. just a small mm -hmm. request. Uh, get it away from the outhouse and get it away from your fucking ass, too. All right? No, no, oh, sorry, go ahead. Yeah. All right? Have a lovely day, Mr. DiCenzo. Yeah, you too. Hey, Boyd. I didn't get your name, sweetheart. Uh, Audrey Dusk, sir. Audrey, all right. Audrey, you see, any, you see any guards around here other than this guy over here? Mm. Don't talk to him, Dusk. <clears throat> all right. We must move. She gods, Bye, she Mr. DeCenzo. Uh, hey, Boyd, is that, that what I used to wipe my ass this morning? Hey! Was that his? I was wondering what that was. If it had a lot of numbers, if it had a lot of numbers, then yes. I thought that was like... I thought that was like throwaway. It is throwaway. Oh, okay. You better hurry up there, Cesare. Get your shit together. No. Bye, Bye Mr. Cesare. DeCenzo! I swear to God, boy, you better not be using that age to clean your fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> Never you, you mind, turd. Talking to him or me? Boyd, why the hell do you call everyone turd? I don't know. Is that a new thing you're doing? It's a new thing I'm doing. <laughs> I think he's just talking shit. That's right. yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah, quite literally. It's the front of the boat. I'm going. Okay. Why are you talking to me like a criminal? I don't know. Uh, he's conflicted. Cage! Uh, don't do that to Boyd Cage! What the hell? Sorry. Just step away, would you? Some things it never change, I see. How about that? Play me for your problems. Oh. You guys want to know what my prisoner Are number is? Not really, <laughs> but sure. Okay, it's four four five one five two. I'm not gonna remember that, Jonathan. 
Uh, I had to remember. I was horsey. Cage, should we leave you here, sir? <laughs> He's really struggling. There you go. There you, you don't go. want to All be right. here if you already have friends. But if you don't have friends, then here's okay. You okay there? There you go. I'd say Cisco Island was like a 4 out of 10. Would not recommend unless you have no friends. Jonathan, do you have any friends besides Jojo? Yeah, I have Mr. Cesare DiCenzo. He's your new friend? Yeah. Him and Amadeo. And... Um... And the other one was named Sonny, I think, but I didn't talk to him too much. Hmm. Anything else you want to tell me? Oh, you I also met a guy named Cole. Uh -huh. No, I wish I met Cannabis because I'd drown him in. I mean, I wouldn't drown him in the water. When you get out of here, are you going to still try to go after the cannibals? No. Are you just saying that? Yep. Okay, well. <sighs> but no. Do I'd never do that. Down. I'll be very disappointed in you. I've been telling everybody that you're going to get out a better man. Are you making a fool out of me? Well, I don't know if I can be a better man if I'm already the best. He does have a point there, Boyd. Yes, he's ways I see it, and my friends see it. I, see. I just got put away for honesty. I really hope I have eyebrows today. I should ask him. Apparently people's trying to move in my cave and I got a lot of telegrams about that. Huh. If you keep trying to kill cannibals, I don't think that you're a very good person, although cannibals probably deserve it. But I never said that. What the? Dusk. What, sir? You can't okay. say that. Well, I, I just want to I... say that I've never tried to kill cannibals. I just said I shouldn't be saying that, but cannibals are bad people, but failed. he shouldn't do that because that's vigilanteism and I should get them, not you. And I don't want to kill them, but I will arrest them. Well, I feel like you should kill them, though. Well, all I know if for sure... If you were going to kill them, I would definitely tell you about where they are. I'm... Okay, so... You tell me where they are, but I can't guarantee you that I'm going to try to kill them because I won't. But I will try to arrest them. You if should try not to out. kill them, though. You can pull it in here to the right. I can try way. not to kill them. Don't well, kill them. I, no, what I'm, I'm trying to say, Jonathan. Like, no, I was, I'm, th I'm just I'm thinking maybe the teeth plant. Boyd's teeth plant. The one where he thought of him. No, yeah, okay. Hold Boyd on. did think of the thing to exterminate all cannibals by pulling their teeth out. But it doesn't mean that you should do it, even though it was his idea. And it's kind of a good idea. I don't know. I think don't it's a good idea. Dusk, are you trying to get I, I think I'm gonna do it. Like, every single cannibal, I just kick the teeth out of him and be like, He Boyd already Kerrigan knew the gives his regards. That's that you shouldn't do that. That's a very bad idea. Okay, well, I'll just say this is Boyd's idea, and then okay, then but you idea. know that you had it written in your book, so you're trying to frame Boyd. And if you try to frame Boyd, I'll be mad at you. Okay, well, I won't do that. I just want maybe want some credit on that. He'd be like a hero of tall trees. What do you think, Boyd? All right, that's a no. You shouldn't do that, Jonathan. All right. Boyd and myself are not encouraging your illegal criminal behavior, so please refrain from doing that again in the future, and please keep both of our names, uh, you know. Maybe don't say our names when you're trying to exterminate cannibals, and maybe just what stop exterminating like cannibals. Just don't do that anymore. What if it's like between day and like sunset? Hold on. Like it's like at a dusk or something. Give me one second. Uh, I'm, I'm good to go, right? Craven, right? How Look at that, you. How did that FC? Completely reformed, huh? I, Doing I, hard, I, honest work. I, I certainly am, Mister. I mean, I've already done myself two of the orange runs. I'm just clearing out gators now from my swamp. Well, look at that. This man right here, Dusk, he got arrested last night for moonshine running. 
and he promised me that when he got out he was going to reform and be a better man and work hard for his living look at this and i catch him delivering pelts well I'm look at that very hard mister well that's good to see craven maybe you're not a turd after all maybe i was wrong about you yeah I th that's what i think mister i said i said to you i won't get in any trouble and you know i won't get any trouble from now, from now on mister i'll just I just stick to the hunting and and the oranges and and the fishing, uh huh, and the drinking. I, I, I stick to, but but I stick to drinking the whiskey, though, Mister. Uh huh, uh huh. Good, good. Keep your life on track. I will do, Mister Deputy. You, you. It was all because of you as well, Mister. Wow, you're, you're good job, man. boy. I'm proud of you, Mister Craven. Good job, boy. Yeah, scared him straight. What did you do to scare him straight? Call him a turd a bunch of times? I, yeah, I verbally abused him for maybe 40 minutes. Just by saying turd over and over, is that a new strategy I should uh, also try? No, I, no, I threatened a lot of things, actually. Not the gallo, surprisingly. Mm-hmm. What things? You don't want to know. I do want to know. You're not gonna know. Boyd, I need to know. No, you don't. Come on, tell me. Nope. I want to know, though, Boyd. Watching you squirm is very enjoyable to me. How am I squirming? I, you know what? I don't care anymore. Okay. I kind of care, though. I really want to know how you did it. I don't think he's okay with it. I heard he wasn't okay with it. All right, fine. I don't okay, care. Degenerates. Okay, good. Let's I go back to the office. Hey. Make sure you clock in. Nice All right. Yeah, let me send a telegram saying we've arrived. Uh -huh. That's me, mate. I'm sending that on yeah. my desk. Okay. Oh, Johnny, Thanks. We killed the cannibal the other day, and uh, uh, Doctor Orvid. You know that the brain, the brain, the fella. No, it's okay. He's in, he already went to Sisica for killing the cannibal. Cannibal. Yeah, he got up before I did. You go to jail for killing Something. a cannibal? <laughs> Boyd. Yep. Do you remember last night before uh, you left and you went back to Blackwater and I went to San Denis? Yes. Do you remember how there was two, uh, I think they're like boys, hardly men, that were talking to me? Do I remember that? I wasn't here. How would I remember that? No, when we said bye to each other right after in Rhodes. Okay. okay. Do you remember them? You don't remember Two them, Two fellas you? in Rhodes. No, I don't. Why? Uh. Okay. Oh, sorry, Stone. One of them sent me a telegram uh, this morning. <sighs> he said, uh, okay, I, I don't really know how to explain this story. Maybe I shouldn't. We went to a gate inside. You might not want this echoed through the streets of St. Denis. No, I don't know if I even want to say it at all. So, wait, so someone at Rose that we ran into before I left, is that what you're saying? Yeah, there was two boys, or barely men. They had to be, they were definitely boys. Boys? Yeah, I think they worked with the Postmasters. I don't, why Timmy, don't, I don't Timmy and Tommy? People. Do you know Timmy and Tommy? Oh, right, right. Yeah, I know Timmy. Yeah, yeah. What about him? <sighs> I don't know if I could say it. Think I'm right? What? That to concern me, Dusk. <laughs> I need to get sugar cubes. Yeah, I need to get some food for myself. 
Actually, there might be food inside. Uh, lock this. Trying to find Pearly. Gotta find his ass. I think I'm gonna become an alcoholic. Yesterday. He was an alcoholic? I think Dusk. I'm gonna become an alcoholic. Any hey, updates on that murder? Yeah. Fuel. I opened an we investigation know. about it. Alright. And, uh. I mean. Let's talk about that. I'm gonna check the zip yeah. line. Bar over here. Yeah, um, I've been trying to follow up for the past hour or so. There's been, uh, there's been a few things come up, just old reports. How's it going, Dusk? Mostly. It's good, Clam. I got a number Do one suspect. Idea. Who's that? <sighs> James Delaney. Please keep your voice down. Delaney! The barman of uh, Valentine, right? Yeah. Yeah, I need to find him and question him about yesterday where he was and what he was up to. Okay. Uh, I know the fella. I've done some work for him before, before I got the badge. I'm going really? to convince him to come in. Yeah. Well, I have nothing concrete at the moment. The only thing I have is the fact that he was for sure seen at the Blue Pearl where Phoenix was as well, having a conversation with uh, Sheriff Winward. So, do you want me to uh, get him for you, or would you rather just sit on it for now? Uh, if if you know him and you can get him talking, just uh, get him to recount his uh, whereabouts yesterday. See if he slips up. He was for sure seen at the Blue Pearl here in Saint Denis uh, at I believe seven ten. What was that lady's time? name that we arrested? That was his best friend. Time. All right, so all right, yeah, yeah, I can do that. Well, I'll head, I'll head to Valentine. Just have a look, see if he's and then there. Ask him what he did after. Like where he yep. went. Uh, cause, I won't uh, even bring up the pearl. I'll just see if he even brings it up himself and then go from there. Yep, just his whereabouts yesterday between the hours of 7 and 10. Like what was all he right. into? Where did he go? All that shit. The murder happened uh, roughly around 9 o'clock. So around 9, he was seen a couple hours beforehand at the, at the pearl. Was, uh, and was the victim at the um, the pearl as well? Or? Yep. Him, him, the victim, and Sheriff Winwood were, were all there at the same time. I see. All right. Uh, what were they discussing there? Is it? Uh, Phoenix wanted to talk to the sheriff about, I don't know, his firing, and he wanted. What am to I eating today? Shit. Does the sheriff uh, know why? You just reminded me. Delaney I should would have a problem with Phoenix. Maybe a chicken sandwich. Um, it's in the reports. And tomato yeah. soup. There's a big All fucking right. reason. All right, we'll uh, we'll head to uh, Valentine and uh, see if he's there and catch up on the report. Yeah. All right. Hey, also look for a man named Ezekiel. Ezekiel. He was seen with him. Yeah. Okay. All right. Stay tight. And I'll try to hunt down Pearly. Get those doors. Mm mm. Before stream, I forgot. All right. I guess we said a telegram that we're going to Valentine. Actually, that no, looked, uh, Let's go to Rhodes. Ah, oh, fuck. We probably should. We can send a telegram from Rhodes. Yeah, as long as we don't get picked up between here and there, we'll be fine, right? All right. You want to risk quick, it? Man. Let's just go fucking quick. A lot of riders up 
bed. I don't really know what happened with Phoenix's death because I haven't read the report, so we didn't go to the thing yesterday. So I should probably read it or get briefed on it. Sugar cubes. Don't let me forget, chat. I'm making you tell me when we get to roads. Chicken wings? Yeah, I always grab chicken wings. Salmon too, but only sushi. Who's in that wagon? Boyd, I'm gonna go to the general store real fast. There's Jonathan. Yeah. Sushi's gross? How dare you. What's wrong with you? He said he needed food, right? That sounds so good, Amazon. It's like some shit I would order from a restaurant. <laughs> Clinics. I love sushi. I used to be a sushi chef. Sushi chef. the rolled sushi I don't eat the rolled sushi anymore it ruined it for me Shut the fuck up. I don't believe you. You're lying. Really? I don't know, man. I don't know about that convenient. I don't know about that grocery store sushi. Well, there's nigiri and there's sashimi, right? Nigiri is like the sushi with like the fish on top. Not like the sushi roll. 
And sashimi is just a fish. Mmm, kimbap. Fuck yeah. I miss being in LA and just going to H Mart and picking up a fucking roll of kimbap. No, what I really miss though is um, Korean jajangmyeon. I mean, all sushis are handmade for the most part. It just kind of like I'm down to the fish quality. Oh, fuck. I don't believe you. I don't believe you, Sivaga. I don't. Mm hmm. I don't believe you one bit. Maybe I'll try it though. <laughs> no! No, Beavers! Man's outside Kerrigan Ranch. That's not the one. <laughs> moonshine. Moonshine. It's moonshine. Man's like Kerrigan. There's a man dressed in old tan. Looks like a buzz cat killer. No, right, well, we're not heading out there. We, we'll let someone steal that. Right, we got to go to. Uh, so Moonshine is New Han Hanover, headed west. Well, it could be fucking anywhere. Do you want to go to probably... Moonshine? No, that's probably going to be heading up north through the Cumberlands we'll just head to Valentine I didn't know where to get you to the store so I just got some extra salty bread beautiful <laughs> alright let's head out Boyd, why do you like salt so much? I'm trying to condition my body to it. Why? That way, when it runs deep and heavy, it doesn't affect me in my judgment. When what runs deep and heavy? The salt. <laughs> what? Tommy made you what? Drink his mom's titty milk. Why'd you drink that for? I didn't know. That's why I didn't want to tell anyone. I'm never going to look at you the same anymore. It wasn't my fault. It definitely was. No, it wasn't. He handed me a bottle of milk. He told me that it was Kerrigan cream milk. I figured it was from your family, so I drank it. He said no, it was from his mom's titty. fucked up for me to think about <laughs> I threw it all up after and then Timmy just stood there and watched <laughs> oh ew imitation rest crap. your horse rest your horse Are you 
really not going to look at me the same way anymore. Next time someone offers you know, to, to drink some, just make sure you know what it is, right? He said it was Kerrigan Cream's milk, Boyd, in a bottle. Did it have a label on it that said Kerrigan's cream on it? Or did he just tell you that it did? Did you investigate? Did you look he, into it? He told me. Hi there. Good day. Does he seem like a trustworthy individual? Yeah, he just seemed a little bit socially inept. Uh, and he kept getting sweaty palms and he was hyperventilating and he said my hands were soft and uh, I thought that, you know, and then he fainted and, and when I talked to him, he breathed a lot through his mouth. I gave him my telegram number so then he uh then he fainted again and uh he got really excited when i drank the milk and uh yeah he sent me a telegram this morning it said Wait, timmy uh, tommy did tommy. i'll, I'll okay. have to read it to you later but from what i took from it he said he really likes his ma like a lot uh-huh and he also says that i remind him of his ma Okay, all it's right. It's really well, strange. Yeah, you yeah, you need to excommunicate that. Sounds like he wants your titty milk. What? You heard me. I'm never given what that why the hell would my titties don't even produce milk void I, I don't think he needs aware of that what the fuck is wrong with people you're in the cross that's what's wrong all right you're seeing a telegram okay your turn Oh my god, Fripsy. Where, the pe where people are the most weird. Hi! I don't think I've ever been to Colorado. I want to go. Yeah, some people really like imitation crab. I'm not like a huge fan. California roll. Imitation crab. Um, mayonnaise. Uh, cucumber. And avocado. Wrapped in seaweed. Good night. Hi there. Dragon roll. No, he's not. We oui, I'm talking. I say bonjour. Hi. Oh, okay. Get in, man. Bonjour. Dragon roll is a California roll with eel on top. A Philly roll is cream cheese, uh, smoked salmon with cucumber. Yeah, with eel. A rainbow roll is a California roll with uh, salmon, tuna, and avocado on top. I still remember like all the rolls. Spider roll, that's the one with the fucking uh, deep fried crab. Spicy tuna roll is uh, sriracha, spicy tuna ground up together we'll with friendly. a cucumber. Hi there. Good day. Hey, how are you what? doing today? I'm doing just fine, honey. What can I do for That's you? It's good. Is that uh, Delaney about? He is sitting at the poker table over there. Beautiful. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, you doing, everyone? Good day. Good evening. 
What's going on? Why are all these people in here? All of a sudden. This your face, right? That's a very nice uh, suit there, Boyd. Ah, uh, mate, you're looking pretty smart yourself. Oh, I try, I try. Hey, mate, when you get a minute, uh, I'd like to have a little word with you. Yeah, yeah you are. I'll step out now if you want. Yeah, excellent. That'd be great. Yeah, no worries. You want to talk? Oh, oh yeah, it's fine. You want to talk in the office, or can we talk oh, at the back of the saloon, or? Oh wait, yeah, we can come. Yeah, this one. Have fun in jail, Delaney. Where, where is easy, mate? Oh, so how's business? Is it is it booming? Hey, it's not well? too bad. It's not too bad. No. Can't H complain. How's Kitty doing, oh, sir? Poker. Poker. Uh, Kitty is doing uh, fine. She had a bit of a run-in with some rules and a puma, but she's uh, she's resting up all right. With a what? A, pu a puma, or whatever they called her, uh, cougar, or whatever. Oh, I see. Excellent. Uh, I'll just have to take your weapons off you before you go in, mate. Yep, yep, yep. Procedure and all that. Yep. Yeah, that's fine. I'm feeling I'm I'm hitting at the point with uh where I'm like actually getting to know like other characters outside law, which is really cool. All right. Look at that door. How are you doing? Fucking thing. I'll, uh, I can lock it, boy. Alright. Alright, Delaney, you can just have a seat. Hey. Alright. You coming in? Alright. Me? You guys are distracting me with just food Just sit tight for a second. Mm -hmm. <coughs> I was just supposed to make sure she was with me. So how have things been, Mr. Delaney? Mm -hmm. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I'm hoping to get my uh, stitches out today later on. Oh, shoot, sure. what happened to you, sir? Uh, I got shot in the Armadillo a few weeks ago uh, when there was a shoot up between the Vicenzos and some of the residents of Armadillo. I was taken hostage and got shot in the back. And uh, the bullet was taken out, but apparently what, there was a fragment of the bullet left in, and it was it moved slightly. It was touching my spine on occasions when I was moving about, causing blackouts and stuff. So I had to have an operation and have that removed. Holy shit! Well, I'm glad you survived that, sir. Yeah, no, I was I was lucky, really. But uh, yeah, so. Is Kitty still doing crime, sir? Kitty's still doing crime? Yeah. Uh, I wasn't aware she had done any crime <laughs> before. So there's a funny story with Kitty and mm, myself. Uh, she didn't have oh, a criminal right. record, and then I met her, and I asked her oh. if she was a criminal, and then the next day, yeah. or like one hour after, she became yeah, a criminal. Yeah. No, she hasn't done anything else uh, to get herself charged. <laughs> That's thankfully. good. Tell her I say hi. Will do, will do. All right. Um, uh, Kerrigan. Hey, you man. Your friend, uh, apparently out there wants to know where you get your windows from. Uh, there's a fella down in, uh, Blackwater. Uh, if you get to the timber yard, he can, uh, he can look after him with some window orders. He just has to make sure he orders them in advance. Right. Take a, take a little bit. All right. Okay, Delaney, you, uh... I'm just gonna ask you a few questions, mate, alright? Mm -hmm. uh, could you tell me uh, your whereabouts I'm gonna on take the notes on this. 27th around 7 pm till 10 pm? Hang on, 27th around yep. from when? 7 to 10. 7 to 10, so we're talking about the Tuesday? Hang on, what day are we on? Yeah, 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 New York time. Uh, New York time. I'm sorry, I was just trying to think which day was Yesterday. the 27th. It's the 29th today. So, it'd be the Friday. It'd be Friday. All right, sorry. Okay, so it's slightly different in my head. Uh, that was the 28th. Okay, I've got you. So, Friday, yeah. Uh, Friday, uh, 7, sorry, one more time. 7, and between 7 and... Yeah, yesterday. Yesterday, um, between what time is New York? Back, Seven and ten. Seven and ten, right. Um, <laughs> it's public time. Roughly, because my head works oh, in uh, British time, allowed. so I'm just trying to... Just write this down, by the way, does. Yeah. Um, on it, Boyd. 
I went to Saint Denis. Do I to correct uh, yep. and uh, by roads Saint went through roads in Saint Denis. Uh, we played some poker in the Bastion. Uh, popped into Pearlies. Uh, chatted with Pearly for a bit and some yeah, patrons. Uh, bumped into Phoenix there. Uh, left of Phoenix, he was going to come back to, lead to Valentine, but he had to head off. He got a telegram for somebody, had to head off. Um, and then I met up with my brother Isaac, and uh, we came back to Valentine. Yes. Draven's mother had passed away, so they went up to Strawberry with Kitty and uh, Isaac uh, and Draven, a load of the others from the saloon. Yep. So strawberry, Let's take a walk down cheer him up a little bit, uh, just take him out, oh. and then uh, went through a uh, ride with Kitty for the Big Valley, and uh, came back to Strawberry, hung around there for a little bit, then came back to Valentine and went to bed. All right. Do you uh, remember anyone else you might have spoken to over at, over at Burley's? Um, I spoke to Pearl. I remember Pearly and I remember Phoenix. I don't, I don't think I really recognised many of the other people in there. I had a chat with Pearly because apparently I upset a girl called Trix, I think her name is. So I was clearing that up with Pearly because she works for him and stuff to make sure he was alright and he wasn't offended with anything I'd done and pass on my apologies. Um, you know, I sort of bumped in, I can't remember anyone else at Pearly's particularly. Okay. Do you know a man by the name of Phoenix? Yes. Uh, if you, I think you're the Phoenix you're talking about. Got some scars on his face. Ex Lawman. Yeah, ex Lawman. Yeah, that'd be a better mm. way to describe him. What's your relationship with him? Um, met him fairly early on when I arrived in the crossing. I think over a game of poker. Um, he was with a, he was going out with a girl. Then I don't know, can't remember her name. Uh, bumped in on occasions. Used to hang out at the. Valentine Saloon where it was called Queen of Cups when it was run by Tilly. Um, used to see him there quite a lot. Uh, other than that, sort of like occasionally bumped into him, but otherwise, you know, friendly enough, but I wouldn't say I knew him as well as some people, but knew him better than others. Did you see him at Pearlie's? Yes. Yeah, like I said, I saw him at Pearlie's. He was going to come and have a drink with me at Valentine, but he, uh, we sort of left St. Denis together, but then he had he was called away, basically, so I didn't see him after that. Okay. Who's that person? Did you see him talking to anybody? Um, Hanging out with anybody? I actually saw him before Pearlie's. Very briefly, he popped into Bastion when I was playing poker. Um, don't know if he spoke to anyone there because I was obviously focused on the poker game because I was losing a lot of money. And then I saw him at Pearlie's, spoke to him there a bit. He was already chatting. There was about, I don't know, three or four other people in Pearlie's at the time. But like I said, I, I didn't really recognise any of the people in there myself. I don't know if they were more citizens of St. Denis, because I'm, I don't, I'm around St. Denis fairly often, but not, I don't know as well as Valentine, the people around Valentine, obviously. But I couldn't tell you if they particularly were speaking to one person over another at Pearlie's. Dusk? Yeah, I have a question for you, actually. So, um, mm -hmm. <clears throat> so you said that uh after pearlie's you went to meet up was it with isaac uh so that well, well, i was i was coming back to valentine with phoenix he uh he got a telegram i think or something it was and had to get head off so then i bumped into isaac uh on my way to valentine near the oil fields and then we sort of like came back together to uh, Valentine. So you went with, so you bumped into Isaac near the oil fields. What was he doing there? Was he just in passing? Uh, yeah, I think he, uh, he, he being with uh, Zeke and Cora. And uh, he was out hunting just a little bit by himself after they went off. They, I think they went off to Blackwater, maybe to play some blackjack. They wanted to continue. They, they basically were the ones we were playing at the Bastion, uh, and they'd won a lot of money off me and Isaac. I think they wanted to continue their winning streak, so they went to do Blackjack at Blackwater because they usually have good luck there. I mean, like uh, Isaac won, not Isaac, sorry, uh, Zeke won a thousand dollars off that table alone um, the previous day. 
Um, I see. Dusk, I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to leave you with him. I'm just going to uh, just read this report a little bit. Huh? Okay. Uh, okay, so you said that there was three or four people at Pearly's already. Mm. Is that including yeah. Pearly? Uh, that's not including Pearly. I think there was three, maybe four uh, patrons, and then there was Pearly behind the bar. Was um, Trix there as well? No, she wasn't there. Um, but uh, Pearly talked about her. Otherwise, I would have just apologized to her there. I didn't realize I upset the girl. I thought we were just having a bit of banter. I see. So it was you, Pearly, Phoenix, yeah. and three or four others that you did not recognize. Yeah, I mean, to be honest, like obviously uh, at that time, Isaac and Zeke and Cora were with me for a little bit. So they came in with me. So we popped with those three. Zeke as, well, as in Ezekiel, right? Yes. Yeah, uh, just, just make sure you keep you update regular. Mm -hmm. All right, continue. Sorry, go ahead. Uh, okay, so Mr. Delaney, mm -hmm. when uh, when Phoenix got a telegram uh, from Valentine, no, um, no, it was at uh, Benedict Point, just above you know where uh, Emerald Ranch is. Emerald Ranch. I think it's Emerald Ranch, the one out near the Heartlands. Oh, he he got his telegram from Emerald uh, Emerald Ranch. From, well, yeah, it's, I think it's Ben. Is it Benedict Point? The, Benedict the Points station? is like way west. Oh no, sorry, that's way west. Sorry, I can't remember which one that's called. But you know the telegram station just literally north of Emerald Ranch. That one. I get that. I get them mixed up their names. All right, so he grabbed a telegram. He checked mm -hmm. his telegrams at the telegram mm -hmm. station just north of Emerald yeah. Ranch, and then mm -hmm. did he say anything to you? Uh, he just said that he got a telegram for somebody, so he had to head off and have a meeting, um, and he would catch me later in Valentine for a drink. I went to Valentine, hung out here for a little bit, and then, like I said, I didn't see him, uh, checked my telegrams, and Draven was quite upset, who works for me and his friend, and his friend, so we went up to Strawberry, and then spent some time up there, came back, and I went to sleep. So he didn't say anything to you about the telegram? No, no, I mean, uh, he seemed in a bit of a rush, so, you know, I just let him go and said, uh, obviously, he sent me a telegram, he wanted to meet up, I'll just see him in Valentine in a little bit. Did he seem like he was in danger? Mm, not that I would say so. I mean, he seemed pretty much his normal self. Uh, just seemed to be catching up with people because he'd been out of state, he said, for a while, so I was, that's why I, I offered to, you know, have a drink with him at Valentine so we could catch up properly. Okay. Uh... And you said your relationship with Phoenix has always been friendly? Yeah, yeah, no, it's, uh, I can't think of anything that I've ever had a reason or concern to not be friendly with him. Like, he's been fine with me, I've been fine with him. We don't spend a huge amount of time together, but it's more of, uh, we used to hang out in the same spots a lot. Like I said, the, uh, Saloon and Valentine when it was the Queen of Cups under Tilly and stuff like that, he used to be around a lot then. So the only reason you uh, saw him yesterday was because of the same thing, just seeing him in the same places that you Oh, yeah, it was just we, but, but I, saw, I saw him briefly in the Bastion, like I said, but I was playing poker at the time, so I wasn't sure if it was him. And then I bumped into him at Pearly's, because after we finished at the Bastion, we went to Pearly's just to have a drink there and see her, so it was about the same thing. All right. Uh, when he took off from Emerald Ranch, what direction did he go in? Uh, I wasn't really paying attention, but I think it was like northwards. All right, let me uh, let me talk to Boyd real fast, and then mm -hmm. um, I'll come back. Okay. Do you want to talk to him real fast? I'm gonna update. Oh, um, I'm gonna lay my head down. Do you two need anything? Uh. No. uh. No, I'm good. Thank you. Yeah. Good luck. All right. Um, what'd you get from him? Okay. You want to talk outside real fast or you want to talk here? Uh, we can talk here. Just keep your voice down. Okay. Uh, well, so they were in St. Denis. They were playing poker. He ran into them at the Bastille. Then after that, they went to Pearlie's. There was about three or four people that he didn't recognize at Pearlie's. Uh, there was also Phoenix, Pearlie, and uh, Delaney. So a total of about six people, seven people in Pearlies at the time. After that, uh, they were gonna head back to Valentine. Uh, and then on the way, it seems like they checked their telegrams in Emerald Ranch, which is where Phoenix split from him. He believes that Phoenix went north when he left Emerald Ranch. 
Uh, after that, so Dwayne, so Phoenix so Phoenix left with him. Phoenix left with him. Yeah. So they left right. Pearlie's together. They were on their way back to yep. Valentine. They stopped yep. by Emerald Ranch, checked their telegrams. Phoenix yep. said he had to go in a rush. He uh, Delaney thinks he went north out of uh, Emerald Ranch. And then okay. uh, Delaney was heading back to Valentine, ran into Isaac. Uh, Isaac was with Zeke and Kitty. And then they came back to Valentine for a bit. Then they went to Strawberry for a bit. Um, and that's all I got so far. Okay. Uh, write that down. I'll... Uh Okay, just, yeah, get that all in order. Yeah. I'm just going to read the rest of this report, then I'll ask some more questions. Okay. All right, be right with you, Delaney. All right, mate. No rush. So um, let me just get this straight. So when when you left Saint Denis, uh, you ran into Ezekiel and the rest of the group outside of Saint Denis. No, no, no. I ran into I, I didn't see Ezekiel and Cora till uh, Valentine, um, and they came back from Blackwater. So you didn't see Ezekiel and, and uh, Cora in Saint Denis. Uh, like I said, they came to Saint Denis with me beforehand. Uh, they left uh, with Isaac before I left. I was talking to Phoenix. Did they go into the Pearl? Yeah, they came into the Pearl with me. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Isaac is my brother, and Ezekiel and Cora worked for me in our family. All right, so so Cora, Isaac, Ezekiel, yourself, go into this, uh, go into Pearls. Yep. They leave. Mm -hmm. Then you leave with uh, Phoenix, right? Yes. And then you run into them on the way to Valentine. No, no, I run into Isaac just outside of Valentine, and I run into Ezekiel and Cora in Valentine. Uh, is Isaac, Ezekiel, or Cora around right now? They're, they're all three of them are in the saloon, I think. They were literally just in it right before you pulled me out of the saloon. All right. Uh... Yeah. All right, so... It's a little bit of a issue, I'm... Trying to put the pieces together because he says they left before him, right? Yeah. Ezekiel and Cora. Uh, but in Rabbit's report, it says they'd left together, I think. The, it, it doesn't say together, but it, it, I interpret it as that. So I, I think we have to talk to the other well, three and just see how their stories line up. Boy, come here. His statement about where Cora and Ezekiel are uh, it didn't add up with what he just told you because he told me that he ran into Isaac in the oil fields and that Isaac had previously been with Cora and uh, Zeke. All 
right. So, but it seems like they came from a different direction. Or maybe uh, Isaac had left Zeke in, in them in Valentine and then went to the oil fields and then went back to Valentine. I don't know. The places of people just seems odd. Oh, Monroe's here. Thank God. Oh, thank fucking God. Uh, Monroe. Monroe, how you doing? Uh, before you close that, could I have a word with you for a second? I'm gonna leave you with Delaney. I'm gonna, uh, me and Munro are gonna grab a couple of other people. We're gonna grab Ezekiel and maybe Isaac and question them and see if the stories line up, okay? Yeah, that's fine.
Tabitha? Sorry, Mr. Delaney. I'll be right with you. Hey. Now you? Good. How are you doing? Doing all right. Are you, um, are you working this, uh, Phoenix case? I have no idea what you're talking about. I just woke up. Okay. I'll get caught up in a minute. All right. All right, Mr. Oh. Delaney. Oh, oh. Mm-hmm. Is she Ooh. okay? Uh, I don't know what happened there. Sorry, see you again. The door's like... I I'm not sure. Okay, well, I'm just gonna here? assume she's alright. Um, did you or any of your friends have any prior history with Phoenix? Oh, my fucking... God damn it. God fucking damn it! <clears throat> Sorry, Mr. Delaney. Can you hear me? I, I, I can hear you now, yeah. yeah. Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, did you hear what I asked you, by any chance? No, so I didn't hear anything now. I could see, I could see your mouth moving, but I didn't hear anything. Oh, okay. So, um, uh, did you or any of your friends ha or associates ha ever have a prior history with Phoenix? No, no. My brother Isaac arrived uh, maybe two weeks ago, three weeks ago in the crossing. Um, I don't think he's ever met Phoenix before, and as far as I'm aware, Ezekiel and Cora have no, they're, they're again, reasonably new to the crossing, and don't have any previous uh, relation or meetings with Phoenix. You said Isaac arrived maybe two weeks ago? Uh, I'm probably closer to three. I can't quite remember now. You know, time goes quite quickly. Yeah, and your um, other friends didn't really have any affiliation with them. Uh, no. So uh, I, I've known them less time than Isaac being here. So maybe two weeks. Oh well, about two weeks for Ezekiel and a week for Cora. Did you ever have any, uh, let's see. Did you ever, uh, confess to a prior murder? Mm, well, I, con I confessed to, uh, self-defense that led to the death of a person. Oh, okay, it was a self-defense. Yes. What happened in that incident? Um, this is going back a while ago, but yeah, I'm I'm sorry, I just uh, no, I'm sorry, pretty sorry. new, um, so yeah. Uh, the person in question, her name was Vinny. We were very close at one point, but she had started to essentially uh, lose her mind, become irrational, uh, become paranoid on things. Uh, drew a weapon on me, and uh, in my self-defense of defending myself, uh, I killed her. So it was not my intention to ever kill her. How did you defend yourself? I honestly can't remember now. Um, I don't know if it's in the report, but I honestly, I think, I think it was with a gun. But it was uh, probably close to two months, if not maybe older than that. In my mind, anyway. But yeah, I confessed to the crime and. Uh, Served my time in the uh, Rhodes jail, I think it was. Okay. Uh. Hmm.
Do you know Sheriff Rabbit? I've met her in passing a couple of times. Um, I think I was introduced to her uh, by somebody in Armadillo uh, a few weeks ago. So I probably bumped into her before then um, in uh, in uh, Valentine or somewhere else. I don't. I can't say I know her particularly well. Did you see her yesterday, by any chance? I'm not aware of seeing her yesterday. No. So obviously, I gather she was in Pearlies. From I'm afraid I did overhear a little bit what Boyd was saying to you a moment ago in the back there. Yeah. But I, I didn't. Uh, I can't say that I actually clocked her properly in uh, in Pearlies at all, unfortunately. So otherwise, I would have said hi to her, but. I wasn't in there for very long, so. Mm. Do you have any idea why we're asking you questions? At a guess, I would say uh, something's happened to Phoenix. Um, I would presume something unsavory, so possibly he's either been missing for some time or he's turned up dead. Do you know... Do you know anyone that would have an issue with Phoenix? I know a lot of people that had issues with phoenixes. I mean, I can't really think of anyone off the top of my head, but I knew just over the course of the months, I knew Phoenix in the Crossing. I know that he was an ex-lawman, um, that he, quite a few of the law staff didn't particularly trust him or like him. I know that uh, other people didn't seem to trust him. Um, he was usually an outcast in a lot of societies. I know he ran with Annabelle for some time and then stopped... He was actually going out with Annabelle for some time and then stopped as well. Um, yeah, there's a lot of people that had problems with him. I wouldn't say to the point of wanting to do any harm to him, but he wasn't the most liked person. I know he was also thrown out the ranges as well, so I presume, you know. But like I said I had I never had anything personal against him myself. Uh, do you have any names specifically other than just Law because he was ex-Law no, in Annabelle? No, no, no. Um, unfortunately, not. The, way, the way it is, is a lot of people would speak badly of him behind his back. And uh, I was told several times, months ago this is now, I was told several times by people not to trust Phoenix. Um, but other than that, you know, I, I, I like nothing that stands out to me that I would say like, know definitely have a word with this person because they were going on about phoenix or anything like that and because he'd been not in the crossing for so long i would not heard anyone talk about phoenix probably for the last month easily Okay, you said that people warned you not to trust Phoenix. Is there a reason why? Or do you remember who told you Just, that? Just, uh, the only person I can remember by name is, uh, Ronnie. Please kill him. Um, who was related to Solomon Walker. Um, that's the only one I remember off the top of my head. Uh, and that was ages and ages ago. Um, when I used to work for Solomon. Um, other than that, you know people just seem to have a, not the best of opinions of him but certainly not like a violent opinion of him or anything like that is there a reason why Ronnie wouldn't trust Phoenix not that I'm aware of it was just a general I think it was to do maybe with being ex-law I don't know but uh, that's just a guess really like I said it, the comment was made to me probably close to three months ago now All right, so probably uh, there isn't still a, uh, any kind of maybe 
distrust there because he's been gone for so long? No, I, I mean, like I said, I, I didn't really see him that much or talk to him that much. He didn't move in the same sort of social circles of friends that I did. So I never really had any reason to avoid him or to uh, not trust him anything. And like I said, I hadn't seen him so long that, you know, as far as I was concerned, I didn't have any problems with him. So I was happy to catch up and spend a bit of time with him. Just as a just as a friendly thing. All right, let me uh, let me see if I can find Boyd and see if he has any more questions for you. I think it's just come oh, in, so okay. there you go. What are you looking at? What? Do I have eyebrows? Yes, you have <laughs> eyebrows. <laughs> Why are you staring at me like that? Oh, you know, I'm just a little on edge. Uh, someone was killing a cow outside. Oh, was that? I heard the cow noises, but I didn't see what was going on. Yeah, wild cow. Uh, I also just like to point out we're all matching in our race coats uh, yeah. choices here, which is quite nice. Yeah. Boyd likes yeah. to copy me. Mm -hmm. Sorry, carry on, mate. Um, just just to reiterate, when you're mm -hmm. at the uh, when you're at Pearlie's, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, and Ezekiel was there at Pearlie's with you. Uh, for, sure, for a very brief amount of time, yeah. They left. They they left while you're inside Pearlie's, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. So uh, you stayed in Pearlie's, and uh, they left without you. No, I I'd not. I I popped out just have a word with Cora because she wanted to just let me know they were going to go over to Black uh, Blackwater, um, okay. and then I went back into Pearlie's. And did did uh, Delaney join you out there? What uh, my brother Isaac? You mean? Oh, sorry, uh, not not your brother Isaac. Uh, did uh, Phoenix join you outside, sir? No, no, he was inside. He was at the uh, he was at the bar. Interesting. Alright. Yes, sir. Wait, so you popped out to have a word with Cora, then you went back in to meet Phoenix so that you could go to Emerald Branch, right? Uh, I'd already gone into Pearlie's, uh, chat to Phoenix a little bit, chat to Pearlie, uh, popped out just to have a word with Cora, uh, or just to, just Cora wanted to have a word with me, I can't remember which way it was around. Um, so, so, spoke to her quickly, and then uh, popped back in and continued my conversation with Phoenix, and then uh, said if he wanted to come to uh, Valentine to have a drink and a bit more of a chat properly. Because I, I obviously hadn't seen... Um, we hadn't seen the fact, well, some of the changes and some of the things I was doing at the saloon, the red line there. And then both of you left uh, Pearly's together, went to Emerald Ranch to check your telegrams. Uh, well, he asked about checking telegrams, and that seemed uh, because we were taking sort of like a scenic route back to Valentine. That seemed the best one to stop at. Was there a reason you two were taking the scenic route? It's just we haven't seen each other for a while. We weren't in a particular rush. You know, we didn't. He didn't seem to have anywhere in particular you need to get to straight away, and I certainly didn't that day. And when you guys were uh, going from Pearlie's to Valentine, just to clarify, mm -hmm. I know it's already been asked. It was just you and Phoenix. Yes, it was. All right. So from Pearlie's to Emerald Ranch, it was just you and Phoenix, and then mm -hmm. he split off. He went probably north. Then you went. Yeah. To Valentine, which is why you crossed over the oil fields, which is where you mm -hmm. ran into Isaac, who had yeah. just left Cora and Zeke, and Cora and Zeke went to Blackwater to play blackjack, and you went to Strawberry with Kitty and Isaac because uh, someone's... And Ezekiel and Gilles Cora and Draven and Danny. And Draven and Danny. For fuck's Dan. sake, you got a whole yeah. goddamn entourage, don't you? Yeah, well, uh, there's quite a lot of staff, so we sort of go out together at times. Like, everybody seemed to want to go to Strawberry, so I went to Strawberry. Kitty right. had just gotten uh, up. So when, uh, so when he, when you got to Emerald Ranch with mm -hmm. Phoenix, uh, he checked his telegrams, correct? Yes. 
And then after he checked his telegrams, he said he had to go and he headed north? Uh, I think so, yeah. Like I said, I didn't really pay attention to which direction okay. he went off because I obviously just said, to, you know, uh, send me another telegram if you want to meet up or pop into Valentine, I'll probably be there. Okay. Uh, besides you and Phoenix, awkward. who else was there at Emerald that can... Uh... That, that can corroborate we didn't uh, really go know. through Emerald. We sort of like skirted around it to just get straight to the telegram station because it's the telegram station. Sorry, say that again. Oh. <laughs> what? What? Are you I okay? Want, I, just I just wanted to get that out there, okay? Was... Is that the word you've been trying to think of for a while? That feels like corroborate. you've been trying to think of a word for a while. Yeah, co and then co it... co co corroborate. Corroborate, corroborate, yeah. corroborate your story. Corroborate. Yeah. Who else was at Emerald? <laughs> <laughs> uh, not, not anyone. I, I didn't see anyone. Like I said, we kind of went round it and just went straight to the telegram station. So it's just you and him. Yeah, as far as I'm aware, I didn't really look to see if anyone was in there. We'll, we weren't planning to stop there. I forgot how much I, mean, I missed honest, doing I've detective shit chat. The outlaws are using Emerald uh, Ranch, so I've been avoiding it. Okay, and then you went from Emerald back here to Valentine, and that's when. Yes. Uh, your brother and Ezekiel and Cor all showed up a little bit after that? Uh, no, like I said, I, I bumped into Isaac first. Uh, Cor and Zeke were quite a bit afterwards. I, I only saw them in okay. Valentine. All right. <clears throat> okay. I think, uh, unless anyone here has any other questions. Why did you Why did you go to Emerald Ranch? We didn't go to Emerald Ranch. That was just, uh, he wanted to check telegrams. And that yeah, for Epsi. And there was telegrams from where we were at the time. Well, where were you at the time? We were leaving St. Denis and we were sort of like just taking a, I was just sort of generally taking a lazy route back towards Valentine. And he was riding with you from St. Denis to... No, he was, on, he was on the back of my horse at the time and then he whistled for his horse at the telegram station. Okay, well, your handsome it? button. You endorse. Yeah, he was the last one to see him alive, and he has a prior, I think, with a cleaver, but he said in his report that it was a gun that he used to defend himself. I think about a month. What? Yep. In his prior incident, you know how he was, uh... He, conf he confessed to using self-defense against Vinny? Right. They said in that report that he used, uh, what weapon? Tomahawk. Right. In that report, he used a tomahawk, apparently, right? But to okay. me, when I asked him, he said he used a gun, but he doesn't remember. Mm. Well, we talked to Ezekiel, and his story lines up with uh, Delaney's, so I'm going to talk to Cora just to make sure. But it seems to be lining up. It might be Vinny that would use a cleaver. Kerrigan. What were you what were you wearing at the time? Uh pretty much this, I think. Because I've just been doing some business earlier in Valentine's, so I think I was still. This is what I normally wear when I'm running the saloon and stuff and organising events. Okay. Uh, when you see pretty much this, I mean, mm -hmm. you have a coat. Yes. You have a flat cap. Uh, I do wear a flat cap sometimes. Yeah. Where I've is this coat? I've got a top hat, but uh, the coat is uh, hanging up in the saloon. As when was that? Hat. The coat you were wearing at Emerald Ranch. Um. If I was wearing a coat, yeah, it would have been that same coat. Was this the same or similar outfit? It, I think this was this outfit. Okay. Um, can I take a look at that coat? Yeah, yeah, of course. We'll have to walk over to the saloon, that's all right. Yeah, that'll be fine. I don't suppose I could get my weapons back first, or...? No. Okay. As long as they don't get lost this time, I don't mind. What the hell? Yeah. 
He just walked out. Yeah, he did. Ma'am? In this coat. You mean just handing me the coat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me a moment. Alrighty. There you go. There you are. Uh, four fifty. Thank you very much. Of course. I'll mm -hmm. be away for mm -hmm. a little okay. bit. Okay. All right. I need some catching up to do. Alright. No Did you want to check the the hat at all? Or? Uh, sure. Right, one second. Mm-hmm. Come here. There you go. Can you check for hair on the coat and also check his gloves? This many interrogations. Okay, Thank uh, you. this this is the coat hanging up, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mind if I just grab my right there? Sorry, we just just give us a minute. Right. Just show a black hair, okay? Yeah, yeah. What? It doesn't and show up much because of the black coat, but which is why okay, I wear them mainly. Then you're you no, just, well. just, uh, yeah. just yeah. sorry, I didn't quite hear that. Oh, your gloves. Hell, just pay, place your you're palms out flat. Yeah, yeah. Hey, you're speaking in my right ear. <laughs> oh, is that what it is? Is it? Oh, I think your fucking ear changes. Yeah. No, it's always my right is my good one. My you left is, is my bad one. Oh, you just got selective hearing then. Uh, okay. No. All right. I don't After think you did it. Billy Joe went and. I think he maybe that, maybe okay. he knows we'll about go back it. To the office and then we'll. Oh, uh, it's never came back. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Yeah, I oh, know. But maybe you changed. Go on about it. I mean, it pops every <laughs> now and then, but. And I hmm. hear very little, but most of it. Usually, the last person that sees them, though. <laughs> but I think it's also perfectly reasonable See, to someone really be I like, "Oh, gotta go," yeah, and not say not anything. Matter, honestly. You acting like this on purpose? Have to Could be covering for someone. To be. I was about to try over the door I myself, then, which has been a bit yeah. useless. Mm-hmm. Let me turn down my AC. Uh, do you know who has your weapons? Uh, I think Boyd might take. Yeah, Boyd took them off me uh, before we came in. I just take a seat for a minute. Oh, 100%. Uh, just come here. Yes, sir. 100%, Fripsy. Um, I, I think we could probably go down to Emerald Ranch, have a look, see if there's anybody around there that might have witnessed it. And, uh. I mean, he was the last person to see him. But there's not much else I can go on. Yeah, the only thing he said is that he sped off north. Yeah, yeah. They rode out of town both on one horse. Apparently, Phoenix called his horse Emerald Ranch. I thought I was going to be able to catch him out there. But if it didn't work. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll have to let him go for now. Okay. Is Boyd? Where's Boyd? I think he was talking to his friends. He's got friends. <laughs> not Boyd. Not ta he's talking to Delaney's friends. Oh, okay. Hold on, you're trying to turn down the AC. 
Just give us a minute, Delaney. All right, mate. Uh, Where is he? Uh, oh, last okay. time I saw him, he was. He's in, there. Where? I see him. I see. Basically made this whole joke to this guy who came in, this uh, doctor guy. Um, mm -hmm. He didn't know where he was, and so we said that it was the red line, um, and Pearlie was kind of pissed off about that. Hmm. Um, so we were joking about that with him, but honestly, I don't remember too much. I know Isaac had a, a bit of a dizzy spell when he was in there, so I was just making sure he was okay. Um, and then we went to Blackwater and played some Blackjack. Okay, so after after Pearlie's, uh, you, who'd you leave with? to go play blackjack in uh, Blackwater. I left with Ezekiel. I'm not too sure where the other two went. So Isaac stayed behind with Delaney? I don't know if he stayed with Delaney or if he went his own way. Um, I just left with Ezekiel. We went to Blackwater. Okay. And uh, after Blackwater, where'd you go after that? Um... Well, I would say that we stayed in Blackwater for maybe a couple of hours, and then we came back to Valentine, um, and we saw everyone here. You know, chat, I kind of want to start using, like, an actual notebook. Like, I was kind of doing, I was kind of doing it, right, for the report, but then I just put the questioning into the report anyways. But I kind of want to, like, start but using, like, a notebook. I telegrams or anything to know where the other And then, were. like, putting all of, like, the... Ezekiel was too busy losing money. Line of questioning and shit into a you notebook. You were there for an hour to play blackjack. Maybe a couple of hours. I like how really keeping track what of time. he's doing and like actually so using a notebook for it. And then black, like if uh, I get sorry, robbed, the then around. they get what like. Time do you think? Um, then people could get like just uh, case notes this. or like interview notes and mm. shit because I feel like uh, you know I would realistically Maybe keep a notebook ten, on me ten? for stuff like that. Because I right. think it could be, like, interesting. But, like, you know, you don't want people to know the case. Right, but, like, you, say uh, they, like, someone takes it, they can find it. Do you remember seeing anyone named Phoenix? Angel, thank you so much for the two months. I honestly don't even know the name. All right. All right. Well, uh, appreciate your time. Yeah, of course. You, can, uh, you have a lovely day. Because I feel, like, Continue realistically, if you're, like, no, a detective no, back then, he's, right? He's you you would put, take back. notes down in, like, a notebook. He's still in the office. Oh, he's still in the office. Oh, okay. That right. you would keep on you. Have a lovely day, man. For any time this would come up, right? And it's not like you would change it out. I might start doing that. Uh, did All we? Right. Did we? Uh, did anybody go and check Window Rock? Yeah, we've been. I, I went up there. I was at the scene of the crime. And the fucking was blood There was no. Was there a weapon found? <laughs> no. So what? What I? What we found was um, three sets of uh, boot prints. Uh, blood prints inside the house. Uh, two pairs of boot prints leave in the house, and uh, three sets of hoof prints coming and going. Oh, wood, right? Because you have to copy Jeez. paste it. Okay. Yeah, okay. So try, to, try, uh, try and work that out. Uh, we also you... found a white horse hair on uh, on his body. Hey. All right. Well, okay. Black hair. I Believe, and uh, Wait, Delaney, maybe yeah, a hatchet or a tomahawk was used as the uh, murder weapons. Okay, uh, Delaney has a previous case a long time ago with someone named Vinny. Uh, there's reports of a tomahawk or a cleaver being used in that incident. I'm not too sure which one, if he used it with self defense or if Vinny used it and he defended himself. He doesn't remember exactly how he defended himself, which I find a bit odd. How do you forget? He thinks that he used a gun. I would check his horse also. I would check his boots because we did not look at his boots. I did look at his boots. No, no blood. No blood? Uh, we checked his coat. We checked his hat for blood, for yeah. anything. Gloves. Yeah. Mm. Their stories line up. Their stories do line up. Yeah. I think it's... I fi we need to figure out who sent him that telegram. Yeah. Is there a way to find that out? I might be able to see if I can have a look. I, I very much doubt it, though. It's worth a try. 
I can certainly try. That telegram is who fucking killed him, obviously. I think that's a uh, that would be even, our. Even if you can't read the telegram, is there a way that we can talk to the telegram company and see if there was even a telegram sent? Perhaps. Just a time. Just a time. Would help. Yeah. The the. Let me let me see if I can dig into that. Or like a recipient right. or something. Yeah, if we can get a time when a, a telegram was sent, we might be able to work out when he received it and all that. All yeah. right. Uh, Let's go. Well, I guess we, we we cut him loose for now. All right, I'll, we'll cut him. I'll cut him loose. I'll give him his stuff back. And then we can we can. I was thinking Emerald Ranch. Um, see if there's anybody around there that might have been around at the time. Yeah. You know. Uh, it, it probably would, Fripsy, because I don't think the copy-paste works really well with the notebooks, but what I might work is back, if I write back. it in a Google, 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 if I write it in a Google Doc, and then I copy-paste what I put in the Google Doc, fuck, you can't copy-paste into the notes, can you? I don't think the notebook has copy-paste shit, but I think you can copy-paste into the I'll, uh, uh, filing system. Back out here. All right, thank you, You're right, it would be really hard. Fuck, dude. I kind of want to take the time to do it, though. I feel like it would just add so much. Maybe nothing at all, but maybe it would add a, m a lot, you know? And uh, next time, send me a telegram, and we'll make sure to color coordinate ourselves, our outfits all together better. Oh, God. <laughs> Don't mention that. Like, uh, we, we got fairly close without trying, so I think we've just a little bit of work. You just need a red tie, sir. You know what? I do sometimes wear red. Um, I've got actually a red top hat that used to be with my dad's, but I don't wear that so much now. Boy, this is what you get for copying my outfits. I, I need, I'm gonna get some water. All right, Wait, thank you very much. Too. Thank you, Mr. Delaney. That's I appreciate right. you taking the time to talk to us. No, that's all right. Pop in and get a free drink on my on on me if you want to, guys. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, I'll probably experiment with it. See how it goes. <sighs> Fuck me. Well. That was something. Good job in there, by the way. I, uh... Yeah, okay. <laughs> Hog in the fucking water and barrel. Hog in the... Okay. That, get that fell off that roof, will you? No, you get the fell off the roof. Fine. Sir, can you get off the roof, please? An announce yourself. Announce yourself. He's getting off. All right, good. Hi. Hi. How's it going? It's it's going fine. How are you doing? I am okay. Oh, uh, I was just daydreaming, so. Oh, yeah. I see. Uh, yeah, maybe uh, you know, uh, just stare into the, the sky somewhere else. But there was a little mouse-looking thing, so it chased me up there, and then I had to sit down and wait it out. All right, what's your name? My name's Twitch. Porch. Twitch. Twitch Cooper. Twitch Cooper. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, it's very nice to meet you, sir. Uh, Deputy Audrey Dusk. Why did you laugh, Boyd? I don't know. I don't know why either. Funny I laugh because you laugh. It's a funny name. It is it's a funny, funny name. Well, if uh, if he got a telegram to meet someone, he felt comfortable enough to go by himself, which is interesting. I don't think it's one of the uh, groups of people that uh, that rabbit rode down. Man, the Kenelman gang must be pissed. Why? Why? 
Uh, looks at all those beautiful guns. Shit. Oh! They have many good ones in the next auction. Yeah, they, there's one called Black Dog. Oh, it's a com completely customized navy. It's black. Who, it's nice. Who, who, belonged, who that belongs to? Sloan, and Sloan. I won't buy it in the next auction. Uh, you, you think you will. Yeah, maybe I, I will. I mean, yeah, yeah, sure, if you want. No, maybe I will. Not to give it to her or anything. Wait, what? Why, why, would, you, you why would you say that? Why would you say that? Like, that say what? Why, why would you so say that? As a gift? Oh, boy. She's my friend, right? I think. Oh, is she, is she my friend? She, oh, boy. She, is she that, tried to fucking murder a bunch uh, of deputies. No, no, uh, she, uh, uh. uh <laughs> Just have a real good think about your next words. I'm not lollipopping with Sloan, even though she asked me all the time, sir. That was that's he had a really hard think, and that's the best you could come up with. Yeah, that's that's. Uh, that's just, I have to. So I worse. have to she end our friendship. So worse. I just, have to end our friendship. With Sloan? What? You have what? You have a friendship with Sloan? No, not really. I wouldn't call it that. I don't really know if I want to get too much into it. Now I feel like it's kind of important that you tell us some details, because if not, it looks really well, bad. Well, er, uh, yesterday I had to drink breast titty milk. I'm very sorry. My brain Wait, is... Wait, what? I get that. Yeah. yeah. Wait, Wait, Weller what? just stood there and he, he wanted me to do it. Talk about it. Okay, Wait, you no. made me do it, Weller. Oh. I made you do. Fuck? You made me drink oh the milk, my God. and then that we had to. Uh, and then you laughed at me while I threw up in the street. Are you serious? Yes, sir. You what the hell? All right, sir, she's on. Who's, she's just who? talking pure shit. She was throwing up. Every Look, this fella. <sighs> I don't know. He was like a newspaper boy or something. Came up and gave her like lollies, and then she drank milk or something that he gave her, and then it turned right. out it was his mother's breast milk, and then she started throwing up everywhere. I almost started throwing up. <laughs> <laughs> I felt so bad for you. Promise never to speak of it again. Sirpot, Sirpot, Sirpot. She fucking brings it up. I, I do not understand. Have, have you had your coffee this morning, Dusk? Because you are not making I, any sense. Uh, I think we should go know, back to her friendship with uh, no, known felons. What the void? Okay. He's known to so, aid and abet major criminals. And absolutely not. I would never okay. aid and abet. Okay, yeah, she's a criminal. Uh, I, I'm not. We are never doing. Tell me about the old, the old girl gang. Oh yeah, I so I'm starting a dossier on the the bouquet. It's a group okay. of uh, female criminals. It's a girl gang. Uh, Precious Cargo, Holly Hawk, and a third one. Cor Cor Cora. Was, yeah. Oh yeah, they stole Malone's pump, didn't they? Yep. No, they stole my pump. Ooh. They also stole uh, guns off Khan's last night. Khan's. And oh, left really? a little flower in his holster. Yeah. Yep, the bouquet. So just just before we deviate too far, dusk. Yes, sir. Buying a, buying a DNR weapon at the auction and giving it back to the criminal it belongs to is not going to happen. No, I wouldn't do. I would I would keep it okay, for myself God. and then I would show her the fact that it's mine now. And then you'll get robbed with intent. Oh, well, okay. yeah, you'd Maybe. probably be exposing yourself to to danger there. <laughs> Never mind. I I thought it would be funny to like be like, haha, it's it's mine now. But you know, you're probably right. Look, I'm 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 all for antagonizing crims, but that's just plain stupid. Okay, I won't. You know what? I'm not gonna even. You know, I don't even have enough money to buy that gun anyways. I don't want it. I was just saying that to see what everyone would say. Did you that's get the reaction sentence. you wanted? Yep. Hey, I think we should go to Emerald Ranch. Yeah, good idea. Lead the way. Slow in there. No, Weller. She just clicked her teeth. <laughs> she does that. I did tell Jack Kettleman that I was gonna steal his girlfriend, though. Yeah, I want to see if there's any folk around we can have a chat to. Oh. Right here. You're right, Kerrigan. No. <laughs> <laughs> Lead the way. Yes, sir. Yeah, 
Anybody check the tip line recently? No. Maybe we should check before we go. Yeah, let's do that. I'll get Creamer to do it. Are what you, are you trying to get me in trouble, Void? No, you're trying to get yourself in trouble. What the <laughs> fuck are you doing? <laughs> Why are you talking about Sloan like she's your friend? What are you doing? Okay, I'm not allowed to be friends with criminals. And what do you mean lollipopping? I thought... What are you talking about? Why'd you bring that up for? Because she's been trying to ask me out on a date, Boyd. Okay, well, tell her fucking no that you don't I interested. did tell her no, Boyd. Where'd you, how? When'd you do that? In San Denis when I saw her yesterday. She was, you know... You saw her again yesterday? Yes, in front of the bank. And she was asking me, you know... Just, just tell her to fuck off. Yeah, well, I'll, she, tell, I'll tell her. I'll uh, tell her. Okay, well, she was trying, you know, she was trying to tell me that her and Jack were anything and she wanted to go on a date and all this, and I told her that I wasn't. <clears throat> all right, let's go. I'll fuck uh, off. <coughs> Never mind. <laughs> In this cave. Is it? Hey, how you doing? I don't know. I think it's kind of like. I think it's funny though. I hope it's not a bank. Roads, 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 roads. Come on, Graham, hurry up. Fucking read. I am gonna die. I'm about to die. Oh, I'm safe. Okay. Oh, thank you so much, Ben. What is it? Yeah, fuck it. Roads Bank. Oh my it's God! Really it's a bank. Somebody make sure they put a tip in. We're going to the bank robbery! So, somebody put a tip in to say we responded. Yep, I'll do that. You guys go on ahead. Alright, I'll meet you there. Let's get these fucking freshies into a bank robbery. Come on, boy! Why is he riding with a lantern on this horse? I'm not too sure. It's driving me crazy. Right, he's with us. Okay, let's go. Let's go! Boyd, Monroe wants you to take the lantern off your horse. Mine's not. I should wait for Boyd. Where the fuck is Creamer? I'm not too sure. Why well, should you think I should uh, ride my Fox Trotter today, sir? Yeah, I think you should. I think you should always ride. I'm waiting for Boyd.
Are you okay? My horse is sick. What do you mean is sick? I push him too hard. <laughs> I got too excited. But you're the one that taught me how to ride properly. I know I'm prettier than you. <laughs> Boyd, we're going to miss oh, my come first on. bank robbery. Let's get him. Come on. Come on. Let's get him. Together. Monroe wants me to ride my fox trotter all the time instead. <laughs> this fucking guy. I'll give him some fucking sugar cubes or something. Pirate man, step outside real quick. With a with a uh, slimy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, hey here, deputy. boy. It's just Hello. me letting you know I got a guy at gunpoint. There's another one inside. Oops. Come here. Okay, okay relax man, right? yourself. Just, just uh, step back inside. I'm not inside. in the business of relaxing. Well, okay? you're gonna be in the business of relaxing if you don't get the fuck back in the bank. If someone's dying today, it ain't just gonna be me, I'll let you know. And if somebody's dying today, if you kill that hostage, you're in fucking shit. I'm fucking relaxed, let me get off my horse. You want me to talk to him or you, you want to do it? Oh, I'm gonna well, talk to him. You're, right. uh, a you're second in charge, boy. Oh, yeah, you ain't cold. Okay, well, uh, sir, I'm thinking if they got a wagon, maybe we should get a wagon. I mean, you can do. Right. My name is Sheriff Logan Monroe. Ain't gonna worry about drinking once they got you in there. I also now need though. martial law as well, guys. Yep. Uh, yep. So, first of all, how many of Dusk. you are inside? Yes, sir. I mean, yeah, Boyd. Plenty of us in martial law. Folks, make sure, no, make sure yeah. I was on the street. Law enforcement officer, please remain inside a building. I want to know Thank how many you. people are inside. Want to get out of here? Fellas, three of them leave the town and get inside. Heard you the first time. Hey, you've got two hostages, you only showed me one. Let's go to the parlor. Nah, good idea. I'll, I'll take the carriage over. Yeah, you'll just get over there. Look like there's anyone else in town. I have to pee so fucking bad. This is the worst time. Ain't nobody gonna die. No, nobody needs to die. Nobody needs Boy. to get hurt. Where's Willa? Where's Willa? He's uh, telling the people to leave town. Um, firstly, I'm a sheriff. Of course there is. Uh, uh, well, I don't think I go to this well, you wanna, uh, I'm thinking we grab a uh, law wagon if they're going to be using one. Shit. Yeah, sure. You want to grab that? Yep. Look, I need to... Fuck. Who's on duty right now? Fuck. Now's not the time, Willa. <laughs> but it's always time to fuck, Kerrigan. Get your, what get the your hell? Fucking, get your mind on the prize. Oh, God. Who are you to, fucking, Weller? In this Look, wagon. how many of them are in there? They, he's claiming that you want dead hostage. Three oh, it's all yours. You can, you, you're welcome to it. I have no interest yeah, in this wagon. Son of a bitch, and there's only seven of us. All right. Uh, so we can't do nothing. We're here now. That's it. Well, actually, there's over seven. Let me give these guys over to you. What are your plans after that? Go wait for us to turn ourselves in. I have to pee. I have to pee so bad. I'm going to pee really fast. What's going to happen, deputy? What's going to happen? I'll, I'll tell you what, what usually happens is that we will, uh, we will 
Be right behind you and we will instruct you to stop. And that's how it normally is. You'll get a warning. If you don't stop, whatever that warning is, you will receive. I don't like I don't like coded language. You're gonna shoot me, motherfucker. Tell me you're gonna you shoot. You understand. Me. You understand you're robbing a bank. You're holding weapons at innocent people. And you want me to take it fucking easy. Sure, you want me to lay not? on my back, do you? You wanna you wanna come and give me some tummy scratches as well? Did I miss it? You got a family and kids. Luckily no. Woo! Woo! Got any I'm one? back. Anyone that will warn you, your death, if you were to part from this world today. You're only threatening me with a good time, son. Oh, shit, uh, I do not envy you at all. What about your three compadres out there, huh? Your pals, they, they probably got people they want to see. I'm sure they do. Done. I'm sure they do. Well, I but you're you gonna... Know, I don't think your lives are worth a couple bags of coin. It's just me being frank. Our lives are worth. For you is just to let us leave, and maybe you catch us later, huh? We are quite the rambunctious folk, us wise men. Really? I mean, you're inside a bank robbing it, and you're calling yourself not rambunctious. No, no, I'm telling you, we are rambunctious. Oh, you are. We okay. Damn right, we do. Is when you when you leave, I also want those two hostages. Yeah. No problem. Do you think they'll tell us their name if we ask? Yeah, I can ask. Give hey, what, what's what's your name? You're a fucking idiot. <laughs> think I tell you? Think it's gonna be that easy? Well, yeah, I do think that you tell us. We're three wise men. I'm wise men S. We got wise men B and C back there. S, B, and, just and make C. Sure, make sure yeah. you keep an eye on the horses. What horses are riding off and take note of what they're wearing. Oh, S, B, and S. S, B, S. Yes, wise man S, uh, two S's, and then there's a one way. How we do it? Give us a minute, deputy. You're not gonna give us gifts as you depart. Who else do we have? Yeah, your lives, motherfuckers. Uh, uh, so I'm gonna be sorting out the hostages. Oh, I see. It's more and movement. The bank. You guys are gonna be chasing hey, them, okay? Uh, so, like so they're now, gonna deputy. go on that carriage. They've also How got horses got as well. They've got horses as well. All right, I'm go okay, I'll be I've on, already I'll be told you. How many, uh, how many people we've got, and that, that's still no. the same. Yes, sir. Same Come here, you're gonna be riding shotgun with me in this wagon, okay? Okay. Right. Do they, are the hostages need food or water or anything? One of them needs water. That's okay, well, I've got... Problem. Gary, you're gonna be in his horse. Uh-huh. Right, make sure, since we're on the wagon, you give plenty deal. of verbal warnings before you shoot that horse, okay? Okay, I'll wait until you tell me to start hey. shooting. Nope. No! No! Dusk. No, this is on you. It's your call. Uh, okay. People aren't going to be around to babysit okay. or hold hands forever. All right? Okay. Uh, okay. So you're if. Struggling? Uh, just calm. All right. Take a deep breath. Just calm down. So it's when should hard. I start shooting them? Well, no get, did, you got trained, didn't you? <laughs> I mean, okay. Uh, if I feel like my life is about right, to be in danger right, stop, or. Stop. First thing yeah. you're going to want to do, right? We're riding the wagon. Let's say we're right behind it. Uh -huh. Saints Cross and Sheriff Department stop the wagon or will be forced to shoot the horse. Say that like three or four times, and if they don't comply, hell, fire a warning shot and then just unload into the horse. Okay. Should I, what if I shoot the wheels off the wagon instead of the horse? Is that... Mm, <laughs> like, that's a... They might take that as you trying to shoot them, and then they might unload on us. So it's always best to shoot the horse. Oh, okay. What if we're behind right, them and, and I can't the horse, see the horse? Carry on. All right, well, I don't know, Dust. This is on you. You're a deputy. Get out of the way, Mr. Okay, yes, sir. All right. You you make the calls. Everything's at the, uh, so, you know, uh, I mean, we trust you, our you deputies to go with their gut leaving, and do what's or right. Or okay. What we're doing. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. You got this. Well, well this is my first it's robbery. I know, and time. it's going to be great. Okay? It's going to be a wagon chase. And we're going to stop these fucking degenerates from taking things that aren't theirs. Yeah, these thieves. What is this lady doing on the side? No, I'm questioning the kids. Excuse lady. me, ma'am. Friends in there. Can you kindly get the fuck out of here? Big man in the dick. Hey, mind. don't know. Was Come back. She it's fucking taking it. Piss. No. I see. 
What did you say? Where you where, where, where are you where are you gonna be? Where's the after party? What did where she say we to your Weller? You? No, she was very angry. Oh. Is it because I said the fuck word? I don't know. I say the fuck word a lot. I just wanted to be commanding, you know, having the commanding presence. No, if you want to be commanding, you have to use a diaphragm. Into the desert, maybe. I said kindly get the fuck out of here. I feel like that's pretty commanding. Yeah, I mean, hey. I'm not telling you how to do your job. But I made a lot. Martial law. That's right. What does that mean? Please folks? kindly get the fuck out of here! Martial law is. It's a bank awesome. robbery. Get yeah. Eddie. It's a and bank get... robbery. Sir, can yeah, you explain to me absolutely. what martial law means? Hmm? Yeah, it means if you don't get out of town, I'm going yes, to drop kick you out, sir. Get moving. Well, I'm, you're, you're, aim, you're, you're aiming a weapon. Hello? So, you know, we put the Martial right law, fellas. Oh. Just a real quick. It means a crime's currently going on and you're going to have to Boyd? your own safety and the safety of us. Right. Yeah. We're doing like my first bank down. robbery together. Um, no, I don't trust you. Yes, we are. Yes, What's we are. What's there not to trust? Come on, fella. Well, I don't fancy getting shot in the face, all right? Cases! You know, us. I would never What's that, my, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a fucking you. teacher. You Look, and fella, I'm you don't have to explain you me, you but you, you're a new deputy. You don't bad bones for fellas you don't know. You can, you can tell me from yeah. there, son. I'm telling you from person. Who the fuck is this coming in? Who's coming? I was gonna tell you that I was gonna be at your mask. Who the hell's that? <laughs> you had to ruin the joke, didn't you? Huh? Well, I would have ruined it. What are you anyway. doing? Scaredy cat? Yes, I am. I'm good at jokes. Quickly, I have witnessed the, uh, something. Uh, mm, the sergeant, I witnessed the uh, kidnapping. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Okay, uh. Can you put well, it we, in anon right now, sir? Yeah, put it, put it in an anon. We, we're dealing with something right now, sir, where it's martial laws in effect. You're gonna have to Boy. move out of here. Go to the. To, yes. But there is a lady. She is. She said she, this. These men. The, the, the two of the men. They said uh, they had put her in a disguise. She was being stalked and she has been kidnapped. Okay, can you put it in an anon, sir, and get yeah. out of the area? A man has put it in an anon, but I need to tell you what I know. This is um. It's a he very bad distracting time. us. It's a very bad time. You're gonna have to come back in like ten minutes, sir. Boyd, can you ask Weller if you could uh, drive the wagon? What do I know about? I'm not driving the. Wagon. Wagon. Drive I'm getting on my horse. I don't get on that fucking wagon. It's a death <laughs> yeah, trap. No <laughs> so you're gonna let me die? No, as far I as I'm aware. He said that a wagon's a death trap, sir. Still alive, as far as I'm aware. Ain't nothing I'd rather be riding on than barefoot, How's my steed, but... Still alive. I... used it to my ears. I thought I killed them, I did. You thought you killed them? Yep, last time I saw half of the old two out of the three there, they were the gurgling blood. And so are you saying that, you know, you're a very dangerous man, is that... Can I even trust you with those hostages? No, I'm telling you, like a wolf, if you corner me, I'll bite. Motherfucker. Yeah, so these fellas obviously ain't. Uh, right now, I'm not quite the friendliest of friendlies if they're asking about deputies that they've almost Just make killed. Sure I keep having so options. keep that in mind during the pursuit. Yeah, like I said, don't split up in the chase. Done, There's right? only going to be We're three of you. Done. So stick together. If they split up, stick together. Chase one. You hearing that, Kerrigan? Look at them with their guns out. Because you're going to be on the horse. Thirsty animals. Hey, do that again. Do that again. Stand still right there. Right there. Don't move. Why? So I can shoot you. What the hell, sir? Yeah, just get I'm away from the windows. Did you hear that? Get away from the windows. If she's playing peekaboo, she's asking for it, okay? It's like you want me to shoot you, sir. What the hell, ma'am? Hello? Gave eight or nine warns and see I still got fucking complained against. Yeah, I, fucking worry I, about it. I gave fucking I gave bank. I gave three warnings yesterday to Speedy and Emmett and they it's still. It's How are we getting on? So they didn't hear me. What you got a date later tonight? Who? Uh, the impatient one. The one who keeps asking us if we're done yet. I mean, 
Are you having trouble in there? No. I just you having some my capabilities. You having some performance issues, sir? What's the what's the hostages' names? I know one of their names, but we're not on talking terms, you see. Well, I'm he can to... talk to me. Go on, you can tell them. I ain't gonna shoot you. Go ahead, uh, tell them. Jack Crow. Give for your little. Who? Say that again. Gabriel Adler. Who the fuck is All that? right. We're going to move out with both hostages. Okay? Brother. If we feel like there's any funny business going on, Dusk. first thing we do is shoot up. It's happening. What's your name again? Yeah, it's happening. Gabriel Adler. Yeah, this guy. We're going to shoot him first. Make sure you think of friendly when you get on the wagon. Yes, sir. <laughs> Alright, now the only issue we're gonna have, right? Mm -hmm. I'm probably gonna whistle for my horse to follow us. Because they can take that uh, carriage somewhere we can't. Alright. So I should whisper? Whistle? Okay. Just wait, let's see what they do. Oh. Did one of them just get ran down by the horse or was that a local? He got in the back of the wagon. <laughs> Sheriff, clear the road. Is this your first time? No, it's not. Dusk. Yes, sir. Don't antagonize. Oh, sorry. Go, 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 go. Saints Crossing Sheriff's Department! Stop the wagon right now! What do you want? You gotta stop your wagon and turn yourself in! Stop the wagon now! Saints Crossing Sheriff's Department! Stop the wagon now! Stop the wagon! If you keep from driving the wagon, I'm gonna have to kill your horse, sir! Oh god! Alright! Better stop now! Stop the oh, wagon! He, did he fall off the wagon? God damn it! Oh shit, where's my bandages? Holy shit. I got you. Woo! All right. Where's the other ones? All right. Other ones fled on horseback. Uh, uh, super son of a bitch. Stay sharp. Stay alert. Whew. All right. Anyone injured? No, sir. All right. Just a bit of a... bit of a bump to the back of the head, but I'll be okay. I got a little grazed, but it isn't bad. You know, we could just leave him here, feed him to the gators. No. All right, I yeah, just thought I'd ask. Where's the other one? How many are we down? Just this one? I so think there's two. Another there's, there's another two. one. Yeah. Yellow bandana. All right. All right, let's find that old and make sure his friend didn't get him. I tried to hit fire. Wait, what'd you say, Willem? I don't know. 
You guys said you down another one. I didn't down another one. I yeah, didn't. there's a man with the yellow bandana. He's down somewhere over here. Two, right? uh, okay, he, he fell in a bush right here. I think what uh, this fella did was he pretended to be down. Oh, he was the same guy. Yeah. Really? Are you sure? Because I sure? fucking him. Because I think there was one with the yellow bandana. Right? Uh, where was it? Why don't you ask him? Is he, is he when he's trying to fucking die? Did you get hit? Uh, no, not really. Nope, sorry. I don't see anyone else out here. Awesome play, did you? Hmm? Oh, that is. Does he have a yellow man in it? No, I think it's just the one. That's it. Hi, X car. All right. They think that it's just that guy. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe. Uh... Yeah. All right. Just the one. Just the one. All right. God damn it. What the fuck? Yeah, well, like the back of this wagon. Damn. I thought there was two. I'm going to turn around and get back on the bridge. You folks go first, or is this just gonna be a shit show? You just blocked the bridge. Yep. Ah! yep I'm reversing. Go ahead. My aiming is getting a little better, chat. When I was hip firing, it was a little harder, but when I was aiming down sights, it wasn't too bad. I think I just need to, if I, if I actually have to think about where I'm shooting with the hip fire. Headache. Uh oh. Mon Monroe had a headache. Uh, God damn it. Uh, I'll just wait. Uh, I'm gonna take this to the, uh, the wagon rental. Here, you could be on my horse. There. How are you doing there? Which one are you? The S, the B, or the S? Uh, the S. The S? You're about to find out why. What? What is that? Is that a threat, sir? Alright, Dusk, if you got slimy, just head on in. Oh, slimy! Yep. That's why you're the ass, huh? Oh, you know this fella, do you? No, I, I don't, do. but he does have a warrant. Come on. Let's oh. take him in. Alright. Slimy, slimy, slimy. What did you do? Besides rob the bank? I'll tell you where I buried it. All the treasure. Yeah. I, had, I got a good look at him when he tried to attack the, uh, the sheriff. He's wearing some stupid beard or something. It's worked uh, for months. You like just figure it out now. Uh, Kerrigan, can you uh, go to the telegram station and put up a bulletin for medic? Yep. Thank you. All right. I'll split it with you. All you're, of it. You're not. Give me half of your treasure. All of the treasure. Yes. 
Half, half. Really? Half for you, half for me to get out of here. Mm, how much is in this treasure? Enough for the both of us. All right, where's it buried? Uh, yeah, I'll lock the door. Just throw me in there. Thanks. Where is it buried, Slimy? I'm not gonna tell you until <laughs> I know I'm out of here. All right. Can't believe you people shot me. I didn't do anything. I was very what do you mean? I was shot. <laughs> I didn't shoot back. I put my hands up. I surrendered. Uh -huh. I said, please don't kill me. And you proceeded to try to kill me. Slimy, you almost killed my sheriff, sir. And I would have if it wasn't Holy for fuck. meddling Holy fuck. I don't deputies. think anyone responded to the Blackwater bank robbery. I don't think there's that many oh of us on duty. There is. There's fucking apes. Really? And no one responded? Yep. I got a patrol update. Oh wait, no, three deputies responded, thank god. Did, uh, so you just, you oh, admit sheriff. that you tried to kill my yeah, sheriff, I sir? Telegram to a medic. Yeah, yeah, uh, Kerrigan's doing it now. So <laughs> only three deputies what responded to What do you think that, motherfucker? Really? You just said, you said, and I would have got away with it too if it weren't for your meddling kids or something like that. What are you, okay, well. when I put my hands around his neck, I said, die, motherfucker, die. What the, what you said that to him? I screamed. How dare you? Him. How dare you? It's like, you want this gold? You shoot him in the head, and I'll show you it's not I will never gold. shoot my sheriff in the head, sir, and I can't believe you said die. Everyone has a price. 5,000 dineros. No, I will not take 5,000 dineros to shoot my sheriff in the head. I mean, you don't have is this bribery? No. This is bribery. Just, Do you, are you uh, hearing this, Sheriff? Yeah, it's, just a, it's just a like yes, John. It can't hear nothing. I'll deny it. No one's going to believe you're you. You're going to deny this? Yes, I'm whispering. Only you can hear me. That's why your name is Slimy. You know what happened to Molly? Why she's not a deputy anymore? Why is Molly not a deputy anymore? Because I gave her an offer that she shouldn't have refused. Okay. You, go, you want to now. You can put me in Sisica, but I have many contacts, okay? A lot of people I can talk to. Are you and threatening that, me? Oh, what? I gotta spit. Of course I am. I gotta spit it out for you. <laughs> are you, are you saying? Did you hear what he said? Yeah. Uh, uh, he caught one of the bank robbers. Uh, I still think I'm passed out. No, they've got they, no idea they, we're having a conversation. They don't think you're passed out. They know full well that you're talking to me and you're saying that okay. you're going to have people come out after Sissica and I kill me, sir. Crazy. I'm okay, not crazy. That's that's good. Uh, you heard of the man killers? Who? Man killers? Uh, no, yeah. we're good. We just, need, uh, <gasps> we just need a here. No, who are the man killers? They'll come find you. Yeah, uh, they'll be, it's bad. They'll be called the women killers. Bad to get soon. What? Just for you. No, that's the got their money. Let me get out. I'm not taking the money. Yeah. And if the man killers come after me, I'll kill them before they can kill me. Yeah, that's what they all say. Yeah, that's what they all say. Yeah, how many people have the man killers killed, huh? Do you have a list? Too long. Oh, really? No. Too long. So now you're telling me the man killers are murderers? You heard, of course, it's in the name. How do you smell? I gotta spell everything. No, you. okay, just I'm just saying, okay. We head off to. It's in the name, man. You think they? I know. Okay, so soul? I should put uh, warrants out for their arrest, all of them, so they get life in Sisica. Yeah, they don't have warrants. Huh. I got an idea. Do you have the names of the man killers, Slimy? If I tell you. Yeah. I want something out of it. Okay, what do you want out of it? Let me go home. Hell no, you are not going. Yeah, you're gonna go home to Sisica. Then I'm. Then these maniacs are gonna be on the loose forever. I'm actually gonna tell you. I know who they are. Okay. Two of them at least. What if I give you some time served? Will you tell me? Mm, depends on how much time it is. Hmm. A good enough amount of time, slimy. How good is that? 
We'll see when we add up all your charges. What do you mean, add up? <laughs> all I did was hit a blank. <laughs> I'm you had a, you have a warrant, slimy. Oh, jeez, boy! I didn't even have rounds in my gun. What the fuck are you doing, turd? <laughs> what? I didn't even. What are you have doing with your life, running around with a yellow straw beard? What have you done? You gonna start calling him turd? Are you my father, Pendel? He does. Yes, I yeah. am, and I'm very disappointed. Well, he's lying there. Take his weapons. Yes, sir. Don't you could have been something in life. You could have been I... a hard worker, but look at you. Oh, I boy. am. I'm hard working and ruining lives. That's just my business. And you're even failing at that, sir. You're just ruining your own. Uh, that's not true. I've been on the run for months now. You only found me today because I wanted you to. It's all part of my plan. Any place you're running, sir, is straight to Booty Island, where I hear that you're the number one favorite. They're very excited. They're throwing oh streamers up in the air right God. now, hearing that you're arriving. Void. That's, that's not true. I'm cutting it's very true. Out, okay? What is this? You good deputy, <gasps> bad deputy? You got a routine no. going on here? No. You think this is my first rodeo? <laughs> no, I am I'm very assured that you are very seasoned when it comes to Booty Island, sir. Trust me. I'm not assuming right. otherwise. Oh! Kerrigan? Yeah. Do you want me and Kerrigan to go, we'll head into Valentine, see who's there, and then we'll head up to Wallace Station Way? No one's responded to this. Uh, so I think it's just one of those times where everyone's Boyd, woken up and it's Are you really time. calling it Booty Island? Yes. Why? What's wrong with that? Why are you calling it Booty Island? Can you explain it to me in great detail? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Slimy's outside. How? How? Because, uh, headache. Uh, oh, never mind. Uh, Is this slimy? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you recognized him, Weller. Did you accidentally, uh... Fuck you, don't bring it up. <laughs> My life's over. <laughs> No, it's because he pressed F and yeah, respawned. Just me up and take me back. Oh, I haven't been around god. for a while, Come okay? On. Come on, you fucking... What oh the... Oh my god. Laugh it up, laugh it up. Oh. When I get out, I got a bullet for each of you. What oh, the oh hell? Oh my fucking god. Did Amazing. You, you well, uh, I think that might have something to do with the Blackwater Bank. Yeah, right. Okay, so... Well, now the doctors have taken your belongings, you Slimy. Turn. If you need any medical... Oh, my stuff. Uh, yeah. There's doctor in town. I had important stuff, too. <laughs> okay. Where's the doctor, friend? Oh, I have Slimy. Oh, you God. Things I've been holding on to for a long time. Gone. You know Lars or Bianca? Uh, no, but uh, I can have some help if needed. I'll just make sugar work and I give it to the other people. To my superiors. Uh, yeah, but who do you send those telegrams to? Are you endorsed by, you know, the health department yes, of St. Scrosby? Yes, I am working. Yeah, okay, sure. Come on in then, friend. Only if you need me, of course. Yeah, go in there, take a peek at him. Okay. Slime is still cuffed. Uh, okay. so. Slime, this fella's here is gonna take a look at your wounds. Pull that fucking beer down, would you? I, Hello. I'm gone. This, is, <laughs> this is a guy. This is a doctor you sent me. The guy had my gun to the whole time. Wait, he was your hostage? Yeah, it's just him. The German yeah. guy. Yep, all right. If, if, He's gonna kill me. You, 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 you're sending me to well, slaughter. Well, again, I guess. Yeah, that's just you. double paperwork, Slimy. What's she see? Are you if, okay? Hold on. If, okay, if you sent a telegram to doctors. Oh, okay. So, if you send a tender telegram to the doctors, there's gonna be a there's gonna be a doctor on their way. So I'd rather a doctor come here and treat him. Yeah, sure. He's a trainee. I was just gonna say, just in the meantime, he's oh, willing I'm to pack this. just to I'm maintain fine. him until the doctor arrives. What's, what's your name, trainee? I'm uh, Gabriel Adler. I am yeah, Larkin, a medical beautiful. trainee for the. Yeah, Larkin. Larkin, uh, Department of trainees in here. Right. Okay. Okay. Somebody needs to uh, rem remove her weapons, please. Oh. Yeah, trainee, come here. Dusk. Yes, sir. I got Can it. Can you remove her weapons? Yeah. Put your hands up. Oh, 
I just woke up. What's just going on? Touch uh, bank, two bank robberies here at the same time. Hands up. But there's, uh, there's, there's a lot of us here. Um, go with, go with Will. Head to Wallace yeah, Station. For some reason, I'm having issues taking. Wait, uh, uh, can you, can you grab it? I, for some reason, can't reach. Search this villain takes the longest. I'm scuffed. Fucking... What are you saying to me? Oh, what I'm you say? Uh, what, what do you mean? Take a weapons from her. Oh, yeah. Alrighty. I need a. I need to take. I need to. I need to take a nap, sir. I'm really okay. messed up in the head. I'm scuffed. I'm just gonna do a full reboot. Give me a sec. I'm so glad that the first robbery was slimy. He's such a little Pepega. So good. I gave that person a 24 hour timeout because I don't think that, uh, I don't, I don't think they, I don't know. <laughs> to the drug tank. I like how that's what we do to anyone that's kind of like semi questionable. We're like, damn, this person is losing their fucking mind, and you're like, everyone is thinking it, but they don't want to say it. We just sent them to the drunk take for no reason other than, like, hey, are you drunk? Oh, thank you so much, Jeb. Sorry, sir. No, it's fine. You're good. I'm just trying to write the report. No. Nope. I got people asking me 21 questions. So he's been treated now. The report is, I'm doing the report. Can you remember the names of the hostages? Because uh, there's one with a strange long name, name that I don't remember. Hey, cat, don't do that. Uh, fuck, what was the- <sighs> Shit, one was Jack. Jack something, uh, Jack. Fuck. One was Jack and the other name, even though he said it um, twice, I really no. don't understand what the hell he was saying. Yep, I'm ready. Sorry to interrupt you, Dusk. Um, Where are you going? I got the statements in. Uh, Wallace, I Wallace. Place? Well, or some look, kind of, uh, look, if Thorn, if Thorn's, is Thorn staying here? Like, if you can opt out with someone here and come with us, by all means, you just gotta convince the sheriff. Is there guns over there? What do you mean guns? You said something about guns. I didn't, I didn't hear what you said. Yeah. Okay. So, so the tip is, uh, kidnap woman. This came in before the, before the bank robberies, I believe. Oh, the kidnapping. Yeah. I need yeah, to, yeah, person, I want to be there for that. Person kidnapped. They were yeah, heading towards Rig Station. They were armed and not afraid to open fire. Both were carrying guns. A man by the name of Jean Luc was a witness. Yep. Yeah, I want to. Yeah. I want to be there for the kidnapping. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Talk to the sheriff. That's what I mean. We can't just start dragging out. It's well, pretty annoying. Do you remember uh, who the hostages were? It was Jack uh, something? I believe, I believe Thorn. It was that fella in there. One of the medical trainees was one of the hostages. Really? And uh, yeah. who was the other guy? Uh, I'm not sure, but Thorn uh, took a statement, I believe. Uh, any any questions you have regarding hostages or the bank robbery incident, uh, talk to uh, Sheriff Monroe. Okay. Just cause I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to uh, stay well. Um. All right, easy. Um, uh, he said Thorn took a statement from the hostages, sir. Yeah, I got, we got that. That's okay. fine. Do you? It was it only him that shot us. Uh, I think there was another that may have opened fire, but I didn't get a good look because one hopped off the wagon, horse. one was on horse, the one on horse went off, and uh, one got back on the wagon and went off. Right. Okay. At least, uh, 
That's what I thought I saw. So I'm just get, trying to get the charges right. Uh, Is that his name? Hit? Jacks me off? Shut up. No, any of us. No. No, I'm good. I, uh, I actually had a slight grace. Slight grace from what? Maybe this is all dealt with. A gunfire, but it's like, uh, it's just, it's very shallow, sir. I'll have her take a look at, look at me. Hey, can you uh, take a look at my shoulder real fast? Yeah, sure. He also says he's still cuffed. Still cuffed? Are you lying? Come here. Why would I lie about something like that? Okay, you're right. Here, come here. And plus, plus, if I wasn't, I would be choking you out right now. <laughs> yeah, that's me. All right, give me a second. All right, you're leaving the office now? Fuck, I think he's scuffed. All right. Um, e yeah, Slimy? you can leave the office. That way yes. we're not crowding uh, the deputies uh, too much. All right, here. Come this way, then. I might have to take a nap. Uh. I'll let you yeah. out the door. Uh, yeah, you, you do. You no, I didn't, Slimy. Just grab, just grab those on the way All right, up. I'll be back. Okay. He has to take a nap. Okay. Go ahead and uh, let me see. Right. Have a lovely what? Day. Where were you hit? Uh, oh fuck. So where's the injury? Your shoulder. Well, good news is, is this will be fairly painless. Have you ever had anything with cocaine in it before? Uh, toothache drops, fizzy drinks, cocaine gum, anything like that? Uh, no, I usually apply cocaine gum to Boyd. Okay, but I don't use it. Yeah, let me try it. Have you ever gotten it on your hands, though? Mm-hmm. No allergic reaction? Mm-mm. Okay, perfect. And this will just start to tingle and it'll numb up the area a little bit. All right. Ah. I know, I'm so sorry. Um, well, I'm Is she alright? Yeah, she's gonna be okay. Um, what I'm gonna put on there next is a honey salve. It'll help prevent infection. It's not that bad, Boyd. All right, and there you go. Thanks, Doc. Yeah, no worries. Uh, I think if that's all, gentlemen, uh, payment and then the weapons. Payment? Oh. I ain't got no money for you. Did Claymore take your weapons? Uh, he left them in a box, in mm. one of the boxes. Okay, let me see. Which one did you leave it on? Uh, what did you have? I had a repeating shotgun, a navy, uh, five throwing knives, and 
a lasso if that was also taken. Yeah, it was. Hey, hey luck. Mm hmm. You ready for tomorrow? Oh, I'm never ready for tomorrow. Prepared for that record to be obliterated? Oh, you're talking about the races. What are you talking about? <sighs> Sunday nights. Oh, that's right. The debut of Swing Sundays when I capture Summers. Oh, right. yeah. I, I wouldn't, you know, don't go play in Icarus. You fly too close to that sun, you're going to crash. Mm hmm. Well, someone, well, no, he's going to be caught eventually. Yeah, eventually. You know, don't <sighs> provoke him Wait, that before that point. Like? That is a, uh, that is a losing game. Boyd! You have uh, company. Okay, I'm flipping out the door. Hi, Wisteria. Boyd uh, Kerrigan. Uh, Handyman yeah. extraordinaire. What can I do for you? I heard someone got oh hacked God. to pieces on my property. Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck. Uh, right, right. You up at window, yeah? Uh-huh. Yeah. Fuck. Um. All right, just uh, give us a, give us a couple of minutes, right? I will not be here when you leave. I am fleeing from the scene. What the hell? Wait. Did you kill the man on your property? No, but I think it'd be fun to make you think I did. Wisteria, did he do that? Did he do what? Did he, he hack a no. man on his person. own? No. I do have a, I am a convicted murderer. He I could is a, What's your name, idiot. sir? He is an Jack idiot. Jack Thompson. Uh, he is Jack Thompson, an idiot. Right? Yeah. I am. Okay, whip. Fuck me. I, I am a convicted murderer. He turned himself in the first I time. I could have done it again. Jack. What? Well, hello. For the love of God. Get up here. What? What? You are going to get put in handcuffs. You didn't kill the man, did you? Who knows? <laughs> Ask me some oh. questions. Ugh. Get down to the bottom of it. There Ask me go, about Boyd. the crime scene. No, 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 no. No, there you go. They Boyd. told us to talk to Boyd. There you go, so Boyd. we are here talking Why to Boyd. Why did talk to Boyd for? Who told you that? I don't know. Some dickhead in a hat who I very much dislike. All in red. Heart? No. I don't know. Maybe. Um, I don't think it was Heart. It was, um, shit. I know his name. I'll just know he's a dickhead. He ain't that much of a dickhead. But he said to is talk there, to you specifically, boy. All right, all right. Let's have a conversation over here. Just me and you, all right? Come on. Woo! <laughs> oh, I live there too, but okay. Bye. Well, how do you Why does Jack you? want this kind of attention, Wisteria? Because hey. this is hey, Sarah. what he does. Never okay. mind, I'm up there more. Hey, Sarah. Uh, Wisteria, if you want to wait, I'll talk to you. But there's a man in the cells I need to talk to. If you can hear him yelling. What? Oh wait, I know that guy. Slimy, what? You better try and bribe me again. Bribe you, I would never. He tried to bri bribe me too, sir. Yeah, I believe it. And he criminally threatened me multiple times. Criminally Slimy tried threatened to bribe you. me. Yep. Here, say. Bribe you, Wisteria. I've never bribed you, and if I did, so I lied. No, because you wouldn't tell me your name because I'm not important enough, Slimy. I, I did not <laughs> fucking <laughs> say that. I said lie. I didn't say that. I was you probably in did. hiding. Hope you enjoy your time behind bars. I oh. told me you were good. What happened? What happened? Is he this because I called your leader a bag of old bones? I love him. I heard she's dead, by the way. Oh she my dead. god. It's all hag dead. She ain't dead. She's dying, though. She is? Thank tell me where she's at. I'll make it quicker. God knows oh. Valentine could do without that crazy old lady. She's out of state in a hospital. Far away from you. God. Oh, I heard something, Wisteria. Mm-hmm. I heard your house is in disarray. And your people trying to kill each other. Oh, yeah, we did find a body on our property. Thanks for the reminder. Yeah. Hard times, huh? Hard times. You know I could fix it all. Put more I bodies could. on our property? You did that? Nah. No, not necessarily, but I could help you. 
I could help you make sure everybody likes each other again. That people don't want to kill each other again. I could do that for you, Mysteria. I don't think that is possible, Swami. Is you this take care of, You tension? take care of my problem? I'll take care of yours, huh? What are you expecting me to do, Swami? I don't know. You're the one on the outside. Figure it out. No, I'm the one on the outside that can walk away. Uh, I look forward to when all the mama boys die. Death to all you cucarachas. Every last one of you. Good thing I ain't a boy, Slimey. Well, what you guys got on me, huh? What have nothing. I got on you? Well, I've got... There was a, an incident on the 27th of April. Um, you had Sheriff Lewis and Senior Deputy Kai. Nice. They were out near a rig station. They were looking for a Fall moonshiner, phone. apparently. What'd they find? They were at the bridge coming from Riggs, heading towards Blackwater, and Slimy and two others ambushed them and robbed them of me? weaponry and ammo. I would never. And plus, if that was me, I would have killed them. Make sure you know, no turn left. Really? What, did you rob the bank here today? Uh, the bank here today? Yeah. If I said it, it wasn't me, would you believe me? No. <laughs> well, then I, I guess you know the answer then, huh? Yes, of course it was me. I was he just thinking, you. I just thought that your response was going to be the same, you know? Your, your failed attempt at trying to kill somebody. You know, when I wrap my hands around your scrawny little neck... And, and you, you failed. My, and I pulled up my, my gun. You no. were too slow, though. I you, you're getting old. No, 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 no. I, lucky for you, a six shooter is a six shooter, not a seven shooter. Because if it was, <laughs> you'd have a hole in the back of your head. Interesting. Well, honest, that's unfortunate okay. for uh, your Mr. Professional Gunslinger here. Uh, so many times. I shot, I shot, I shot, and you just kept coming in with your goddamn maniacs. It's like you out for blood. I thought maybe if I shoot them three, four times, they'll tuck tail and run back the roads and kiss their loved ones and have a nice day. But no, you guys wanted to be, you wanted to be in the trenches, huh? You wanted to be in the trenches. I guess next time I got a plan better. Where's my friends? You got them too, huh? We'll find out soon enough. Maybe we tip them somewhere else. If you Maybe may. you can join them in Sissica. Hi, Big Bud. Maybe I will. And another thing. I got a question for you, senor. What's your question? You know a man named Sanguini? No. Never heard the name before? No. Okay. Is it a name? Yes, it's a name. Sounds like a sure. drink. Uh, I don't know. I think it's a name, at least. Well, I've got something that belongs to them that they want. So if you find them, let them know that they, they, they slimy is looking. I thought they were a deputy. I was so sure, you know. I was so sure what I had was so nice. You know, it's the type of things only deputies would buy. No, we have no deputies called Sanguini. All right, well, what do you have on me other than this bank job and uh, the other... Uh, That's the, it. The, the lies, that's it? That's it. Okay, I was talking to this deputy here, and I'm willing to give you some information if you swing the deal, huh? He wants to give us information on the man killer, sir. Yes, those guys. I'll tell you who their leader is. What do you think, sir? They're not even a group of interest. What? <laughs> we, there, there's no group. What are you looking at? Are you serious? <laughs> I heard, I heard that they were <laughs> killing people. In fact, they tried to kill me one time. I'm pretty sure if there was a group called the Man Killers running around, we'd have fucking heard about them. 
this. Hello. Come on, give me something for this. Who oh, no, knows? Maybe they come around and they do it, and now you know who to look for. What the fuck? I'll tell uh, you what. I'll, I'll, sorry. I'll, I'll keep hard. it simple for you. <laughs> Any weapons that you have, uh, Sheriff? Jack? Howdy. Yes, howdy. What did you do with Boyd? I killed him. I will. I, where? I I almost accidentally got never mind. I thought Jack uh hatcheted you into a bunch of pieces and killed you and I was about to murder him and No don't don't okay. Don't tell <laughs> Do not say that to people. Alright? <laughs> I was trying to figure out what to do because I felt like arresting him and putting him in jail uh, for murder just wouldn't be enough in exchange for killing you. But I got it under control. I almost lost my shit though for a second. I gotta, I gotta add this to the, uh, to the report. What's going on over there? Not pain, I had. You're really messing it up. Yeah. Um, sometimes. To be fair, I could have been the murderer. Theft of government property, payment yeah, fees will be under two hundred and fifty dollars. You are still part of it. Team the type. What's that mean? Yeah. Yes. Come me a deal here. I'll tell you whatever you want to know. You give me a name, maybe I know something. I'm not giving you names. There's gotta be someone out there that you wanna get captured. Listen, let me, let me, let me finish. Are. Let me finish, all right? I'm not an asshole. There's aiding and abetting in 15 days. Uh, horse theft. And then your charges for today is bank robbery, hostage taken, and assault with a deadly weapon. Adios, mio. And now that's got a total of 295 days and a thousand two hundred and forty-five dollar fine. Tengado. I'm willing, shovel. like I said, I'm willing, I'm going to take 60 days off for time served. Okay. And? What's the caveat? The caveat is... Let you me see, hold right on. Right now? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're fucking joking, aren't you? What if I told you that I got a cabin out uh, near Tumbleweed? A nice white picket fence, nice dog, a couple of goats. I'll go retire, okay? I'll call it quits. This this life is not for me. I probably I don't, do this. I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure we've had a conversation very similar before. We have? Yeah, you don't remember that time in Valentine. Monroe's voice oh, yes, is nice. I do. Why you guys almost gave me five hundred dollars? I don't. Why are you gonna give me that money again? It's like nice to listen to. No, I can't remember either. It's for for weapons. But we changed our mind. Last minute, I almost robbed you guys behind the bars. That would have been quite the tale to tell my people. They would have been laughing. Uh, I tell you what, I will. What will I do? I will take time off. I will take twenty days off for the for names you can give me that were in that bank job of people that are real people. Twenty. If you convince me that those people were in there, I will take twenty days off. So you could get a total of forty days off here if you give me both the names of the people that were in that bank with you. Turned on. What the I fuck? Know the name of the what is wrong leader? with you? The guy who did everything behind the door. Uh, the whole lock picking. The guy who was killed who had the dynamite everything. I'll tell you his name for 50 months. The other guy, he was he was just a lackey. I don't even know what his name was. But that guy, I'll give you his name for 50 months. Vivian's voice? Oh, God. Vivian's, vo Vivian's voice is so good. 
He won't even know that he's wanted. You could get the drop on him. He spends a lot of time in Valentine too. But I tell you what, you you tell me you tell me the name, and I'll uh, I'll have a think about it. I no no, it doesn't work like that, deputy. You should know this. I got a card in my in my hand. You think I'm just gonna hand it to you so you I can tell think you what, about She it? is a voice actor. Thirty days. Thirty days. Meet in the middle. Forty-five. Forty. Forty. Forty days. Okay, I'll tell you, and that's a promise, right? It's a promise if this is a legitimate name. So that's a total of a hundred months gone, right? True. That's for right. Me. Okay, so that's a hundred. Uh, and I want you to promise that that that, that oversized uh, goddamn numpty and Sasaka will not be there. Go on that shaves my head. I don't want him there. Okay. He he works there. He, that's that's his place. What? No. That's something you'll Don't. have to work out. That's not my uh, jurisdiction, I'm afraid. Fine. I'm gonna talk. They're busy. I'm gonna go find the other one. Are you alarming? Is that Ed? Okay. Well then, I'm going. Okay. <laughs> You to stop Are you me. harassing her? No, I'm not harassing her. I'm not back harassing off, back her. Off, back off, back off, back off. Come in, come in, come in. What? What? Excuse me. What? Wait right here. Wait, wait right here. Who uh, are you talking to, Boyd? Yeah, Boyd, are you stay okay? With stay with her. Stay with I'm, her. I'm with her. What? 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 what is going on? What is. What was that? What I'm not doing? going to take a piss. Sure. What is he doing? He's taking a it's, piss. Hi, ma'am. It's Boyd, so hi. I've never seen you before. He has a Audrey Dusk? That's connected to yes, a bunch of sketchy things. Uh huh. Are, okay. Is there. Is, do you want. Would you like to file a report? I don't even have a knife. Ooh. Uh, Sorry. I looked, I looked you in the eyes right? and I just got so weak in the knees. You're such a pretty oh, woman. Are you hitting on other women? Are you flirting with me? Sir, I, she can't tell. I don't get why everyone's can't tell flirting either. with me. Oh, I can't tell either. When my head come back, go away. <laughs> do you? I mean, oh, do you, you take want? your poncho off. Hey, pat me that down. I ain't got no knife. Okay, all right. That woman is a liar. <gasps> That's what you said. She is no longer a credible source. Uh -huh. Wait, do I have anything illegal? No. You okay. should have. Wow. No. <laughs> wow. Now you're gonna not believe me. So, do you normally carry illegal items on you, sir? No, I would never. I Are you does. sure? I would is never. That, is that moonshine I smell? Sorry, what was Syria? I found these keys. Okay, but what do these belong to? Why are they so old? I don't know. I, I just found them. don't want them, I think. But thank okay. you. You're welcome. Now they're just floating in the air like that. What? They just kind of float. Are there. you sorry? Keys. Why was it? Why hold on? What do you need to talk to Boyd about? Well, I, I don't, he said to wait right fields. there. I was trying to get the law and I couldn't get I find a door with the lawman in it. So I just tried to find Boyd, who was over here. I, I have he was, a badge on yes, I my that. chest. I didn't see you were there originally, so you followed us out and then I saw you. So I turned around and talked to you, but then Boyd ran up to us and then it was a mess. Okay, so what do you need law for? Boyd, what, what? the fuck is wrong with Boyd, you? Boyd, are I you tripped okay? Over a rock. I tripped over a rock. Can I talk? Uh, excuse me, outfit? lady. Are you wearing the <laughs> same outfit? Yes. <laughs> that is cute. <laughs> Is there a problem with that? Is there a problem? I'm very hello. <laughs> oh, that's so Wait, funny! Oh my god! Oh. Why? <laughs> Why? Oh shit! Oh, that's funny. And then you can prepare. This man's dead. That man's uh, dead. Probably. Wow. Somebody's, you know, stitching up a gunshot oh, wound. That, the, hmm. and that way no, I'm just, kind of I was just worried about you. I wanted to see how you were. That's all. I got kidnapped. You remember a little bit? Oh, that was you. There are just yes. Hundreds of By who? Grow into a, a Timothy. Um, he used me in a bank kind of robbery.
Oh, fuck me. Why did you need to talk to Boyd specifically? I did. I was talking to you, but then I was talking to him. It seems like you went Jack, specifically you to are talk to Boyd. I what? I told Stop hovering. Am I not good enough? I have my badge too. And then you started getting like a little jealous that we're matching clothes. Man, you have You know he has a girlfriend, right? Walked off. I told Wisteria that you are free to leave. You can go. She didn't tell me that. And he told us to wait. No, I didn't. I said you're free to leave. Anything you can. Okay, I'm telling you right now. You're free to leave. If I need anything, I'll let you know. Thank you very much. The knife, right? He didn't have a knife. And then he just free asked leave, me if I was okay. And I told stay. him what happened to me. That's what I was talking about. Yeah. Are you hitting on him? No. He has a girlfriend. Is it you? Is that is that how you is that how you staple your relationship by dressing the same? What? It's not like that. We are not in a relationship. I'm not his girlfriend. He has a girlfriend. That's not me. Oh, that is so cute. I uh, color me jealous. Boyd has a girlfriend, and it's that it's that lady. With no, the badge. no, it's not me. It's a lady with outfit. another badge. Did you not see that? Oh, does that mean you're dating? <sighs> yeah, they're dating. Oh, she was real adamant to say that she was. Uh, she was very adamant okay, that he yeah. has a days, one thousand two hundred and four. Oh. That's why she's getting jealous. Fighting. I'm not, that's not. <sighs> that revolver you have is no DNR, so you will not be able to come and collect that, but everything else you have, you will be able to, unless it was contraband from the bank. Too soon. Look, it's Boyd's girlfriend. Why the hell are you guys still here? To I'm trying to put in false mean? reports? What? Yeah, are you putting in false are reports? Are you putting in false reports? Come no, that, on, Ed. That would be illegal. That's what I'm asking. Because I would that never is, do anything illegal ever. It, that's illegal in this state. Wait. What? Why'd you say it like that? I don't yeah, know why I said it like that. Why did you say it like that? I have no idea why I said it like that. <laughs> that was so strange. Maybe I was thinking I have to go, laws, okay? okay? Unless you have a real report. Yeah, no, no I do! Worries. Thievery! Where the hell is my horse? She don't care. I'm trying to make a report with her. Oh god, they're gonna notice the same horses. Hi, Tenchi. Oh my god! Oh, Jack, you changed! Uh, Out of the way!
Hmm. I'm sorry. I... For... Them giving you shit. Yeah. Where are we going? No idea. Hello there. I'm supposed to be going on a date or something. Huh? Hello? Void. What's that, sir? Yeah, what's that, sir? You're supposed to be going off. Off where? You know, out and about. I don't, I don't I don't know what you mean, sir. You know what? Don't worry about it. But listen. If you're both going to leave me to do the paperwork and the charges, at least keep it down outside, all right? To be fair, sir, I was actually filling out and uh, taking statements for the murder. We had another... That Jack Thompson, apparently he lives up there. So I was interviewing him he, and taking his statement in the report. Was he the one that said that he was gonna be running off. Yeah. I heard. I overheard it. Yeah, that was I, him. Okay, but let me let me just say, I was uh, when I when, I, when you say I left you with the report. I'm just saying that I was filling out a statement and I did find some information, sir. Okay, that's good. Listen, I'm so, just saying when I've it's it's very hard to sit there write reports, add up charges, and I can hear fucking shouting and screaming out the front i agree i agree i was trying to fill out their fucking statement and that jack thompson fella was standing right next to me asking me fucking questions and he wouldn't shut the fuck up even though i told him to leave and then he said i'm free to leave i said yes he is i'm free to stay then and he just wouldn't fucking leave <sighs> thank you op so i understand I, need some food. So I, I apologize but let me take the information i got go on so jack thompson went up to that cabin today where uh phoenix was murdered yeah and there was a fella up there that had been attacked by wolves. He was on the ground. Mm -hmm. They picked him up, and uh, it was Roscoe from the Sam Bass crew. And when they asked him what he was doing up there, he said that him and his crew often uh, use that cabin to meet. Might be worth looking into. I don't know. Interesting. Yeah. M maybe a stakeout. Maybe. Maybe. Is Sam Bass still wanted? I saw his name on the warrant list. I think he hasn't been caught yet. Um, I think he is, yeah. Uh, you, have you guys been told when you make an arrest of somebody who's wanted to get rid of the name off the wanted list as well? Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. But that has, that has mentally drained me, that whole thing. You're not the only one. <sighs> okay. Are you Where okay, are sir? Yeah, I'm fine. I just, just trying to do several things. Um, his weapons were they tagged? Slimies? Yes, yeah, slimies. He doesn't have any uh, weapons. He didn't have sir. any weapons. He uh. He have any he, weapons. He, he, yeah, he was the oh, local okay, doctors yeah, okay. took them yeah, from him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we know if the guys at Blackwater had any elite headway with their bank? Uh, not too sure, but there was someone that got robbed. Right, okay. And uh, they robbed them and headed towards thieves, but I'm pretty sure someone's dealing with that, and I think a few I'm deputies. Taking a right, by the way responded yeah. to the Blackwater call, but I haven't checked the tip line since. Where are we headed, sir? Uh, Emerald Ranch. Oh. Sorry again about that, sir. I was, I was trying to get him to leave. They just wouldn't fucking leave. Yeah, if people are out the front of the office, just try and fucking get him to move. If they don't move, just threaten him with a disobeying a lawful command. Right. Okay. Good to know. 
What if it's like Wisteria where she was having that conversation with Slimy? Should I tell her to get out and leave and take her somewhere else? Yeah. I mean, I, no. you, you know what? I don't mind people. I don't. If, if somebody's friend comes in and, you know, they're compliant, I don't mind taking their weapons off them and they can come in and have a conversation. That's, that's fine. But that guy, that vibe. guy was he, he, fucking. He, he, gave, he, yeah. he gave me a vibe. He gave me a vibe that even if I threaten him with that, he'd probably egg me on to do it just so he can get inside and continue doing it in the cells. It's kind of the vibe I got. Yeah, probably. He's just fucking. He was in a very in. weird, very weird mood. What, what are we talking about? And fucking. Jesus Christ, sir. I can't believe he almost killed you, sir. I know. You I, I shot him me. for you, sir. I, I massively appreciate that. You have no idea. <laughs> I thought, I, do, do you know, do you want to know something? Hmm. He actually pulled the trigger. Yeah, he didn't he have any more bullets. Had, yeah. Well, that guy tried to kill you? Yeah, he yeah, did. He pulled the trigger, but he had no bullets left in his gun. All right, slow down. Chuck's so funny. Bathhouse Jack. <laughs> Fucking Jack, man. He's great. Anybody home? Anybody for a beer? <sighs> yeah, I could use a whiskey, actually. Let me grab Let me one from behind the bar. Him. No, 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 I'll get one from behind the bar, soon. All right. to still be alive cheers sir yeah cheers <sighs> what's in that box peek peek into it I'm going to is it too oh there it is oh there's peach cobbler in here I'm so hungry They mind if I take a peach cobbler? Nah, probably not. Can I get one? There's two. Oh. Do you have a Do you have a notebook? Yeah, I do. Can you write like a thank you note and just say they can get payment off Monroe? Yeah. Leave him a little note. All right, where we're uh, where we headed to next? Uh, I'm gonna check the chat telegram station here, just in case there's somebody around. And then, um, well, first I want to eat this peach cobbler. All right. And then I was gonna head to Valentine, check on Valentine, see what's going on. 
Thanks, sir. And then, you know, fucking hell. Thinking about just, I don't know. I, do you know what I want to do? Do you know what I really want to do? Hmm. I want to hire a canoe. No. That's what I'm going to go and do. No, no. Why not? No. I'm not getting involved in that. Why not? It'll be great. No, no. You scared of war? I have my reasons. Did you just spoon feed him? Yeah. <laughs> Good stuff. Look very intimate. Uh, no, sir. It was not like that at all. Mm -hmm. And anyway, I handed him the spoon. What the hell did you think you saw? I handed I him a spoon of some of the people. No, sir. I handed him you the spoon. Your teeth at me again. Yes, I did. Should we check the wildflower whilst we're here? Just be easy. There's a if anyone's building shine, yeah, I'll show you. What's boy doing? I'm, I'm not sure. Why were you looking at me like that in there? Um, just, um, I felt bad is all. Is uh, you left me with them to make fun of me? Yeah, okay. I guess I did. Says goes to sheriff's to bombing anybody home. Got heard horses riding in, sir. Oop. Yeah, I thought I heard the horses as well. No one's home. Shit's popping off today. Look at all these pings. <laughs> Could have been locals passing by. Let's hit the Valentine. I know, I was like, oh, I'm just gonna have a short five hour stream today. Which is popping off. Yes, Fripsy, I know. <sighs> the 
water looks fucking crazy. Oh, yeah, for sure. I think we're both looking forward to it. It's a shame we didn't What's up, Walla Walla I thought that's what was going on down there. I thought yeah, they, they trapped you on the bridge. Their behind. Yeah, they left all their friends behind. Oh, their one friend behind. Surprising. Yeah, they were doing a lot of talking about how they were going to shoot us. <laughs> and then they all always. fucking run away. Summer Sundays yeah, is a uh, uh, Gavin that's Summers. That's what Slimey's usually about. He talks a big talk, but he's a big pussycat. Is he the ringleader? Hi, Caldera. Uh, probably. He was trying to uh, he was trying to tell me that uh, Ren Solo was the guy he crashed in the safe. <laughs> Ren, Solo? Ren Solo? Ren Solo, aye. Are you familiar with this person, sir? I've met him a couple of times. There's a rider up there on the <laughs> right, no. <laughs> you think he was the one cracking the safe, sir? I don't know. I don't think so. I haven't seen him for a long time. Ren Solo safe cracking, huh? See, boy, that's why you don't wear a lantern on your horse. I don't think so. I haven't seen him for a long time. Does this man have a history of bank robbery? Who's that? I'd have to double check. I don't think so. I don't think he's got any criminal record, to be honest. But I, I don't know. I can't be. That would have been so. amazing, dude. I feel like I feel like Kyle with Slimy's crew would be so fucking funny. I've seen of uh, Ren Solo. He'd he'd probably be at the front of the bank talking. The <laughs> guy loves to talk. Oh, A talkative type, huh? Very talkative. Is he loud? Very loud. Okay. Ah, Victor. Yeah, you're not up to, you're not getting into trouble, right, sir? Does it look like I'm getting into trouble? I'm just making sure, Victor. Behaving? Yeah, you behaving, sir. I'm always behaving, darling. Who's your friend here? Uh, Sorry, can you speak up? I can't hear you from there. I'm shouting. How you doing, Tommy? Hello? Yes, yes sir. Tommy. How are you doing? You. Yeah, all right. Hello, can you hear us? Hello? Yes. Are you behaving, hello. Thomas? Hello. Yes, hello? Uh, how y'all doing? Hey, y'all on train tracks right now. What if the train comes back? Come on now, be it's safe. It's not, well, train, Victor. Not, yeah, exactly. That's yeah. What, the, the train's not coming right now? Nope. Damn, that's what we're waiting on, shit. Jesus Christ. I feel like you're up to no good, Victor. Wait, which one's Victor? The one hey, that Thomas, just away. what are you up to, mate? Have, have, how's reformed life treating you? Oh, shit, man. What the hell? Wait. This yeah. is the Tommy? The That's one him. and only. You man. gave Adelaide a snake as a gift? Uh, I've Jesus. given her a few snakes. You know? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Ugh. So, okay, now that you're reformed, what are you doing, oh. Thomas? Jesus I'm waiting Christ. for the damn train, man. What does it look like? Yeah, but you, you got a new job and you're breaking your back like a solid citizen. I work them poker tables. You ask this time. That's how I make my money. Well, I guess that's honest enough. Yeah, that's that Rhodes dealer how we treated him the other day. Took down $3,000. Yes, sir. Well, congratulations. Thank you so much. That means you have to go around being a little turd. 100% refound. 
That's good to see. I'm proud of you. Yeah, they is harassing me. He's talking about you reformed. Are you reformed? Are you done being a peeper? Oh, being yeah. What? Wait, yeah. you're a peeper? <gasps> you're the lady that told not, me Void's a peeper. I haven't not, seen I'm, you in a while. I'm not a, I'm not a peeper He's at all. He's on three women. Tommy, don't let him harass you. He's a peeper. Oh, I'm he just a little not, peeper bar. Yeah, I'm he's not a peeper. He's coming bathhouse looking at women's boobies. You have peeped at me a what couple times, What the fuck are you Floyd? talking about? What yes. the fuck? I, I've never even bathhouse. seen him in the fucking it. bathhouse. He's done it in the fucking medic station. And well, then he fell into my breast, Tommy. Well, maybe I'll talk to some of these laws about maybe, maybe, maybe making us a law that would probably prevent something like that we from should. dirty little men like him. Should be locked up for something like that in my yeah. book. We don't like people seeing Valentine. We got our, our peeping Tomer over here. <laughs> uh, have a lovely day. Oh, disgusting. Jesus. Horrible. All right. I miss dust. Bye, Victor. Uh, Tommy, maybe it's I'll uh, play this. poker with you in class sometime. I don't know Bring if we it. are friends. Anytime. Let's do this. Bring it. Take care. It's been a rough day. It's been a rough day. It has been. Hey, boy. Yeah, I've been very friendly with her. I don't know why she's come in there giving me shit for. But you've been friendly with her. Is that she's kidding? She's been an asshole to you. Yeah, she's a fucking bitch is what she is. Was it... Was it just a friendly breast fall? No, I didn't fall in... It's, she's fucking lying, sir. That whole statement she just made was a fucking lie, all right? That wasn't even a statement, to be honest, Boyd. And as far as I'm concerned, she didn't even report it, so don't worry about it. Are you checking the tip line, sir? What did you say? Are you, uh, are you checking the tip line? Am I checking the tip line or are you checking oh, the tip line? Oh, I was just asking because I'm going to run down to the stables really fast. You go, go ahead. Oops, sorry. We're gonna fuck with them a little bit. Swapping out the horses. It's my fox shutter, right? Hell yeah. Let's see what Boyd says. Victor? Yes, darling. How are you? I'm fine. Alright. Yeah, the first one's trash, though. No, the Wella... You, the, you no. didn't send a telegram Wella, as well? Wella. I'm addressing it. Yes, sir. Not you. Okay. Yes, sir. Good. Seems like Sorry, we're sir. both a little bit incompetent, Willem. Yep. There's no incompetence. It's just a mistake. And we're going to yes, learn sir. from it. Absolutely. What, sir. Do you, what do you mean? What do you mean gunfight communication? What are you talking about? Well, I'm just saying. You know, you've got to call out your positions and whatnot. I you couldn't hear you over the gunfire. There was, uh, I, there was guns. There was crocodiles. Yeah, no, and but, all kinds of even, shit going on. Look, but it sounds really bad. But even if, if you can't... Even if you think someone can't hear you, it's always good to yell out just in case. Because claim was me. A, uh, uh, no, sir. But were you oh, yelling? I was out? yelling. It's me. Yeah, sweet. Than where that's, I was. Exactly. Yeah, I was that's definitely I mean. yelling. I was definitely. Yeah, I was yelling. Are you, you, do, you, do, are you handing not. out sweets? What? Was, you handing out sweets? What? Do you want some sweets? Well, you keep saying sweets. What? 
beans? Did you fall? Do you have sweets? Oh, no, sir. I, I say sweet. It's 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 like an Australian thing to describe something. You say, oh, yeah, that's, a, a, that's sweet. Boy, an Australian thing. Go on, leave me the lunch, boy. I get it. That's fine. What'd you say? Sorry, sir. I talk, I talk a little bit derelict. Because Boyd doesn't say it all the time. Yeah, but look at Boyd's dress. Very smart, like, yes. Exactly. What are you talking you about? Gonna, you think he's going to talk like a derelict? Dress like that, sir? He says he says the word sweet a lot, and he's saying it's because he's Australian. Sweet? Yeah, I just say something sweet. You know, it's nice. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Is, a, is that You're a fucking now? bogey. We got a bogey yeah, here on the force? Absolutely. Oh, fuck me. It says the one with mutton chops. What's wrong with the mutton chops? They're the most bogan you can they're, get. They're in, they're in fashion you right might, now. You, you might as well just grow grow a fucking soul patch while you're not a little. What little year are you living chair. in? What year are you living in? It's 1901. What the fuck are exactly. you talking about? They're they're in right now. Actually, these aren't choppy enough. I should maybe grow them out maybe a few more inches. Yeah, go yeah, and do it. A, you need a Doug Darrell down. That's what you oh, need. Uh, no, nah, nah, I, I don't know if anyone needs that. So, how much pomade do you put in your hair to get it like that? Who, mine? Yeah. None. You, you're telling me that's all natural. Natural greases. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Sweat, blood, and tears just rubbed into exactly. his hair. Exactly. Well, you, you know that guy pulled the trigger today. What do you mean? And he so? had no bullets in his hair. Dirt what's up, Blur? Well, that's unfortunate. Excuse me? Uh, unfortunate. And he had no bullets for him. It's quite it's, fortunate. It's very fortunate for you. Jesus. Listen, oh, sorry, I, sir. I, uh, I need to go to bed because I am yeah, so absolutely. fucking tired. Get some sleep, sir. Oh, man. We'll watch the post. Listen, right from I will be, well, my, You're I'll right? be around all week, yes. I'll be around, you be around all week. tomorrow, sir? From Wednesday, I'll be doing oh. late shifts. Okay, but are you going to be around uh, tomorrow, sir? Because I imagine tomorrow is going to be a bit of a shit show. Uh, I won't be around late enough. That's right, sir. We'll as much as I would like to stand side by side, unfortunately, I cannot. Absolutely, sir. You gotta, you gotta rest. Sleep's important. So tomorrow's not a long day. No, tomorrow. <laughs> not until tomorrow, next Wednesday. Wednesday, yep. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it'll be Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday. Today, Tuesday. I'm really tired. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. So get some rest. Good night, Sheriff All right. Monroe. Take Thanks care. Thanks for Goodbye. the peach cobbler and the beer earlier. Oh. Good night. He's we needed really... the beer. Yeah, we did need that yeah. beer, sir. We needed it. Mm-hmm. Days on the Good night. I'm riding the Fox Trotter. Do it. All right, then. <clears throat> well, that was good. What I miss? Wait, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? Throw me under the wagon in front of the sheriff's like that. What are you fucking that? doing? The fuck? You fucking no, you, no, 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 you, 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 you said, oh, well, who didn't send a telegram? Literally threw me under the fucking okay. wagon. Right, straight first away. First of all, first, first of all, you're, you're, talking, said, you're, you're talking, talking way you're too doing. loud. You're talking way too loud, first of all. And second of all, you son of a bitch, there's a difference between telegram These miscommunication and miscommunication under fucking fire. One's very serious. We just run a fucking unit. You get me fired? Uh, what I miss, Dusk? Uh, a bank robbery, sir. Yeah, well, you know what? After, after and then they uh, ended up being what? in a shootout. I don't have your back right now, you son of a bitch. I had your back. Maybe I didn't call out, but you know what I was doing? I was Davey! Doing I, was, I had that guy, and I was fucking him up. It's fun, was... dude. It's fun, but I miss playing Goldie a lot. Okay, um... Yeah. So I think they're mad because he didn't say where he was. I'm not really too sure what happened. Oh, I was, I was calling out with gunfire. That's they, exactly where I was. You knew exactly where go. I was at all times. You know it. Oh no, no, we really didn't know where he was. Okay. <clears throat> That's right. They didn't see me coming. I was stealthy. I was stealthing it up. And so why, Claymore. That's why I got a good flank on him. That's why. Dusk. Yes, sir. I said so, Claymore. And I said dusk. Yes. You, what were you gonna say? <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Oh, okay, righty. You two need to resolve it's this always, in the pig pen. It's always fun when you no, play no, late. We don't need to get violent, okay? We're, we're civilized folk.
Yeah, Damn, I'm, Dave yeah, is in chat, which means we, team before, okay? we can't yeah, try sorry. to get pipped today. Fuck. Everyone's sleepy. 7 a.m. You're oh, yeah, on Davey's schedule. Right and I turned back and I thought I'm going to stay You and Davey team. both. Yep. yep. Always up until like crazy ass hours. Well, actually, I just, uh, wait. I, I've kind of I, been on the same every, schedule as you guys. Every my being wanted to chase those Except fellas, in, I just thought, I can't. You know, NA. There's gunfire going, I have to turn back and help you. All right. Oh, my God. That one fucking clip. Bro, when we were going into Thieves. I need to get some apples for my horse. When we were going to Thieves, and the only person that saw them was Marty, but we were already inside, and I had a head pop. And then someone sent the clip after? Bro! Are you fucking serious? Amazing. Amazing. And then in the bar. And I couldn't even like I couldn't I couldn't chase you even though I knew who you were because my character doesn't really know your description. <laughs> Except for where's a fucking cougar hat or panther hat? Amazing. Send him to someone else. He's a fucking it, nightmare to deal it's, with. It's your fucking job, boy. Yeah, we do. It's your it's job, too. Ow. And then I think he's landing in the morning. What are they doing? What Thank the fuck? God. What the fuck? Let's get the hell out of Valentine. I thought I just saw Saf for a second. I thought I did, too, but, uh, huh. Maybe you're just thinking about her. Maybe you just miss her, Boyd. Yeah, I know coincidences. I fucking saw the clip. Yeah, you alright? Yeah, we had to get apples for my horse. Alright, you okay? Gla Glamour, do you see this man? Which man? This man that claims to be Maple. Um. That Yo, is. I'm getting out of this fucking Yeah, hellhole. let's get the hell I'll out go. of Valentine. Hey. I'll, I'll join you. No, he he was in the Sandini bar. He was uh he walked out right in front of me. One hundred percent. Cause I was coming down the stairway and walked from the right to the left, and then he walked oh, in front of yeah, Jack seeing, and Wes. You don't want to know what I'm seeing, Dusk. What? Did you yeah, to I Delilah need to get the hell out of here. The Lila? No, I don't wait, know. Wait, there they are. Oh. Dust is very high, but I can see these people. Yeah, one hundred percent, dude. Don't Bye, Victor. Don't do crime, sir. You don't do crime either. I won't. Sure you won't. I'm not a criminal. Okay. What the hell? Right. You're the biggest criminal ever, Dusk. I swear to God, everyone thinks that I am. All right, where are we going? Blackwater? Yeah, we could go to Blackwater for a bit, regroup, figure out what we want to do. All right, which one of you two want to send a telegram? I'll Play more! I just offered to send it. You what don't have to yell at me. fuck is that? Yeah, we got to get the hell we, out yeah, of no, here. You know what? Fuck the telegram. Let's just get out. So many horses. They have horses. <gasps> oh, my God! You <laughs> son of a bitch! I I read your telegram this yeah. morning. Dusk. Yeah, uh, yes, did to you me. Like it? It was... Oh my god! I here. do. Listen, I need to get out of this town. But Tommy, yeah? I, I would prefer if you did not tell me that I remind you of your mom and you like <laughs> me very much. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Boyd. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Kerrigan? Or boss? Oh, hi. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, yeah, I work for, for Mr. Kerrigan. He's your here. boss? Oh, uh, oh, boy. Yes, I'm his apprentice <laughs> carpenter. Boyd, these are the people that made me drink the breast milk yesterday, no, sir. I, 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 I'm very disappointed, it. Timmy. I was going to warn no. you there, Deputy Dusk, but my friend... No, you did not. Milk. She liked it, I, I think. 
Timmy, you, Timmy, you had a fair milk. amount of time Bell to warn milk. me, and you, you did not warn me at all until after I drank oh it. My God. I'm real sorry about that there, Deputy Dusk. I should have warned you about that and his mama's milk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. I apologize in the telegram. I... Timmy, <laughs> Timmy, yes. you get your act together. Uh, yes, boss. Stop, act, stop acting out and stop hanging out with delinquents. I'm not a delinquent. Uh, uh. Hi, man, you fall I'll see you later, Miss Dusk, okay? Maybe yeah, uh, bye, Tommy. Hey, th no, I have Timmy, did he tell you what he wrote in the telegram to me this morning? No, don't, he hadn't. Don't, he don't had need missed. to talk about uh, that. Oh. Gunshot? Oh, let's just get the... That's it. I'm, uh... They have enough... They have a lot of uh, deputies there, right? It was a gunshot? Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure that enough, was a gunshot. There's enough floor in town. There's enough floor in town. Yeah. Right? Should That's it. That? I'm transferring all the way up to Tumbleweed. <laughs> Nobody ever goes there. I don't understand. What what is it about Valentine? This it's it's, it's a shit town. I, I have understand. a feeling, but cheap poker table. For no, some reason, when people move to the crossing, they all kind of reside in Valentine. I don't get it. I don't get it. Claymore, where are you based out of? New Hanover, primarily here. Unfortunate. But I've been talking to Rabbit and might actually transfer out to New Austin. <laughs> She's convincing you to go to Tumbleweed? <laughs> I'm considering it. New hangover. Yeah, hey, good, do that. We're calling it New Hangover now, Claymore. Because you have to be drunk to stand it? That's what I said, but no, it's because uh, you're supposed to hang people there. That's right. You're, you're, you're supposed to left. hang people in New Hanover. Yep. Not supposed to. You, you, okay, you misquoted me a little bit. Alright, what's the actual quote? <laughs> Sundays. Have you ran that past the deputy marshals yet? <laughs> Working on it. The point is, once swinging Sundays are in effect, it'll naturally be re, uh, you know, renamed. People will just start calling it that naturally. See? It's not that we have to swing people. There's that. Yeah, it's right know, in the building. Uh, I mean, right in the, right in the middle. Considering the state of affairs. And what if they do the the? And you always you know, know people are gonna be there, so I think most people just go there. Counties. Apparently, roads used to be more busy than uh, Valentine. Gallows crafted by me. It will be the best, most efficient. Logic tracks. The what? So that logic tracks. Exactly. Already been part of a firing squad. Been be interesting to be a uh, witness to a hanging. Boyd, I it's just us. realized that you employ Timmy, and they gave me breast titty milk, and I also found out from uh, someone named Klaus that you taught me how to play poker wrong so that I would lose money. Are you doing you this that. intentionally, Klaus? First of all, fuck Klaus. Second of all, I've got nothing to do with titty milk. Understand? <laughs> Had nothing to do with me or my being. So you have a secret admirer, Dusk? Or I'm sorry, not so secret admirer. Who? I thought that uh Tommy? I overheard you say yeah. I mean, yeah, well, there's a lot of people. For some reason people keep uh I don't know, flirting with me, asking me out, but I don't really know what's happening until they, I don't know, it's, I don't worry about it. Right. That Jack, uh, th that's friends with Wisteria, started complimenting me, and I had to ask, like, are, is this flirting? Yeah, are you flirting? Too. Yeah. Just remember, if they have a criminal history or active criminal, it's off limits. No, he's confessed to murder, sir. Going off road.
Wouldn't it be something if we rode into town and Edwin was just right there? Yeah, I saw him earlier today, actually. Is he wanted again? <laughs> oh, yeah, he robbed the bank. And attacked Lewis after and stole a bunch of her stuff. It's he been four Lewis? days already? Uh huh. How so? It has been four days. Uh, oh, beat her shit. up, stole her gun and some money. Go to the well, telegram office. Last telegram. I heard, he, this is like an hour or so ago after the bank robbery. He uh, did that, then took off on foot towards Thieves. Miller and I went out to go look out there, but we couldn't find anything. You got this claim ball? Yeah, I'll check in, say that we're here. Ah! <laughs> Boy! I, uh, How the fuck did that happen? Medic too? You alright? How the fuck did that happen? What the hell did you just do to me? Now you're trying to kill me? I didn't do- I, I literally was sitting here doing nothing. What are you talking about? Edwin? Oh, you, you swapped horse. Yeah. So people don't make fun of us for matching. Yeah, because Monroe told me to ride this one. All right, yeah, that's fair enough. I'm sorry that I was giving you shit. I, um, I didn't leave you there to- Are you okay, Dusk? Yeah. Yes, sir. It was a bad tumble you took. Surprisingly, I scraped my knee, but I'm fine. Weird, in my eyes, you smacked your head into that little stand there. What? Yeah. Hi, Mitchell. Came here too, Boyd. Oh, there she oh, is. That's yeah. why you wanted to come here. No, I I left Valentine because it was cursed and nobody could have yeah. heard me and no one could. Ugh, I hated it yeah. so much. Just got, we had to get out of there as quick as possible. I don't blame you. I had massive headaches about three times just trying to leave that time. Oh, thank fuck. Sit down and relax for a little bit. If you say that, then we're going to get something like the uh, Valentine Bank is being robbed. I'm telling you right now, if Valentine Bank gets robbed, we ain't going. I, don't, I, I would not be responding to Valentine Bank, okay? Not happening. I don't want to think about to it. What's happened to D? Well, we had a bank robbery earlier, over in uh, Rhodes. Oh, we had one here in Blackwater too. Yeah, I heard. Yeah. Edwin, right? Edwin and Jimothy, aye. That little shit. How many of them were there? Just the two of them. Just the two of them? Aye, they took, uh, they Who? took Edith hostage. Did they get every, they, did they open up every fucking safe? I uh, didn't can. Son of a bitch. And then I guess, uh... Edwin and who? Uh, I'm not sure, because I You're woke just up the and it was going on, and it was just Lewis and Kramer down here. Uh, and they were already about coming out, so I had to... Oh, all day. Sit there, I ended up pursuing Jimothy alone. Lewis went after uh, Edwin alone. Uh, got in a standoff with Jimothy, and he tried to sneak out of the building he was hiding in. Uh, ran him down, and he finally came in. Uh, Lewis apparently... She went to go put the cuffs on Edwin. He turned around and attacked her instead. Beat her up, I tied see. her up, left her in the road. I... So, LJ's in custody. Amy's LJ's in Sissica. Okay. Bye. All right. All right. We'll keep an eye on this one to fucking find. Finish up his paperwork. 
Yeah. Is there a pump that's closer? Sissica having a rave? Dude, I need to fucking know. Everyone's in Sissica. A pretty common one, unfortunately, especially when you're in downtime. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'm gonna stay away from that town, especially at these hours. Mm hmm. Why? Later in the night, it's not too bad. Eh, 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 uh, fight to paper well, there, it gets. I, I stay up later than you, to be fair. I tree, I suppose, when you get there's a certain hump around. I don't know, there's times I've been stuck there. Until the storms roll through, you know, from like 3 a.m. and it's it's horrible. It's so bad. It gets so bad. I'm gonna sit here just for a little bit, and just think of things. Where did Claymore go? <laughs> Oh, wait, wait, I should pee. I'm peeing right now. I'm peeing right now. Give me a sec. Why are you counting? Shit, are you guys counting the amount of times I pee? Huh? Huh? Is that what we're gonna do? Every single stream now, you're just gonna tally it up. It's not actually the most comfortable, dude, but I think it's like the worst for us. Yeah, I hate slouching. I was doing my best to correct it, and then I started playing Red Dead, and I'm pretty sure I ended everything. I'm gonna grill the steak really fast. Let's 
go grill this steak. I think there are, there are braces you can get to help you uh, correct your posture. There's definitely chairs that try. I got one that's supposed to be like pretty good for that, but uh, it doesn't feel very good for that, to be honest. I got a steel case and it does not help my back. I've been thinking about getting like one of those kneeling chairs. Have you guys seen those? They look kind of odd. So weird, Don. I mean, I fucked my sleep schedule again, Zom, so uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. I took like three days off now, but yeah, basic. I'm back, but I kind of had a quick pause. Eyebrows? Good. I do have a standing desk. Ooh! I do have a standing desk, but I just, uh, I don't use it very often. Because it's just. I don't know, man. I don't really like uh, streaming and playing games while standing. It's a little weird. Unless I'm really tired and I need energy. You like your steel case? Yeah, a lot of people said they do. It just, it doesn't, it's a little odd for me. I don't know what it is. It's like, there's something about like, the height of the armrest. He tried to go up here to, to the place between here and Blackwater. Or they oh. Yeah, also I bought my steel case without a fucking neck rest, like a headrest, and it drives me fucking nuts. You right? No, this door is cursed. I'll try, I'll try. Ah, I'm sorry. Ah. No, no, I got it, I got it, it's shut, it's shut. Alright. Does not look shut. Okay. That's good, let's go. Tall? No, I'm like actually very averagely sized. Do you think I'm tall? For some reason, it's I think people think I'm like really tall or really Did small, but to, uh, I'm, uh, I'm like a five five. I feel like that's very average. Uh -huh. I was gonna say we should probably split two and two. We All can right, try it. Uh, okay, I'll do bridge. What do you want to do? Uh, I'll come to the bridge with you. All right. Where are we going, Claymore? Saffron knows all the good spots to show point is out. She said that we're split in. Uh, she, I just couldn't hear where she said the second spot was. We're, uh, Marty! Let's go! Lead the way! That is very... I'm glad to see you on duty, sir. How are you riding a horse like that? That's very worry, skilled. Man. Very skillful. Both of you. My thighs are burning so bad. What the hell? It's all about having the grip. You gotta have that grip with the legs. Sir, there's a painting thief in San Denis. So if we could get two yeah, or three think... of you to stay around this area to see if they are coming for this this area. Or to from Le Moyne? Uh, they're coming from New Hanover. Okay, it could be going to Canttail. I know, that's the one that, I mean, we could send two people up there, but it's doubtful that they make it in time. We caught, uh, we caught Flash running shine from Lemoyne. <laughs> he made me ride that entire way from Strawberry like that. Why? Because he says, you know, if I don't got it in me to be a good deputy, then I can put my arms down and let know I'm a great deputy. But isn't that really it. hard? It is. My thighs are burning. I had to grip the saddle real hard. Oh, God. Oh, this isn't my horse. Huh? You stole a horse? Wh what the hell, Claymore? Your horse is right there. I got two of them. 
Del was shiners? No, dude. We haven't seen any shiners yet. You ever seen them circus performers that like ride between the two horses? You gotta do that now. <laughs> well, one I did buy a uh, Carlino Turkmen, so. Eee, that's pink. I thought it was white. It's pink. Yeah, I know. I returned it. <laughs> I'm gonna you be buying. Do you pink. see that? Oh God. See what? Oh, yeah, there's a wagon. Hi. Uh, Bye. That's a lot of lumber. Is yes, ma'am. You, you thought you carrying lumber? Yep. Do you mind if we take a peek in the back? We're deputies. They go ahead. The sheriff's department. Thank you. Right, I'm just gonna hop in the back. Don't move the horses. Go ahead and put the reins down in your lap. Alright. Got any bottles back here? Not a whole lot of wood, mister. Yeah. Just hauling from the, uh, the lumber mill down there. Down to Blackwater. Alright. Well, thank you for stopping, sir. It seems like you are clear and good and get out of here. Have a you nice care. day, right. sir. Y'all have a good one. Yeah, you too. Thank you. Hey! What kind of wood is this? Uh, I'm not sure. I think it might be pine. Is it a good type of wood? Yes, ma'am. Do you think I could buy a piece from you? Uh, I don't think... Uh, I don't have any uh, on hand. It's all already sold to the uh, Blackwater Lumber Mill, but... Uh, on my next trip, I can uh, hold on to some for you. Yeah, that would be that would be great. Um, if you want to send me a telegram and I'll pick up some wood from you, uh, it's RU510. Rainbow RU Unicorn 510. Yeah. All right, it will do, ma'am. All right. What was your name? Audrey Dusk. Audrey Dusk? It's uh, name's Matthew McAllister. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you, Mr. McAllister. No problem. And I'll send you a telegram as soon as I got that wood for you. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. How's that Angelica doing? I know I saw her yesterday. She'd been hurt after yeah, talking somebody. I haven't somebody. seen her much uh, for the past couple of days. She's been running around trying to solve this goddamn thing that I keep telling her to stay away from. She gonna get herself caught for vigilantes if you don't. Yeah, I've been telling her, stop investigating this thing. I've told deputies. You've told deputies. It's getting to the point where I just don't know anymore. It's just an unhealthy obsession, and she should be trying to keep herself as far away from it as possible if she don't want to be caught by it. But I suppose you can't help what other people do all the time. Right. Right. All I can do is warn her. Yeah. And I told her, if she gets caught and charged with vigilante, she will be Sometimes you can't tell if they're locals or like... Not locals. <sighs> Stu. I have never seen a shiner. Setting herself in danger like that. Me neither. So she might not just lose you, but her job too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, please be careful. Um, maybe Lamont though. Dusk, would you stay still? You're making me anxious. Oh, sorry, sir. I was just <laughs> taking a look at that person. Look at my pet peeves is pacing, especially really? horses. Oh, yeah. Really? Oh. I think I get. So I don't think that we can ride together <laughs> then, Claymore. Yeah, I move around a lot, too. I don't know. Why do you think I say every now and then, Briar, stay the fuck still? <laughs> this Although, motherfucker have ADHD. 20, I have to move. Still, you punch me in the face. So I mean, it's kind of a catch twenty-two. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you gotta pick your battles, right? Either you take it to the face, or you just let me do what I do. 
What does he want me to do? I I I, I, I have to damn fidget. I kind of know when it's gonna be foggy. It seems like the, I know every single damn time. Same thing with bank robbers. Starting to think they somehow manipulate the weather with witchcraft. Goddamn witchcraft. Okay, I gotta turn my AC then. Hey, if he's not gonna let me pace in game, I have to pace IRL. Oh, pardon me, excuse me. Oh, uh, sorry, really, sorry. Really, really, really. I'm dying. <sighs> Uh, St. Carson Sheriff's Department. Who might you be? I'm. You don't know me? Hey, Tibbets. No, I don't know you. This is Tibbet. Tibbet. Yeah, exactly. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Tibbet. Well, hi, Tibbet. Have you ever met Briar? Briar? No, I haven't, actually. Okay, so then, no, I don't know you. Oh, well, then, nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet you, Tibbet. What you looking for? Uh, I was making sure you weren't a group of robbers, because this is a good place to get fucking stopped by them. Oh, that's fair. All right. No, we ain't robbing you just of, just of your time, though. How dare you? I'm I wish so to file sorry. a complaint with the sheriff's department. Okay, I will take down that complaint starting now. Nope. We've done one shine run, but you we didn't actually do it door. ourselves. Uh, we're just keeping an eye on the place. We heard some, like you said, robbers being around the park, so we're just keeping an eye out to see if they pop back up. Right, if that's the case, I did hear a shot that way. It probably was a hunter, but it was okay. just one gunshot. All right, uh, near Kerrigan's Ranch, or a bit uh, closer? Uh, yeah, it was probably, actually, no, you, you made a good point, Spy, so I'm killing the fucking cougar over there. All right, understood. We'll take a look at it. Thank you, Tibbet. Mm-hmm. Have a nice day. Be sleep. careful. Have a good one. Wow, Dust, you're doing better. Because I was playing with Beans IRL. Yeah, he has no idea. Yeah, have a good one. Hey, Eddie. Uh, Who's that? Wood guy. Oh! I already forgot about him. Hey, Dusk. Yes, sir. You're doing better. You didn't ask him if he does if she does crime. I just didn't say anything. Does she do crime? Or they? Well, yeah. see, the thing is, is, uh, yeah, she seemed kind of upset oh, that okay. Briar didn't know who she yeah, was, and I didn't know who she was, so she might have gotten upset. Oh, huh? you let me take all the hate? Yep. Oh, I got, Tibbet rode by. I'm I got confused. yelled at for not knowing Tibbet. Oh. By Tibbet. When she's okay. never met me before, so I don't. Oh, strange. Okay. I don't like Tibbet. Well, then I don't like her. If Sheriff Malone don't like her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it's the voice, you know? I hate people <laughs> with annoying voices, see? Damn it. Oh, Marty. All right, well. No use no sitting around here. Head back to the uh, Blackwater and see what's going on. I need to go into town and sit down for a wee bit. Marty. Excuse me. Yeah. Last night I had a Pardon few me. drinks with Jack Burton. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Nice. He, he, what? Why, whoa, why did you say nice like that, sir? No, I was just asking, was it nice? Oh, it was, it was our, oh, the. <laughs> Who's that, sir? Huh? Who's that, sir? Those two people riding. I, I don't know. I don't recognize them. No, I was, uh, it, it was, it, it, it was like, it, I don't know. I just ran into him because I figured I'd do some off-duty stuff in San Denis. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and he said, uh, apparently it's inappropriate for me to call you Marty. I mean, I don't really care. I mean, you should be calling me Sheriff Malone, to be honest. Or yeah. Sheriff or Malone. You can call me Malone. I prefer Malone than Marty. <sighs> okay, I usually just call you Sir. Sir. I mean, you call me sir? Yeah, that's fine. What'd you, uh... How do you find Burton? Uh, he was just having a few drinks at Pearly's, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, he's, uh, he was a senior deputy once. I think he's trying to get his, uh, badge back. Yeah, he is. It's not up to me. Are you? The marshals. Yeah, he said he's still waiting on an answer from the marshals. Are you friends with him? Uh, well, I barely knew him to be honest. Uh, I met him a few times, but never had a cause to dislike him. It seemed fine to me. I didn't see him much though. You know, he was only around a couple of times when I was around.
are you doing, boy? Uh, I'm gonna go <laughs> lay down for a little bit. All right. I'll be back in a. I'll be back in a bit. Yep. What's wrong? Are you alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Uh, I'll be back. I'll see you soon. All right. All right. Oh, by the way. Mm hmm. Uh, being asked to uh, get some confirmation on uh, where you want to be based. Where's the hitch? Cat, what are you playing with? Where is he? Did he go inside? Would you and Monroe want me to be based out of San Denis, sir? Yeah, we'd be happy to have you there, but uh, it's wherever you want to go. And, and keep in mind, it ain't a permanent, you know, either. You know, if you find the St. Denis in your thing, your transfer valentine. Never, it's sir. It's mainly the boy. So it'll be, it'll be, the way we do it is sheriffs are assigned a city. And deputies are assigned a county. So Lemoyne would be Rhodes and St. Denis, although Rhodes is pretty dead these days. You got West Elizabeth, would be Strawberry and Blackwater. You got New Hanover, it would be mainly Valentine. And then you got uh, New Austin, which is obviously Tumbleweed and Armadillo. Now you can also say, uh, you know, Annisburg or Roanoke, but uh, you don't want to go to Annisburg. I mean, there's fucking nothing going on there. Who's the sheriff of Annisburg? That'll be Jackson. I don't think you met him yet. He's a uh -uh. nice fella. Where, uh, where is Blackwater under again? West Elizabeth. That's here and Strawberry. When do I have to tell you m bye, sir? Uh, I mean, ideally within the next few days, if possible. Um,. Yeah, probably. And again, it's not really a huge deal. It doesn't mean you have to stay where you're stationed. But it just more it's more of a guideline to be like, you know, like if we've got a bunch of people on duty, we want to have people spread out, so try and go to your assigned counties when you can. But I mean, look at me. I'm Sheriff of St. Denis, and I've barely been in the city the past few days because I've been needed elsewhere. Yeah. Uh, well, I think right now I'm going to choose St. Denis if you and Monroe are fine with that, uh, yeah. but I'll give you a final answer maybe tomorrow if that's all right. Sure, that's fine. Okay. Uh, okay. What else is going on? Well, if you want to be in the city. We've got a uh, I mean, detectives, obviously, division down there. Now, that's not exclusive to St. Denis, but it's where most of the cases happen. There's a detective division. If you open up your um, your reports, you should find one if you look for detectives. Detective. It's a little out of date right now. I still need to update it with some of the current detectives, but uh, we got some cases that need solving. One just came in yesterday. The murder of an ex-deputy Phoenix Haston. I actually interviewed Delaney this morning with Boyd. Oh, you did? Yep. If you look well, then. under... Let's see. Uh... I'm just gonna zone out while you guys talk about this. Investigation you... Phoenix Haston? Yeah, I'm looking at it now. It's... I've got it open. Uh, so I interviewed Delaney, and I just wrote my questions and his answers. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Not bad at all. 
Yeah, so I think that our latest lead is... Uh, oh, we also... I should note there that... Um, we, I don't know if Monroe added it, but we looked at his coat. Uh, Delaney's coat. Uh, his hat. And his gloves for blood or hair. And mm -hmm. nothing was found. Everything was clean. He said that if he was wearing an outfit yesterday, it was probably the same outfit with the same coat. Now, I know there was some history between Delaney of Phoenix and another woman. And, uh, tell out who else do you want to question? What was his name? Hendrix. Hendrix. Uh, yeah. So he lied to me then because he said he had no prior, uh, bad history with phoenix at all but what he did say is that ronnie uh solomon walker's friend once told him that he did not trust him at all uh i think there's a prior incident with him and Vinny. yeah with a uh, hatchet or a cleaver or a tomahawk of some sort right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh did she attack him with a cleaver i wasn't able to read that report yet or did he yeah, attack she her it's him there were uh, it's been a long time uh, i have to bring up the Reporting out of the archive, can find it. There was definitely some bad blood, and I'm, I'm sure I know Delaney was friends with Vinny. In fact, he like, I think he got arrested for a murder. Yeah, he said uh, he got off with self-defense because she lost her mind and uh, attacked him. So he used that a was gun. it. Yeah, there was an investigation on his death, on her death. I found her body up in. Uh, Roanoke. Let me see here. Delaney. You search for the, uh, search for the archives. Type in Phoenix. Alright, let me look. look. at this. Threats of a possible hitman. Two months ago on the 17th of March. Someone's into with Flint's arrest. There's a lot going on here. I think Boyd also found out some information because the people that live there. Hmm. Uh, they came in. It's Jack and Wisteria. Jack Thompson and Wisteria right. Snow Snowden. Yeah, I know him. Uh, they came in and said some stuff, but I think that they were up there and they ran into Roscoe from Sam's Club, and they said that they use a building up there frequently, and I'm assuming it's the up building where? he was found in. Wherever, uh, Phoenix's where body was, was found. found. Yeah, but I, I honestly am kind of playing a little bit of catch-up with this case. Boyd is kind of right. leading it right now, so... I feel like he should probably fill you in on what Jack and uh, Wisteria said, because he has their statements. All right, I will, uh, I'll catch up with Boyd, but, uh, say, you want to be a detective? Uh, yeah, I would, actually, sir. Congratulations, you're now a detective. <laughs> Let me add you to the roster. Oh, yeah, that's Oh, sorry. There, uh, you want to look at, uh... This is an interrogation training I need to read through. My wife wrote it. Very good. It's a good way of uh, getting to talk to people, trying to get them to open up to you. SCSD interrogation tactics. Look at that. Re give that a read through. That's a good way to start when you're interrogating people. And, uh, you know, you can add your own flair to it. But uh, these are some good guidelines to get you started. Quick question. Mm-hmm. Uh, there is a Wesley Shields outside who is seemingly either going to laugh or be very angry because he almost got ran down by a couple of our horses. Oh. That's who we ran into. What happened? We were riding back into the town and uh, they rode quickly past us. And uh, now he's probably going to say we collided with him. He wants to submit a formal complaint. Hello, Shields. I want to go listen to this. Can you guys remind me to here? I'll uh, I'll take a screenshot of this so you remember. Wait. This is like my note keeping. Just screenshot it real quick. So fuck, I should just write this down. 
Okay. Yeah, we were on a pursuit. Noted. Now fuck off. No, that's fine. I've got your complaint. Fuck off. No, it's fine. I know who you are, lollipop. Oh, who's the woman on the back of your horse? Hey, Annie, this fella's probably gonna cheat on you, just saying. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, he'll leave you high and dry. Well, he'll definitely leave you dry, that's for sure. Oh my god, Marty. <laughs> <coughs> Come on inside, deputies. We got things to do. What does he mean? Too? High and dry? What do you mean? I thought high we were going dry. fishing. I need you to make like a tree and get the fuck out of here, Shields. Right. I got things to do. Okay, sounds good. Good seeing you, Marty. I wish I could say the same. Okay. You said that last time. Is there a Goodbye, lollipop and shields. What do you do with this dead hey, animal? You, you tell him. Maybe getting meat from it. Oh, okay. I'll be right back. Dusky, it was really great seeing you. Yeah, you too, shields. Fucking shields. I'm really uh, craving a lollipop. I am dressed just like that woman. Feel the need to change now? Yeah. If, if that is this hat, I need to go change clothes immediately. <laughs> anyway, where were we? Um, he sent me a telegram, sir. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he did. He asked about me about what? Of course he did. I tell you what. You already know what I'm going to say, and I don't feel like I need to say it. He's a lollipopper, sir, and I will not be a lollipop because I'm going to get fired from the department. You're my boss, so I will not lollipop with anyone, sir. I understand. Proud of you. You're learning, kid. <laughs> You're learning. <laughs> All right, let me see. Ah, oh, yes, in detective division. All right. So I'm working on making this more of a certification than a separate division, but that's still in the works. All right. Deputy Dusk, Saint Denis. For now, we'll put it Saint Denis. If you transfer to Blackwater instead, you know we can can change that. I'm putting you on the case of Phoenix Hastings' murder. Oh, I'll see if Boyd wants to be a part of it too, if he wants to be a detective, or if he just wants to be on the case. He doesn't. More. You don't have to be a detective to be on a case, but Thanks for your if help. you are, it just means that you've got a little more uh, say in who you, you know, who you bring in and when you bring them in, stuff like that. But yeah, read through that interrogation. Uh, file when you get a chance. Let me see. I think Rip Riley wants to be a detective too, so maybe I'll pair you with him if um, Boyd ain't interested. But it sounds like Boyd's already made a start, so yeah. I don't want to take it away from him. Boyd and I were tag team in that this morning. Alright, good. You know yeah, what? Yeah, he's been leading it, actually. Oh, okay, so I'll put you as a secondary. Yeah. I'll put him as the lead. Don't want him getting upset. Well, you can put me as as, as lead if you want, sir. I'll, I'll take it. Is You know, and then he could be the secondary. I think that's a good idea. Well, I mean, you just said he was the one leading Well, no, I mean, morning, I think he's making so... some headway on it, sir. Well, you know what? I'll tell you what. Why don't we give it a couple of days first, and then if it ain't, you know, we're not getting any fruit coming from the tree, then uh, we'll see what you do as a lead, all right? So you're giving him lead first? You said he was the one making no, no, the no. headway. No, no, no. Like, well, I feel like I also made headway, but while he was talking to Wisteria and Jack, I was processing another criminal that robbed a bank before I passed it on to Monroe, sort of. I, th I think I should fuck. You think you should fuck? <laughs> well, do that elsewhere. Not in the office. Sir, that's not what I meant. How about, can we both be equals on there for now? Well, there's only one case lead and one case secondary. It's really not... There's really not much difference, to be honest. Well, no. See, the thing is, is I have to tell him that I was a detective first, and I also have to tell him that, uh... Like, detective, in, it's not really even a separate <laughs> rank. It's just a title. And it just... 
All right, you know he that's... could just ask to be a detective, and he'd be one too, you know. But if you want to tell him you're a detective first, sure. But it's only because I offered to you first, because you were here. If you were both here, I would have offered at the same time. You gotta cool it with this fucking rivalry, for Christ's sake. Well, it kind of sounds like what happened with our badge, you know. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Anyways, it's fine, you know. I'll, I'll give this. I'll give this to Boyd and be nice to get rid of our rivalry. He could be the That's lead on That's very this mature one. of you. Thank you. Yep, thank you. I mean, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. If you know that uh, case you wanted to give me about Tilly, I don't know if Pavis had talked to you about that. No. Uh, she oh. was already working on all of that, and I stepped oh. away from it. Didn't want to step on her toes. Yeah, it's probably for the best. So that's why I didn't do anything with that case, because Pavis already had made Claymore. a lot of leads on that. Look at the latest tip. Well, Claymore, you better get to Valentine. All right. Uh, oh, time to... God. What's going on? What's funny? What am I missing? N nothing. Is it, va is it's it Valentine, Valentine Maple? Yeah, Valentine Maple. No active law. Lots of people. None of them cause trouble. Lewis and Lewis yeah. and Kramer are heading back there after Bard's Crossing. It's a tip below. I'm getting right. an uneasy feeling. There's a large group with Wesley Shields right now over by the medical tents. We just wait. You saw yeah. me to go to Valentine. Hold on a minute. What's funny about this? That's what I'm curious. Unless you're making fun of Maple. No, I'm it could be making with fun of Valentine. It's terrible. Still under our jurisdiction. There was nothing funny about this, is what I'm being told right now. Yes, there's nothing funny about this. There's I've nothing been... funny about it. It's just, uh, it's just, just it's fake be promises. Chaos. That's all I got. Sorry, your heart got broken again, Branch. It got broken once, and that's enough. All right, let's take a look around town, folks. Be yeah. prepared for trouble. Are they me, gonna write? Have I met you before? Me and Moody were walking to the telegrams, and they all started uh, sort of following me, so I made us go left to get out of the situation. A couple of folk up on the roofs, too. Really? On roofs? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Then they, they ran had... to the lumber yard. Yeah, they had somebody run in there, in the, in the building there you can go into. All right, if anything happens, you know what to do, Moody, right? Yes, sir. All right. Uh, where is, are we missing one? Where's, where's Branch? Are they, is KG doing sure. a motherfucking robbery? Uh, come on. Why that would be bad. Yeah, they're all just sort leaving. of running. Oh. They're all just running around like that. They're all being children in a grown-up's world. Jack? Pip? Not on... Not on, though, I don't think. Mostly Jack? Sloan? Quit running around They're town, injured. you fools. So Make not. this town You're right. what, who, respectable, goddammit. Yeah, damn it. fuck. Put my own game You wanna play? In jail. Play out of the fields. Thank you. That's such a nice thank you. Yep. Yeah. They They're by the bank Malone there. Smells. One up top and one on to the left. At least he knows who he follows this. One up top on the left. All right. This could be a bank robbery. All right. This may be a distraction. Let's get to the bank. Is that well, the... they're al they're already in the main street. Just to yeah, I tell let's you. Let's go. Is that the lady that rode him with Wesley Shields on the? Yeah. 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 Annie. Wesley Shields is also by that area, building-wise. Yeah, he's gonna knock her up and leave her one day. It's sad. Is that what... That's his MO, sir? Uh, it's just Jonathan, him. what are you uh, doing? Is wanted. No. Could he be? You arrest oh, any big-time criminals today? 
Why do you ask? I don't know. I figure you just kind of like gloat about putting away big wanted posters. Well, who's wanted? I don't know. No, we don't gloat. We just do our jobs and get back to it. See? That's not true. What's that noise? But I saw you gloating in Cisco the other day. Jojo? Is yeah. that you? Did you get a haircut, gloating. sir? Well, I've always had this What's shorter hair. What's with a bandana, fella? I just, uh... I never take it off. Wear a hat normally. Well, I'd, I'd like you to take it off in town, please. I can leave town. Go on, then. Get... He never takes it off. See, I've never seen his face. Mm. No, it ain't a gloat. It's a request. No, it's a but, uh, anyways, you guys should be glowing. You know, it's okay. You know, vanity is a hey, sin, oh. but only in big quantities. Hey, there's a... They're beating up oh, your friend. Shit. Oh. Jojo, you're not killing crim uh, cannibals today, oh, right? No. You know what? Guess what? What? Tag, you're it. Bitch. If you don't want to play, you can just tag me, mister. <gasps> tag. Alright, thank you. At least he's a child. Tag, you're it. No oh, tag back. Alright, go oh, get him. Stop grab assing for Christ's sake. This ain't a goddamn playground. But yeah, I want to you... see people running around town like fucking pickerheads. <laughs> go play outside. I mean, like, uh, out of town. <laughs> but if we play out in the field, we're gonna li likely get mauled by a big animal. That's not true. There are plenty of you places live you in can, tall uh... trees. What do you hey, mean? What? He, he didn't know that. I was trying to get sympathy, but also to my original point, you guys should gloat when you put away like a big time wanted person, because that way people can't be like, "What do you even do? You don't do no job." You can be like, "Yeah, well, we put away I don't know something the kid or oh for God's sake, they're but... still doing it. All right. We put away Jonathan the other day because you guys decided yeah. to go kill cannibals. I hate Sir, it. sorry by the way. I Come on! Oh, all right. Let me just put my head behind these lumbers. Christ's sake! Hey, I said stop, lop, stop fucking around. If I see you running around again, grab assin, you're gonna be arrested and fined for public. He's disturbing. behind you, sir. You're disturbing the peace by acting like fucking kids. Cut it out. Jojo? I'm not Jojo. Oh. We've well, met, though. Damn it. What's your name? You forget me already? You know what? They should all be punished? Sitting in a fucking classroom for three hours straight? Yeah, you I'm and gonna Sheriff get on made me clean the piss time. You hear that? Oh, lines. Nate Casey. Howdy. You running around with these hooligans? Yeah, I made him today. You moonshining again? I never would, ma'am. I never would. So you stopped after the time I made you clean the piss pot? Fucking loud. Well, uh, I didn't stop after that, but I did stop after I went to Siska. All right. It's funny you should say that, because uh, there was a mm -hmm. shine run happening, I think, a day or two ago, when we ran into some random so fella. Can't catch us? Right as it was happening. Hey. And uh, he said he was looking for you. Who was, look, right? who was he looking for? You. And my name? He said his name is friend Casey. Yeah, I, I frankly, I don't believe you. I mean, I don't, I don't care. Dusk, you were there. Yes, sir. You were there with me, right? The other day, I think it was yesterday, where uh, we were looking at this shiner, and some random fella came up to us and said he was looking for uh, Casey. Maybe uh, it was Boyd. It was probably Maybe Boyd. Boyd. I haven't... Yeah, it's Boyd. Is yeah. my ladder foot yeah. better? I don't mean... Uh, your Eyes in your deputy? Much better, much better sir. Right. Yeah, my deputy. He had, he had ladder foot. I mean, it's oh. probably coincidence. I'm just saying, you know, sometimes strange, isn't it? Well, I did name him yesterday. Man, okay. what, what crawled up his ass and died? Okay. I, mean, it sounds, I don't know. It sounds like he's allergic to fun or something. Jojo! I read a dictionary every night. Yeah. I'm the funnest person around. He reads a dictionary every night. 
Well, I mean, that's a good Stop way to running run around road. town! It's wet! You're gonna slip and die! It's mud! I need my fucking coat. I threw it on the ground somewhere over here when I was running away. Uh, hi again, strange doctor. Away from me, sir? I have no oh, idea who these people are. I was trying to talk uh, to you, but okay. Billy yeah, no, it's fine you want to talk to me, but you can just step a few feet away. I don't want to smell Casey. your breath. Was it Jonathan, okay. the other one you sent? Uh, yeah. Jonathan Redding, Nate Casey. Yeah, Jonathan uh, Redding wears a bandana yeah. all the time, which I don't uh, like. Wesley Shields. I guess my question for you is, is it or JoJo? actually breaking the law? It's oh, Wesley's in town, huh? And uh, his new girlfriend, girl Annie, apparently. Like, you know, this, uh, I mean, it's around. causing a public yeah. disturbance. You're making it, you're making the town look like a, a damn playground. Hey, there's always this lady that is on, talking to Briar. Uh, uh, I guess. Acting in such a manner that disturbs the public while in town limits. Oh, I, sorry, I, I couldn't hear you over the storm, but... Acting in such a manner that disturbs the public while in town limits. Ah, okay. Running um, around, pushing each other over, and tagging, and, 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 and being all nonsensical. Uh, I don't it's disturbing the Pillar beauty. Uh, well, all right. Uh, you're Sher doctor, Sheriff right? Malone, I'd like to offer a pr 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 proposal you know to fix this. About, like, my yeah. I will get everybody to, to play in the fields outside of town if you'll join us for one round. Ember, thank you for the raid. Thank you, I appreciate that. Apart from the last part, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't doing that. You know, yeah, you can do it if you want. You want to stay here and play in town? Fine, but don't come crying when you get locked up in public disturbance. Go play in the fields. Be a good boy. Or, or tall trees. Not tall trees. Stay or the lumberyard. At least take it. At least take all of your horse play to, to the lumberyard. Have fun. I hope you enjoy. I hope it's side. good. No, that's within town limits. Thank you for the raid again. I hope you had a nice stream. Sanctioned fights is a sanctioned fight. This is just rubbing and run, running around being a, a bunch of children. Well, okay. I mean, tag is still a competitive sport, right? Oh, come on. Get out of here. It's just kids playing tag. I mean, Yo, what happened during his childhood? Oh, yeah? The new oh, season's he, good? He, he played tag with... I didn't get through season two. Why do you need to last 14 hours? Why do you need to stay up for 14 uh, let's hours, Don? Take a break. All right. Yeah, that might be a Don't good idea. Don't bother me. By the way, ma'am. Yes. No, not you, ma'am. But thank you for stopping, anyways. <laughs> I mean, if you want to talk, I'll talk to you. No, Mr. Casey, don't do crime. I'm not Mr. Casey. Person. Which one are you? I'm JoJo. JoJo, you and Mr. Casey sound exactly the same. We sound the same? Yeah. I don't think I sound any... That, that feels like an insult. No, don't. Kind of. We don't, we don't Wait, sound hey, the same. Hey, hey, yes, you do. Real quick. Hey. Yeah, I don't think I All sound right, the same. All right, okay, JoJo. I don't think I sound okay, the same Mr. Hmm. We look the same. We look the same. Okay, you look the same then. What do you want me to do? What do you mean? They have different colored bandanas. Ugh. Completely different. I was trying to mimic your voice a little more there. I wasn't trying at all. I wasn't trying at all. Okay. Uh, that's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Nia, hi. You know, I think that makes it much harder. You're one of the most, the most beautiful women I've ever that. laid my eyes on. That's very sweet. And yes. Sorry, I had to come watch. Watch what? Why don't we take why don't we take this conversation out to the field like the law instructed us to? What the I would really like to listen to this con no, I wanna see they need some JoJo, I would like to see you converse with this uh nice woman here. Well you know what? 
I, I must I, I think I had something to do. I, I don't know where Jonathan went. He he's probably missing me. Okay, I, are I, you gonna finish asking this lady hour? <laughs> My name is Dr. Morgan Smith. I wasn't Hi, Dr. Morgan out. Smith. Uh, Okay, listen, Jojo. I met this. Uh, I met this woman, and she told me that the way you ask someone out is you ask them if they want to lick your clavicle together. If you lick the clavicle. Well, listen, ma'am. I'll have you know, I'm a God-fearing boy, and I ain't gonna ask no women to lick my clavicle until I'm married. Oh. Respectfully, I am also probably old enough to be your mother. How old are you? <laughs> Wait, how old are you? I'm tw I'm twenty. Uh, who here is named Jojo? Yep. That's Jojo. Actually, no. Can you follow me, yes. Jojo? Yes, I yeah, sure thing. I'll catch up with you another time. No, it's here's fine. Oh, all right. How do I tell about Um, this is Sheriff Cash. Hmm. Sheriff Cash in. is Jojo. Uh, howdy, sir. Man. How you doing? Oh, I'm doing fine. Uh, hey, what Jojo. Can I do? What do can you know I do any, for you? Do you know anybody named Jimothy? She yeah. said she's twice your age and you can't go after her. Well, I, I, what? Okay, uh, uh, I met little Jimothy today. Uh huh. He robbed a bank today and then got arrested. I'm doing good. What about uh, um, Ed Braithwaite. No, I only heard about him. He was at the bank robbery, but I didn't meet no, him. No, no. Uh, you know, All right. the but they drew guns on me no, when I walked no. in. They drew guns on. Yeah, I, I walked in and they were both there, so I sent in an anon saying two masked people were robbing the bank. Huh? Mm. Uh, are you from around here? I live in Tall Trees. Oh. How, how long ago did you uh, get out of Tall Trees? Uh, well, hell. Have you out of Tall Trees before, or is this the. Have you well, recently I... gone out for, for good? Well, I mean, I, not for good. I'm gonna go back there no, by the end of the day. But I mean, you, you, is this, have you recently started to mingle with a lot of people around the crossing? Um, I'd say within the last week, probably. I, I got brought out to Santa Anita not too long ago, and I got stuck out there for a good while. No. I, I canoed back to a, a big manor and then no coincidence. yelled at by guards there and had to ride on the tracks back to road, or, yeah, through roads back to here. So they, they went okay. to break, How long right? How Uh... Um, I, I didn't spend too long there. Probably like only a day, and that was probably like a week ago. A week ago. Oh, I, I think I might have visited it today. I honestly, to go check I don't the, know uh, the places in the east all that well. Ludema Grams. Uh, what's your last name? Uh, Johansson. I mean, so yes. Joseph. That way. Sometimes no, it's Joseph Johansson, but you take oh, the first two letters Joseph. of both. Yeah. Okay. Why? Did something happen? No, no, no. You're, you're good. Oh, look at his hair. That's one of the least sociable Winsley. people I ever met. He just grumbles. Alright, I'm heading back to the city. Alright, Marty. You ride safe? Like, yeah, no. I don't really frequent roads too often. I heard there's a cannibal there, but I don't really care to go. What are you doing in the city, out sir? Out of my way to fucking deal with it. Uh, patrolling. Maybe uh, looking into some things. You want me to join you? Yeah, if you want. I'm not too much. Bye, Sheriff Hello, Malone. Sheriff Malone, sir. Sheriff Malone, mister, you, um... Well, listen, I, I want you to have a blessed day, okay? And I hope some sun shines in your life. My ass is hurting job. from sitting so much. Well, uh, that's why I'm hoping you a, a happier future. Have a blessed day. You too, kid. Sorry for yelling at you. It's all right. All right, now let's go. Come on. Okay. You're the sheriff of the black one. Get up then. Is it time to enable the standing desk? Should I change it? Last time I did, everything on my desk fell over, so I don't really think I want to do that right now. St. Denis, huh? I mean, I think so, sir. Boyd was mentioning Blackwater. Mm-hmm. I was hoping he picked the city, too. You think you can conv convince him, sir? 
maybe. I mean, he, he, he reconstructed those gallows himself. I think he was considering uh, Saint Denis, and then I think he wanted to do Blackwater. Maybe you can convince him to do Saint Denis. Saint Denis lacking right now, to be honest. I mean, let's see. You got the Dechenzos, you got Taipan, you got the people down at uh, Doyle's. No good. Ran by the Jade King. Who the hell is the Jade King? They're still around, barely. Although, uh, since Solomon Walker's death, uh, you're in pretty much a spent force these days. Scattered to the wind. Huh. Do you think... think... That'll be the first stop when we, uh, get into the city. We'll see what's going on at the Cup Manor. Do you think, uh, that Ronnie had anything to do with Phoenix's death? But that was three months yeah. ago that he had an issue. But you think so? The cut had problems with Phoenix Haston before. And actually, now that you mention it, Ronnie, right? Mm hmm. The day after Solomon Walker was found dead, Ronnie uh, came up to me at the telegram station to see Kenny. And he said, uh,. Hey, all right, boy. Uh, <laughs> think you'll be seeing me soon. Wait, that's actually now, so it good. it wasn't said in, uh, you know, a malicious way. It was said in a sort of resigned way. You know, like as if he'd already accepted his fate. Now, the next day, he was found shot, and we found that it was, that it was James Kelly. Now, I thought he was dressed for the desert as well, and I thought maybe he's just going out there to try and avenge Kettleman's death. Kettleman's maybe death? Maybe got that all wrong. Maybe he went out there to try and kill Haston, and he got intercepted. Ran into the Kettleman gang instead. Maybe he was really after Phoenix Haston. They had a... They had some issues in the past. It was all... A, a lot of it was to do with... Uh, that, uh, what was her name? That woman that you mentioned earlier. Sir! You didn't mean that Jack Kettleman is dead, right? Because you just said Kettleman's dead. Kettle? Did I say Kettleman? I mean Solomon's dead, sorry. Oh, uh, okay. So he went out to Armadillo to avenge yeah, yeah, Solomon to Walker. Avenge Solomon's death, yeah, that's what I meant. But you think he was looking for, uh, Phoenix. Do you think Phoenix, uh, is that where he frequents? Out west? Haston, he was a detective at the time, and I don't know honestly where he spent his time after he quit. A lot of it was around the. T he was the worst fucking lollipop or desk. Like Wesley was, Shields. When he was a when he was a deputy, he was already. Okay, I don't like to spread shit, all right, because it ain't it's in the past. But he had a relationship with another de uh, deputy. And, uh, they were engaged, and then, uh, she got cold feet because he was acting a little odd and obsessive, and she caught off the whole thing about a day before the marriage, or the day off the wedding, or the day before, I can't remember exactly. After that, he was spreading, uh, rumors in the department about her, and just talking shit, and it just seemed every, every day, every week, he had a new fucking squeeze, and that eventually cost him his damn badge. Because he started spending time with this, uh, these medics who were, uh, let's say, uh, not exactly lawful and had a lot of criminal connections. And there's one thing I hate. It's corruption. I won't stand for it. I won't stand for people choosing women or men over their fucking duties. Understood, sir. So, he was fired pretty fucking quickly. And I, the only regret is that I didn't fire him myself, because I would have liked to. When I took that statement from Delaney, he said that even the criminals didn't really like Phoenix very much. What's that? When I took that statement from Delaney, he said even the criminals didn't really like him very much. No, it's because he was a fucking, uh, 
he was just playing both sides, you know? One of those people that just try and spread rumors about everybody, try and spread rumors until they can uh, decide that they belong to a group, but nobody ever wants to bring them on because nobody trusts them. Mm-hmm. That kind of person. I'm not surprised he met the end he did. We gotta investigate it, though. Is there anyone that stands out to you so far, sir? Stands out as in uh, suspects? Mm-hmm. I mean, I think Ronnie's a good guess. I wanna... There's a man named Hendrix. I want to question, too, because I know they have a past as well. Anyone from the cut, for that matter. Anyone who's still around. My food just got here. Shit. It's so hard to eat while uh, doing cop shit, unless you're like, kind of on your own. What about own. you? You, uh, you think anything? Hmm. Any leads? I really think that if we can figure out who sent him the telegram, if there was a telegram, to, that he found an Emerald Ranch, I, I feel like that, that would be our biggest lead, but I'm not too sure how to find that. Emerald Ranch, you said? Yeah, so, okay, uh, okay, so the last person that was seen with Phoenix was, uh, De Delacy, Delaney, what, what the fuck his name is, Delaney. Delaney, yeah. Uh, and then, uh, they were at Pearlie's, they left together to go to Valentine, they stopped to check their telegrams, uh. Let's go for roads here. Headache. 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 Oh, oh, is this the perfect time to grab my food? Should I do that real quick? Okay, give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Dude, my fucking desk is like awful. It's fucking awful right now, chat. I have the ultimate gamer degen desk. Fucking takeout everywhere. Water. Okay, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. All right, ready? Yes, sir. Hey, I think they were saying that, uh, that Edwin Braithwaite fella. Yeah. Uh, I think he might have gone to the manor. Really? And then into Rhodes, yeah. I think that's what Jojo was saying. He said that they took a boat to a manor, mm. but I'm not too sure if he was saying Edwin was with him or what, but. Okay. Yeah, keep an eye out, maybe. Worth a look. Let's yeah. check in the tip line. You said you had three fresh?
And then Lois just Hello. turned immediately left. At a, on the stop of a... How do? The buck. Cooking stream oh. one? Yeah. Oh my god, you don't want to watch us cook. I don't already cook. Anything uh, going on around here? Um, no. Mischievous kids running around depensing people. Valentine is leaking. That's about it. Oh, it's in Blackwater too. They've been in Blackwater as well. Fucking <laughs> running around paying fucking tag like it's a goddamn playground. Yeah, well, they fucked like around that. and tried to pants two deputies, so they got chased and tackled for it. Yep. Who's run? Who's oh on my that god, it's closet? Moxie! Where? Ah, uh, Moxie, 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 Moxie. I need to talk to you, ma'am. About what? Yeah, can what? you hear you? Remember you said that one day you did crime? I asked you. Yeah, remember? I don't remember. We pulled up to you. We were uh, a lot of deputies somewhere in your rig station. We asked who you were, and I said, are you a criminal? And you said, oh, am I a criminal? And you said you were a oh. murderer. You remember that entire yeah. conversation? Uh -huh. Yes. Do you actually, or? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, <laughs> WD Audrey Dusk? Mm-hmm. I didn't know your name, but yes. Oh. Well, oh, I yeah, you were, you were around backwards there, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you said that you spelled your name M O. X, capital X, lowercase X, Y, exclamation mark. It's actually M O, lowercase X, exclamation mark, capital X, exclamation mark, lowercase X, Y. Okay, well, yeah. Uh, can we talk to you, Moxie? You want to talk to me? Yeah, let's talk yeah. to you inside the, inside the, you know. Doot -doot. A cell. A cell? Yes, ma'am. I no. actually don't know. Are we, uh, is she under arrest? I'm not wanted. Uh. Right, check the wanted list. I'm not well, wanted. I don't know being how to read. Your world of detain Why for are you now. circling me like a buzzard? Relax. Because I'm not wanted. Detained. Well, we're for detaining what? you You're for questioning. You are being detained for questioning. No. Yeah. Yes. Yes. No. Yes, You don't get to say no. I just said no. Well, I'm saying no to your no. So put your hands well, in the I don't know how to read. She's on the wanted no. list, sir. I don't know how to read. No. This can go one of two ways. We can get you in the cell on Rip. your feet. But we can carry you there. Ah, uh, give me a sec. Look, I believe you. I've been dealing with Who's two that? kids running around pantsing people in town, so Wait, I have no idea. Let me see. You want to talk huh. to Rip? I, I like his voice. Yeah? You can yeah. talk to him in the, in the, you know, you can talk to him in the uh, office if you like. Don't make me carry you there. I really don't want to have to. There's no way you're not wanted. <gasps> Come on, <gasps> let just walk. It's impossible. You're always up to no good. That guy clearly stole that horse. Guaranteed, Rip. Guaranteed that guy stole that horse. There's no way you can afford it. Oh, 100%. Wait, no, no, yeah. not this way. Hey, Moxie. Moxie, Moxie, this is the wrong Moxie. way. She's running. I'm not even running. Oh, oh Marty. Okay. So rude. Christ. Marty Malone. I gave her a chance. I'll get the hat. Oh, no, you don't. She's running. She's running. No, you don't. Moxie. Moxie! Oh! Oh! She's she's running still. What the? What is? What, what am I crap? seeing right now? There we go. She just throwing us up. <laughs> you were you you were sliding all over the rest. Moxie, Moxie the snake. Sliding around. <laughs> Why couldn't you just talk, for Christ's sake? Why do you have never ever been talking? You always take, you say, we just want to talk, and then you're like, just come talk to me inside, and then you lock me in, and then you put me in a cage. Well, maybe you shouldn't do crime. Yeah. Have you thought about that? What the hell is going on? Is everyone drinking something in the water, Zeman? No, I've been yeah. drinking bourbon because Marty likes bourbon. <laughs> She's walking. She's walking <laughs> like a dog. <laughs> you put me in the cage, I act like She's trying to bite me. She's a snake. Corner oh. on the ground. Rip. He's in a yep. cage like an animal now. You could have sat in a nice chair by the fire, but instead, yeah. you're in She the has cage. an agent embedding. Uh, she's wanted for agent embedding, oh, and I think it's for Gavin Summers. Right? I believe. Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw her name in the, uh, the list. Yeah, I just um, took a quick peek at it, but I think that's what uh, I think that's what her warrants for. 
because I, I skimmed it. It said a uh, new location of someone, armadillo, something or another. Uh, where is this? Uh, if you look up uh, Moxie. It was horrible. It's spelled uh, differently, though. I, I think it's like M-O-X. M-O-X-X-X-Y. Eating embedding a M-A-J. I don't know what the fuck that means. What, what's a M-A-J? A uh, major criminal. Oh, yeah, major criminal. Moxie over the location position of several lawmen and armadillo to Gavin Summers. That's what it is. Aiden and Abandon. 35 days and 20. Yeah, she's been doing it. And then I guess now it would be fleeing and eluding. She's being weird. Uh, if you want to give it to her, I would. I, 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 me, me, I don't want to. What do you want me for anyway? All right, let's see. Murder. Murder? No, I don't know. I didn't kill nobody. I don't know how to read. Do you really not know <laughs> how to read know. right? Apparently, he doesn't know how to read right. <laughs> All right, Moxie, you're gonna be away for a very long time. I don't think you know that. Oh, she is. Oh, I, uh, uh -huh. I know that. What am I voting yeah, for? Yeah, I was probably. You're about to find out once we do. Yep. I, not even voted. I know yeah. what it's for. For what? Oh, oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you can for read. What? No, I, I just. What am pretty, I voting for? Pretty letters and stuff. Anyway, oh. gotta go. Go to the store. Oh, yeah. That uh, right, it's leaving. I what think I also. Wow. Probably, should I go uh -huh. for this? I think I should go for this. What the hell I'm gonna am stand I out here. It's actually pretty serious. What? It is very serious. What the? F Remember it was the armadillo the incident with. An armadillo. <laughs> no. Yeah, you do. Where I was unconscious on the ground and Pavis had to it help really me. It doesn't really matter. Up. This one doesn't Ooh, matter. Ooh, your book sucks. There's nothing in it. Before that, moments before. Your journal's on the floor. I was on the ground. Pavis helped me up, and then. See, the Pamis is on the door. Wanted report. I didn't even do nothing. Says here you reveal the location of the positions of several lawmen and armadillo to Gavin Summers. I didn't know such thing. I don't believe you. I didn't know such thing. I know you had a friendship with him with him in the past. I have. I would never help that man. Bullshit. Are you kidding me right now? I would never help that fucking man. You know what he did? He had half my family get buried in the ground. Uh oh. You think I'd want to help him? Yeah. Well, you're incorrect. He nearly killed I'm putting the stuff in here. She got a Schofield and a knife. All right. Lewis and Kramer might be missing. Uh, they went. We, we saw them to Valentine's from Emerald. What? Read the latest tip. They just said, oh, haven't really? heard. FAO. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh, they just had a tip saying Valentine's. There we go. Use it to my yeah. advantage and just stay the hell out of it. Because if you mess with you, as soon as you start working for Gavin, you just. Bury yourself deeper and deeper, and you just end up dead. I Give us no a cigarettes. moment. If it wasn't for Marcus, I wouldn't have been involved. Good. So now I can. And what a Mark? Are you talking about armadillo? Or you're talking about just in general. In general, it said if it wasn't for Marcus, I would have, I would have probably still been involved with Gavin, and then I probably would be dead with my father. Yeah, I'm going to the store. Does anybody need anything? He got me out of there. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll take a drink. Dusk over here. All right. Seems like they got this handled. I have food on my hands. Since yeah. you and God I damn it, is this what you wanted to talk to her about, oh, yeah. or is it something else? No, I this is it. Too, I saw her uh, name on the wanted list, and when you said uh, Moxie, I said, I remember that name being on the wanted list, mm -hmm. so I brought her in and really good it up, and then that was, she, that was her warrant. Yeah, okay. Well, I mean, um, yeah, we need to look through the report about the uh, Armadillo mm -hmm. shootout. Mm -hmm. What's your name? Regarding if she's on there, because right now, the only thing that's on the arrest report is just that she gave away locations of people to Gavin Summers. So if it's if there's nothing else on the incident report, I don't really know what to do with it because I wasn't there. Oh, so uh, okay. look for the summer's and, uh, uh, shootout, frequent, uh, armadillo shootout the, or something. Uh, I mean, if this has anything about me in there, I am pulling myself of off of it. Uh oh. There, there it's at the top now. Yeah, either. it's. No. Repeatedly, like you went there once, twice, three times. Ah, uh, I think uh, I uh, 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 I think I'm d too dumb to look at this report, sir. Okay. All right, I'll take care of it. <laughs> you also encourage Goldie to run. Oh, see, yep. I'm gonna stand over here and eat. You still planted that seed for her to run. I did not know that's what she was wanted for. 
Yeah. That's gonna be my excuse for everything. Quite a bit of effort required. Everything I'm in. Yeah, I don't know about that one. I didn't even realize too. As he skimmed it, he probably knew what I was talking about. Yeah, I could tell. I knew that's why he dipped here. I was like, wait. I'm gonna go buy some cigarettes and eat. Yep, that's what I tell everyone. Oh, I'm, I'm too dumb for this one. Where the fuck are the cigarettes? Yeah, that's why he's like, oh, uh, I'm gonna walk away. I was like, maybe I'm not in it because it was just a summer gang shootout, but lo and behold, mentioned in it. Of course I am. Of course. It's a good shootout, though. Yeah, it's not that bad. It's like 35. She's gonna get, like, probably time served and charged. Mm -hmm. Sounds like you're trying to pit me against him. I'm gonna go over here and have a cigarette and, uh, oh my god, I can finally eat. Finally! Yeah, I'm gonna smoke over here. That's mm -hmm. too wild. Yep. That's what I was thinking too. Hey, watch out for some skeevy little fucks. They'll try to pull your pants down. Uh, did they leave the town? Oh, were their names uh, Jonathan and JoJo, and Nate Casey? Nope. They said their name. They were part of the Guppy Gang, and uh, their name was Forest Fish and uh, Brick Fish. Wait. Whatever the fuck that is. I met one of them in uh, Blackwater yesterday, actually. Yeah, I think they're just... They're just fucking around. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck they're doing. They're just uh, some town degenerates. Yeah, basically. Are they normally from around here? Because I really do not want to get pantsed. I've never seen them before. Wear suspenders. If they pants me while I'm having a cigarette store, I would be very unhappy. I'll just shoot them. Seems a little excessive, but... A little, sir... I mean, didn't they already pull your pants down one time? Not me. That's why I didn't shoot them. They pulled mm. down Rip's pants and uh, Christensen's. If I pants you, sir, would I get fired? No. I think it'd be funny as shit. I'm not pantsing you, sir. Alright. Then you got nothing to worry about. Okay, are you trying to bait me into pantsing you, sir? No, I have a wife. All right, sicko. Oh my god, I'm I have not, a married no, no. man. No, I, no, stop. Right, I feel like I need to clarify. I, just, I am not hidden on you. Why does this keep happening to me? I can't even talk to anyone without them thinking that I'm making moves on them, and they're always like, "I have a wife," or it a girlfriend, or something. Ego. I'm gonna stand over here, sir. I think that about everybody. Okay, calm down. No, I. <clears throat> You're making it weird. Because I'm not trying to home wreck. You're making it weird. I'm not trying to home wreck, sir. You're not. Okay. I've been my, with my wife way too long. All right. Okay, sir. No one's coming between that. Relax. Okay, sir. Okay, okay. Excuse me, uh, you a deputy? Yes, sir. Well, what they uh, what y'all take uh, Moxie in for? I don't, I don't think I could d disclose that currently. Oh, I'm I'm a sheriff. Don't worry about it. You are not a sheriff. Hey, Ryan, this am. man is saying he's a sheriff. What do you think? 
Yeah, I'm, I'm the sheriff. Sh- I'm the sheriff of the uh, east side of San Denis. Yep. Oh, he's the sheriff. That's his. That's his district. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. So I could tell him what Mox is in there for. I mean, I'll let you use your best judgment. Do what your career can handle. No, I mean, <clears throat> right? I said. <clears throat> It's just so I can let a mama know. What the? Don't call me that, sir. You a home record? No, I'm not a home record. Please, no, stop. No, stop, sir. No, I'm not a home. <clears throat> mm. I don't know if I believe you. You seem like the type. What does that mean exactly? Figure it out, deputy. No, I know what home record means, but why do I seem like a home record to you? Exactly. Because you got gloves with buckles on them. Okay, and? That's a good sign. What? That's a good sign, right? Yeah. Why? Sheriff. <laughs> what don't hit me? Why would I hit you, sir? I was just checking to see. I don't know. I usually, when I say smart ass shit, I expect to get hit. I was checking to, to see. Physical? No, no, definitely not. No? All right. She's not in, in there for anything major. And so it was kind of confusing why she ran. I mean, you know, this is a scary sight, you know. Get surrounded like that. That's true. Probably didn't need to do it. Yeah. I probably pooped my But pants. I love chasing people, so. You do? This is a fucking terrible yeah, rumor. This is the part of the job. This is awful. People. And then they eventually turn around man. and shoot at you, and then it gets real serious all of a sudden. Ruins the fun. Right, right. Why does it keep happening? But no Sizzica time, right? You said what? I said no Sizzica time. Yeah, no Sizzica time. No, not All even right. close. All right. You know how long uh, little Jimothy and Sizzica for? Um, shit, he should already be stomping around. All right, good. Yeah. We anybody with more than a hundred days, we gotta send them that island. We can't. We can't allocate any any manpower to keep them in the cells and all that shit. Right. For that long. Yeah, no, you know this. Rip, are you okay? And bank robbers yeah. just so happen to put you just over there. Have you been uh, kicked too many times right. in the nuts because you're walking kind of funny? Look at this man. He all tired. Me? Yeah. Yeah, I know. I don't know how he's breathing. He gets kicked by horses a lot. I think there's something wrong with him. What? Wait, what do you mean? You look like you fucked up. Yep. I feel fine. Mm-hmm. Are you sure? Yeah. Are you sure? I'm 100% sure. Okay. Wait a minute, Pearly. Uh, did, it, did any yeah. deputies come talk to you lately? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They already talked to you about yesterday? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, all right. I went to your oh, bar last night, sir. Huh? I went to your bar last night. Oh, the, yeah, the blue pearl. That's great. Yeah, you weren't What'd there, you get? though. Did you buy anything? Um, Yeah, I bought a lot of bourbon, actually. And some beer. That's good. That's good. Well, um, I appreciate y'all disclosing this information, and um, I'll be on my way. Thank you. Okay. What did you disclose to him? I don't know. What did I, you tell I, him? I, 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 I just said that I had oh some drinks at his God. bar, or what I'm assuming is his bar, considering his name is Pearly, and the other place is called Pearly's. What? Well, I can see he was getting suspended next. What? What did I? What did I? Wh- oh, my oh God, I, I, I was you. off duty having drinks with can't Jack Burton. You. Are you just gonna stand in the rain? <sighs> right. I was off duty having drinks with Jack Burton. What's wrong with that? Burton. Yeah. What about it? Oh god, here we go. Not th- not him. Why not him? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't even know Burton that well. Okay, the view here sucks. I can't get it. You know what? I'm, I'm, I think I'm gonna stand in the rain. So, uh, yeah, she got put away. Wait, we arrested her? Yeah. Ah. Well, Marty did. Damn. How long you uh you both been awake for? Too long. Six hours. <laughs> How long? Right. Oh, uh, if we count earlier, yeah, probably like six, six, seven. Yeah, just over twenty-three. 
It took about an hour break to eat dinner with my wife, but... Today has been a long day. Did you say 23? Oh, yeah. What the fuck are you doing? Uh... Yeah, it's one of those days. Good lord. Go to fucking bed. Yeah, I'll this think motherfucker. About it in maybe three hours. This motherfucker. I think those fucking bank robberies was the highlight Herman of the season. Roman on um no pixel this morning. Didn't he even get to shoot anybody like... today. I didn't even get to chase anybody. Yeah, we did. We just chased two fucking idiots. Well, that didn't really count. Come on. How did it not count? Like his, uh... It's chasing. Wait, just because you, didn't, you decided not to the arrest the guy you chased. This motherfucker had his whole shit in the morgue, and then. Well, I mean. And then when I decided to actually roll really out of bed and get well, on to be and fair, like, he did try and assault you. Do the shit. I didn't get that. He logs yeah, he off. Tried to tackle me. He long. literally logged off Holy as I was shit. gonna get on. How is he gonna do that? He's actually kind of lucky because I almost pulled my fucking machete out in uh, in the manner. Yeah, it's Connor. Oh, I, it was. I was like, you <laughs> I know started what? Reaching for it it would I, make I, sense I that you know, Aaron. Uh, Aaron misses her, or yeah, Aaron misses her own her own dad, own dad's death. You know, it just makes sense. It's like a very Aaron thing. Fuck up. So you've been finding deputy there, dusk. Uh, I've been liking it so far. Yeah, I went to my b first bank robbery today, and uh, I had to shoot this man that almost killed uh, almost killed Monroe. So that was a thing. Did you kill him? Oh shit. No, I mean, he didn't die. It was slimy, but I shot him the fuck up. Hell yeah. So wait, so we did catch slimy? Yeah, we did, and we sent him away to Sissica. And who the... Oh, never mind. Then why the fuck was... Why the fuck was Lewis looking for her... Slimy for her guns? Uh, I thought she was... Was it... I don't know. It's weird. I guess that means Edwin's got him. Oh, I uh, I think. Oh wait, was it Edwin? I thought Edwin robbed the Blackwater one with LJ. Yeah, but he also robbed Lewis. Like later or something? No, it was during. Uh, she was trying to apprehend him. Ah, uh, oh, yeah. got off her horse and. He turned around and uh, assaulted her. I thought I thought it was rabbit, dude. Am I getting yeah, all my fucking shit confused? Or everything of value, maybe. I'm just trying to eat, man. I just want to eat some food. But nobody died today. No, that was yesterday. Who died yesterday? Phoenix. He was butchered. I thought that was two days ago. Oh, fuck you. Yes, oh, technically it was two days ago. <laughs> Calm down, 23 hours. Jesus. Listen, I... Well, <laughs> I woke up... Uh, I, put, I laid my head down for a little bit, but I uh, when I woke back up, within five minutes, walking down the street of uh, Strawberry, I had... To, two incidents and I had to it was like information overload and then we winded up arresting Edwin because he handed himself in only to rob a bank later yeah oh that's why he did it probably he turned himself in that way he could just walk around town and pick up a hostage or some dumb shit mm. slick asshole Rip, I heard you got pants. <laughs> oh, I wear suspenders. Well, Wright told me you got pants. They tried. They tried. I tell you what I did get, though. Mm -hmm. My horse stolen. We got it back. Yeah. You know, the funny thing is, I left him there at the manor, and I just kept running on foot. <laughs> I ran from the manor all the way to the swamp and then all the way back over towards uh, yeah, the little pond over there. Real, that far? Oh, yeah. Because I tried to catch back up with you because I had old boy tied up on the back of my horse. I, couldn't, I didn't think I was that far behind. You were in eyesight. 
Oh, we ran for a while. Okay. Hell, uh, we even passed by the, the parlor house at one point. So, Edwin Braithwaite is still outstanding? Yeah. yeah. Gotta wait. Okay. Sorry. He'll go underground for a little while. Why is it a template? Then he, he won't be able to help himself but go back to that telegram office down the street. Guaranteed that's where he gets found next. Shouldn't we add him to the wanted list then? If he hasn't already, then yeah. Uh, how the fuck are spoiler shit? Where's that? Aw, oh, what the fuck is other shit? Is that, uh, the gentleman Flood over there? The one with the big tall hat? Yeah, at the gun store. Yeah, it's him. That is Flood. Why? What, what, uh, no, I was just curious. I heard, uh, uh, five, I heard he uh, helps out with the gun auction. No, what the fuck? Uh, yeah, he, he's like the auctioneer. Lobs? Well, bloody hell, we need, we need to really get around and uh, pick everything up then, because it, it's getting ridiculous. Have you been to Tumbleweed? Have you been to Saint Denis? <laughs> I'm telling you, if you go to Tumbleweed right now, there's about four times as many guns out there. I'm talking crates. Fill to the brim. Are Lindy! people still, uh, you know, We almost got five times today? Oh, I passed you one time on a horse, right? Hold on. Because that's like his whole fucking deal. Mm. Okay. Well, I knew it was you, and I... I Well, I didn't know, but I had a feeling. I had a suspicion, because no one really dresses like that, to be honest. And I said hi, but... Who's a bitch ass didn't stop to say hi to us as we were writing? Uh, that's not me. Uh, pretty sure it's you. So. I said hi. And then, when are, I don't know the other four times. If it was in Valentine, I had to get the fuck out of there. I, I there was like bubble issues. I couldn't see people. People people's heads were heads were popping. It was cursed. I immediately left. I actually, for some reason, thought for a second that you would be with uh you would be with uh Jack and Wisteria. Can you actually start doing crime so I could arrest you? I think that would be like the most ideal thing is I think that you should become a criminal so that I could arrest you. And then on Goldie, I could uh, do crime with you. It's a, like a, it's a master plan, actually. Ah, right, you're on the uh, slow burn. Slow burn, slow burn. Just wait on Goldie. <laughs> yeah, okay, 25, 25 more days, 24 more days. 25 more, how many days has it been? All right, I, I I actually had you know what? I know exactly. I know exactly what's gonna happen. All right, don't do crime for a new, at least another twenty five days. You know, since you're slow burn or whatever, just you know, stay a sieve. Tw twenty five more days. No spoilers, though, but I have a plan. Oh, see, I kind of hope that Pip runs into Delilah and for some reason decides to hire her for the fucking speakeasy. And then when I come back, she's like one of the employees and I get to see her all the time. That'd be amazing. It'd 
be the clean face of the speakeasy with Aurora. Let's see if I got actually any uh, wood. Howdy, Miss Dusk. I got a bit of extra wood for you. I figured you probably wouldn't like giant logs, so I cut them down to firewood size. Good for making campfires for you. Just let me know when you're around and would like them. Matt McAllister, TL746. TL746. Um, I keep almost putting YZ009. What the fuck is it? RE510? What? What was it? McAllister? Fuck my. I was gonna say fuck my ass, but uh, what, what, is it McAllister? Chat? Is it Matthew? <gasps> oh, no, we, we gotta wait on this! <laughs> Malister? Yeah, the guy did say he had the good stuff. Wait, at the same time? I was training no. for it's, a bank don't robbery. Worry, it's not <laughs> I was doing bank robbery fucking training. That's and then there were two bank either. robberies that happened at the same time. <sighs> and I missed him. <laughs> what would you done? I don't so many send you to be right. Good to meet you. You're welcome. Let me go finish this wood transaction, okay? I feel like Delilah dresses like stupid as hell like this, but better. Oh, very loud. You, you can't, you can't not see it. Matthew McAllister. Matthew McAllister. McAllister. Fuck! What's the telegram? Motherfucker. TL746. I'm writing this for myself. Fuck! That's not even right! Ugh. My chattering is broken right now. Thank you. Is that how you spell Alistair? It's not Kevin McAllister, it's Matthew McA- You're fucking with me, dude. It's Matthew, it started with an M. Uh, are you 510? Wood. Mr. McAllister, uh, great to hear you have that order of wood ready. Just, uh, just wondering, comma, I know you said you had pine, the finest pine wood that exists here in the crossing, comma, but I was just wondering if you have any red wood. Redwood? know what the fuck kind of wood he has when, when we were on the moonshine run earlier we ran into like a lumber seller dude running lumber I 
think it's just rogue. You. You're welcome. Oh. You gotta hey, unlock it though. You okay? All right, clean her gun for her. Uh, it's uh, actually it sac it's a genuinely thing. sacrilege Thank that you. gun being in that state. You're welcome. Howdy then. Although it looks like a school field season, there? I just want you to leave it. About 15 more days. Shut up, man. Fuck. What? Well, see, you know, maybe you shouldn't eat in a bed, uh, major criminals. Eight in a bed. Yeah. Yep. You shouldn't eat them either. <laughs> Stop. I mean, Stop personally, eating if you were to eat uh, them, no. I wouldn't really have much I've threatened. I've threatened to eat them in the past. Huh? Do not eat anyone in a bed. I have you threatened to eat, to eat Gavin yes, Summers? to his face. What? Be careful, because we shoot want to know. You want to know a little secret? Get real close. Get real close. What is it? Yeah, what's the secret? Gavin yeah. Summers' biggest fear is cannibals. Can't stain him. He, they creep him the hell out. Really? Mm-hmm. You're not joking. I'm not joking. That used to be a joke amongst us. Hey, what right. keeps them out? You know what? He doesn't like time off your sentence. You're free to go. Cannibals. Really? <laughs> Anything to help the cars. Come back and get your guns in a minute. All right. Might We're gonna use that to us. our advantage, sir. Absolutely, we are. I'm gonna dress up as a fucking cannibal. It's just like, you know, for the Dijentos, the chunky milk. We just found Gavin mm -hmm. Summer's chunky milk, sir. What we need? Huh. Catch more flies with honey. Hmm. I think we're gonna get something with it. I think we're gonna get something with it. Are you alright there? You okay? You okay? You're a little close, you know? There's no space. <laughs> Why are you laughing at? What's funny? Alright, give her her guns back. Oh, I changed my mind. I'm not giving them back. It's up to you. But yeah, just look at I'm not giving them back. My goddamn guns no. back. No, I'm leaving with him. See ya. I'm gonna supposed to wait outside. You can't oh, yeah. just walk leave into it. the office like that, <laughs> damn it. Jesus, <laughs> just wandered in. <laughs> Nobody said anything. You asshole. Give me my No, let me alone. Give me my Just give her a goddamn gun. No, give fuck off. Back. Don't tell me what to do. I wanna go to bed, damn I'm it. Ordering I'm ordering you. Give me right. my guns back. <laughs> give me my fucking guns back. Don't tell me what to do. What are you doing, Dusk? Stop staring at me. Here, here's your fucking... I can only, uh... I can only fix it like halfway, so whatever. Thank fuck you. you. Your yeah. eyebrows are looking uh, very nice today, sir. That is just talking about my eyebrows. The door. His eyebrows, his eyebrows look fine. Yeah, you think so, Moxie? You should take a close look. Is that the time? I've got to go actually get some. Let me see. I gotta go get some water. Let me. Water time. Let me. Let me, let me, let me <laughs> Your eyebrows look fine. Thank you. Are you yes, sure, they Moxie? They do. Yeah, they Are you fine. sure they're not a little yeah, green? They do look fine. Is that his? Whose hat is that? Is it my hat? No. It's not my hat. All right, I'm going to bed. Moxie, come here. Yeah. Good night. They're green. Look at it. Oh, are they? Yeah, go look. Wait, hold on. <laughs> I need to look again. Wait, take your hat off What's for this? a sec. Take your hat off. What's this? Hmm. Hey, stop making fun of my sheriff. He's insecure uh, about his oh, eyebrows. Oh, they are. Oh, my God. Thank you, Desk, what? for informing got, criminal of my criminal my eyebrows. Kind of I really appreciate that. You got some kind no, of I, I said oh. don't look! Marty, I said don't look at them hey, that you're insecure. You then said I don't, and of course she was gonna do it. God damn it. But I said don't, sir! Yes, that's because you're a little bit socially <laughs> awkward. Yeah, and is that my fault? I'm working on it. Well, you work harder, for Christ's sake. I've been working so hard, sir. It's only you been one. You just told her not to do something because it's going to be embarrassing for me. Of course she's going to do it. Okay. Well, how else are you supposed to tell someone not to do something, just don't sir? don't tell them anything. She wouldn't have even <laughs> noticed. She said she liked my eyebrows, and they were fine. Until you said, don't make fun of his eyebrows. And then, and then she's going to go, well, what do you mean, his eyebrows? <gasps> Let me take a look. I'm sorry, Sheriff. I won't say not to look at your eyebrows anymore. God damn it. 
I've only asked one person today if they're a criminal. I feel like that's significantly better. And also, last night I was talking to these people who I thought I was actually having a good conversation with. And guess what happened? Well, I'll just tell you what happened. Uh, they Everything fed else. me their mom's titty milk, sir. What? Yep. Who? You know, Timmy and Tommy, apparently they work for Boyd. Timmy and T Timmy? I know Timmy. He's the newspaper kid, right? Yeah, well, he has a friend named Tommy. I don't know Tommy. No, Tommy Roach, right? Tommy Two Snakes? No, not Tommy Two Snakes. Wait, okay, that's Tommy Two Snakes' sing. last name? Roach? Yep. Uh, no. Damn, it's his name. He's like a small fat kid. Well, uh, he drinks his mom's titty milk, and he gave it to me, and I what did not... <laughs> I, I to me. Kids <laughs> usually do that. No, he's so like old, this kid? old, like like an old kid. Like he has to be like maybe 18, 19, 20. Oh, like, that's yeah. Like kid. <laughs> he handed me a bottle of milk. He said it was Kerrigan's cream. I drink it in front of everyone last night. Oh, and then no. Timmy tells me you shouldn't drink that. That's his mom's breast milk. Well, maybe you should have told me before I drank it. Oh, hold on. Timmy? Oh, what is it? What is it? Come on. Let's go, baby. Probably shot. Let me see. Bank, Bank robbery. Oh, no, God. shine. West Elizabeth. Heading east. So they could be coming this way, but... You could go and get it. I gotta write a sheriff report, though. Hey, I'm doing the you same folks fucking thing. go out there. What's... Yeah, heading this way, actually, from uh, West Elizabeth. You want to go out with Dusk, intercept it? Oh, Shit, let me I was supposed to go to the way. city. God damn it. Who's heading well, right now? I'm not going to have time to go to the city now. i got to get this report down, and then I'm afraid I'm going to have to go to sleep. You sleeping, Marty? I I'm going to be sir? sleeping. Yeah. Okay. Are we going on uh, the shine run? I'm, I'm hoping so. Yeah, I'll go. Give me, like, three seconds. Okay. I'll get my horse. Now, do you want to go this way? Where the hell's my horse? Oh! Nah. When y'all get back. I mean, because it's fucking. Uh, oh. It's impossible. It's impossible, dude. I feel like I, I hardly. Okay, I'm saying it now, and I'm gonna give us not too bad. good luck. Yourself. Yeah, not too bad. Just woke up. That's it. Well, good morning. Thank now you. we're gonna we're gonna actually run into someone on the shine run. I bet. Uh, which... Oh, follow me. Are you thinking of the, uh, the hill just below, uh, Latinac? Mm. Below Latinac? Looks, uh, looks the, uh, bridge and the train track. It's an omen. You know, as a crim, I thought that you would get caught all the fucking time. So I was always scared to do shine. Except when we did it with Barry. Or, yeah, that one time with Barry. Actually, the one time we did do it with Barry, we ran into some cops. And we're able to talk our way out of it. 140 three successful shine runs when i get back on goldie we're gonna we're gonna do a shine run i remember not liking it that one time so i never did it again but i feel like uh i feel like goldie would do it with Pip, so i'd do it again is that why he's so good with a wagon it's because he's used to doing shine runs I just ate. I was eating for like five minutes, stuffing my mouth, talking to you guys with my mouth full. So maybe we post up like right around here, maybe. 
I saw uh, that clip. Fucking hilarious. Maybe the next hill over, so we get a good view of the uh, the tracks and, and whatnot. Where? Uh, just ahead of us, northeast. Yeah, let's go on. Yeah, we can see Emerald from there too. We should be ahead of us. Rip, how are you live? Pardon? How are you alive? Uh, you know, I, I don't Would have the answer have for that. Sleep? I've been awake for like 23 and a half hours. Jesus. All right, let's have somebody watching the ranch. Uh, Rip, do you want to watch the mountainside west? Yep. I'll watch yep. Keep an eye northeast. I'll watch the ranch. Yep. There's a rider, but it looks like a local. Watch the tracks behind us. I have never ran into a shiner before, so I don't really know what I'm looking for. Um, as far as I've been told, you're looking for a workhorse, a leading a uh, small, small carriage. A workhorse leading a small carriage. Yep. Okay. But it'll be moving quick. Okay. Does it normally pa pa do they normally pass through this area to drop off moonshine? I've, honestly, I've I don't know. And same as yourself, I've never came across one. I'm literally just going off of what I've overheard. So you've never seen one either? No, but I'm a cadet. Oh. <laughs> oh. How long have you been a cadet? Um. Without the bullshit long story, I would. I'm just gonna three, like two, nearly three weeks. What the hell? Yeah, I must be really shit. <laughs> you come on duty a lot. All the fucking time. Oh. There is a long story to it, which does explain it, but I'm not gonna send you to sleep. Okay. <sighs> oh, fucking wild horses, God damn it. The fog's rolling in. I hear a wagon, actually. I think it's a horse. Yeah, I'm not doing much detecting right now. I was gonna go detect with, uh, Mar or Marty, but, uh, well. I always tell uh, Bert and Righty to stop having real jobs, but I don't think that's something that people should tell people. How long were you a cadet for? Oh, uh, <clears throat> I don't know, like four or five days, six days, five, six, five, what three, five, four, five, six, five days. I'm complaining. Uh, two weeks. How many ride-alongs? Before I got my badge, like nine or ten. Look, riders. Oh, wild horse! Just kidding. Yeah. No. This is, this I have number, an itch in this my is pants. Number eighteen for me. I have a big itch. It's so itchy. I think. Need a new saddle. That is another moonshine run. It could be heading from uh, Lemoyne this way. 
All right. And if so, we're in prime location to catch them. It could also be a bank robbery, but we got so many people everywhere. What if it's a bank robbery, right? There's tons of people around. We'll have it covered. We'll never get there in time. Uh, what if it's... Yeah, okay. Never also, mind. That itch has gotten satisfied. Roads again, they'll get nothing. So fuck them. Idiots. Oh, if it's Valentine, I don't want to go to Valentine. That yeah, place earlier was a mess. Shit show. Yep. Always fucking is. Uh, we'll just stand by. Ping chase Andy over here. Oakwood oh, Johnson shouting me in Valentine. What the hell? Yeah, that sounds about right. He has a warrant for his arrest. Is it for shitting on you? No, I don't think so. I think he's up to some other stuff. Are you sure? He wants to protest the sheriff's department. He did. That was right. That was right after he shot on me. What the? Oh, his protest. Oh, yeah, he, he said that he wanted <laughs> justice. He was upset that we responded Ooh, to a well, shootout in Ansburg rather than deal with his bullshit. The, the, the sheriff's department died. Yeah. He tried telling me this shit while I was on a train. But why the hell? What's the point of? Sh Shitting on someone. I th had to throw so, shit at someone before. He's just a nasty motherfucker. That's what. Basically, Hart tried to do some kind of like, I don't know, visualization stuff with him. And I think it triggered some of his PTSD. So he thought he was falling off a cliff. He fainted and shot himself and passed mm -hmm. out. So I had to carry him to the medical office and he just kept shitting and it was dribbling down on my shoulder and stuff. It was awful. Hey, you want to know something that might make you feel worse? Mm -hmm. The only time that's ever happened to me is when I, you know, killed somebody. And then I had to take them oh, to a grave. Uh, yeah, yeah, they shit all over the okay. fucking place. Yeah. All such motherfuckers. All right, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. The day I got my badge, I threw shit at a civilian that was also a criminal. Doesn't always happen, but. Uh huh. And then I also almost got recruited into a gang. So you threw. So you threw shit at someone and gave you a badge. Yep. I get shot on, and I still don't have a badge. Yep. Absolutely. I've been shot on twice. Sh what? Once, I think this cadet once, attracts once, shit. Once by Awkward Johnson, and once by well, the department. Look, on job, you're gonna get some shit on you eventually. Wait, who's the other one from? The department, clearly. Oh, pfft. And then they sent you here to just rub it in my face. Not the shit, just the fact hey. I don't have a badge yet. Come back. Mm. All right. I also dumped a uh, piss on my here. best friend. Well, I didn't like him at the I'm time. Done with this. He was another cadet. Uh, I dumped really piss on him. It's not like there's anything you else. Pissed on a cadet? Unless no, no, no I dumped. Uh, I dumped piss on another cadet while I was a cadet. Do people know about this? Yeah, it was in my cadet feedback. Yeah, it would be nice if uh, <laughs> uh, like, we nearby this telegram if something's happening. Uh, just send one of us a direct telegram. Bro, I fucking love self-stitching. I guess what? Yeah, ask a sheriff to let me see your feedback so I can compare it to I mine. think they got rid of it. Also, uh, there was another person, my, my friend, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. who was a cadet. The, the one, one that... On? Well, well, it, I, it wasn't my piss. Thing. It was a prisoner's well, piss. Well, it was a criminal's there, piss because yeah. it was a piss pot. Anyways, look. Yeah, I think we we had our interview the same day the and we got our badge basically at the same time. No, we'll get lucky He's now a deputy too. I just got made to clean piss. Yeah, I had a clean piss one time. I've cleaned approximately... Hmm, I think we're looking at about nine piss pots by now. Going around, Emerald.
bro. I don't think I'll ever see a shiner. I think I've given up on it and even wanting to respond to moonshine runs. I probably shouldn't though. Wait, it's just, I don't know. I feel like I've never, uh, I never see him. I don't see no horses. It could be incredibly early. Let's go up the mountains. If they're coming here, they'll come this way. Shine runs are like boost. Oh my fucking god. Oh god, dollar why? Why, bro? <laughs> Forever? What do you mean, Angel? I'm not actually gonna do anything corrupt. I just, I just bait it intentionally to see how people respond to it, and then I reel it back in. Maybe in the long run, like a really, really, really long time from now. Oh, sorry. But for now, I would really enjoy having my badge. Uh, grizzlies at night? Yeah, usually, yeah, the, yeah. Uh, usually the wolves. You think so? It'll be a lollipop. Eh? Fuck, I don't know. See what happens. It's still so early like the bears on. are uh, mostly out in daytime. They go back to their cave. Now that I ate, I'm getting fucking mad food coma, dude. Yeah. Maybe next time. Yeah. Then again, like I said, we got a bunch we'll of people out and about, so they could have could have already got picked up. He's not to worry about it. Well, they're, they're, why? They're how, 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 why is it that whenever I'm like, yo, I'm getting really tired, yeah, we can add two, I get fucking uh, raided. Yo, uh, so uh, bullet, thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Considering the amount of dust that I... Uh, that was kicked up earlier when I tried to uh, go through there. No thanks. All right, let's go to road some. See what the fuck's going on. Hell, I was standing right in front of you, uh, you dusk, and she couldn't see me. Huh? In Valentine earlier when uh, you were there with Boyd and Weller. Oh yeah, I did I not all the way see here. you. Rip. Did uh? Did you hear anything interesting that we were talking about? Or? No, unfortunately. I really wanted to be mean, I would have flung schmud in everyone's face. Purple maple? What happened to maple? Maybe it was a shine run. Is it food coma or the shine run that's, that's hidden? I want to go find where like the the murder took place to the house that we didn't go to yesterday because uh what were we doing something else uh figured out where you want to be stationed oh maybe also crippled from that they're asking uh i think saint denis oh so lemoyne yeah lemoyne how about you I've already been stationed. Where? On, uh, West Elizabeth. West Elizabeth? Uh, yeah, uh, I got recruited into the detective unit. Oh, well, welcome. So I'm probably gonna work with Mar uh, Malone and Monroe out in Saint Denis, but I'm also kind of considering Blackwater, but I told them I'll tell them tomorrow. Yeah, I, I think, uh, Cash and uh, Monroe and Marty.
out here all gray. I, uh, I personally chose Blackwater because that was where I, I got off the boat. Mm. It kind of reminds me a little bit. A little bit back home. Where's back home, Rick? Patterson, New Jersey. Huh? I'm considering Blackwater, but uh, we'll see. It's definitely better than Valentine or Rhodes. Yeah, hell, fuck, oh. fuck, fuck Valentine and Rhodes. And Cash is the ASL. I mean, what about Saint Denis? Um, Saint Denis is a little different. Um. There's a lot of bullshit in Saint Denis, actually. Like mostly because of the crime families, the Chenzos, the cut. Just annoying. They're more like a nuisance at this point. So bad bullshit and not good bullshit. I mean, I like Saint Denis, but that's just me. But it's not for everybody. Not everybody likes chasing people down alleys and shit, but I do. Yeah, I don't mind that. Well, I've never done it yet, but I don't think I'd mind that. I don't mind the yeah, alleys of Sanity. I don't like running down the alleys when you're drinking those damn little toners. <laughs> yeah. No, I just like chasing people through alleys on top of rooftops. Shit's fun. I actually lost the one you gave me the other uh, day. I think it's drinking. I gave you one? Yeah. When you were I like, oh, drink. Hey, you did. Oh, I didn't. In Saint Denis, your little green, uh, little green bottle or medium bottle. Oh yeah. yeah. Well, I, I wouldn't give you something that I didn't already drink myself. I. Right. right. You're all giddy about it. Like, yeah, go ahead, do it, do it, do it. Yeah, it was a lot of fun, but yeah, it drives me the fuck out. Yeah. It dries out your eyes. Fucking makes you thirsty and shit. Probably would have been. But David, don't give you a lot of energy though. Yeah. Uh, apparently, Lewis has bought more. I'm so tired right now for some reason. I mean, it was a lot in San Denis office. Up in the crates. I met some I of the know. DiCenzos. Yeah. How yeah. was that? Yeah, I mean, they seem nice enough. They're not. They're not nice? No. Their weakness no, is thick either. milk, sir. Making it right here. You said what? Their weakness is thick milk. That's just Fat Tony. No, all of them. They all drink that shit now? Yeah, Weird. the thick milk. I don't know. They, they they seem friendly enough. They'll have a conversation with you, but... Yeah, if they get the inclination to, they'll... Yeah, yeah. yeah neither all of a sudden, it's the end of the fucking world. Try to fucking be their own goddamn lawyers. I like the Are you sure you saw me on that day, uh, uh, Sheriff? <laughs> that's not. That's not. That was pretty fucking good. Come on, don't lie. It's kind of accurate, really, to be honest. That was, that was good. I love you. I like the Dicenzos. All right, let's see. Tip. Where's Tabitha? Doctor. Moonshiner. Moon. Yep, Moonshine. What's the Yeah, yeah call it. Weller. Clem. I need to talk to you getting arrested over in Blackwater. If he's in free, what can we meet out there? Clem in town? What the fuck? Oh, she's been trying all Needs day to, to talks to use. God damn it! Talk Actually, she's, she's been trying for like three or four days to get. In How touch the hell with did her. she send a telegram if she's getting arrested? They probably confronted her in the telegram office while she was sending it. Can I come in, please? Don't let uh, him in. Who is that? Oh, uh, Cadet Hamilton. What's the magic word? Let him in. He's a fucking. Hey, give me a badge, dad. please. <laughs> Kidnapper. He wants his all badge, right. sure. Where they caught him? 
Briar and Kavanaugh got him. What? Oh, good shit. Uh, sorry, what's the name for there? They got him right in the plane, still. Uh, Hamilton. Hamilton. Right Bro. The Doesn't he count How? like a winter steel? How? Uh, yeah, I said. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's just a hat. A little. A hat and the facial hair? Mm hmm. Hey, I might be heading to bed, so I'm gonna go to Saint Denis. Nice. No. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. Do I need to put in an anon if I'm going off duty? No. Okay. You're good. Just uh, we know. We'll notice you're not on the clipboard anymore. Okay. Yeah, just remove yourself from both clipboards when you. Okay, I'll remove myself when I get there. Remember the Sounds big good. one. Huh? What did he say? I don't know what he. I don't know what the fuck he said. What's the big one? Oh, the Discord. Go off the Discord. He always DMs me. You forgot to exit the Discord. I'm gonna use it only once. I've gotten DM'd about it a bunch of times. I always fucking forget. See if Kyle's up. I don't know what I, I don't know which one I like better. The thoroughbred or the fox trotter? Almost there. Guy scared me. I mean, the fox shot is supposed to be, right? But I don't know. You think so, Gore? Huh. This one looks really similar to milk. So I kind of like, don't like writing as much because I didn't realize how similar it looks to milk skin. To, to, to milk. But it actually doesn't really, I don't know, it's more speckled. I might get a Turkoman, try it out. Okay, this sounds really odd, but when I ride the Fox Trotter, I don't like the way its ass looks. I think I think its ass is like too bulky. Like a like a pig's ass. And so like when I'm riding it for some reason I can't stop looking at the the horse. If that makes sense. Huh? Oh yeah, shit, my telegrams. I wanna check it real fast. I think this is the best office. Telegram, the wood one? Oh, wait. <laughs> Are, are you Matthew McAllister? Amazing. The wood guy. Our wood connect. Listen, bro. We need some fucking... We need some fucking redwood, alright? Motherfucker, it's not Kevin. It's Matthew.
You guys are fucking with me. This guy's scary looking. It's fucking Matthew! This dust got all the perfect redwood in mine. I will need a day or so to get it ready for delivery. Just be sure to have plenty of space. That will be quite a large load. <sighs> Why the fuck is it raining like this? Why is it? Why is it a wood delivery and it's a phrase as large load? Of course this motherfucker doesn't put his telegram in the cap. Bums can listen to me talk shit about it. TL746. Pardon me, miss. It is not 12.05 a.m. You're fucking lying. Why does Dusty need wood? Go find out, chat! Summer, Sunday, fun day. Yeah, I think I want like an over under bet. Like, are we going to go down within the first like... The thing is, is... It's going to be seconds, bro. It, it, it's going to be... I'm saying tops two minutes. Don't think... I don't think that we would even last two minutes. Nothing. Alright, chat. I am going to sleep. Oh, I wasn't even on duty. Dope. For the coffin, you think we're already on that perma arc? Is that, is that what it is? You think we're ready for a perma already? You're welcome, Chi. Thank you. Thank you guys for chilling. I appreciate it. I'm so sorry. I'm tired. It's because my sleep schedule's fucked up. Follow the socials. Join the Discord for live updates. Oh, also, Angelica and Amazon are fucking dope, and they're doing recaps. Like, all the recaps. So if you want those, they're the Discord. It's awesome. Apparently, people use the meta channel. Let's see. Meta channel always pop in? Well, there you go. Um,
Cronus. Cronus. Raid. Con of Cronus. All right, chat. We're going to raid up Cronus. Please say hello to him. Please say, uh, I guess it would be happy partner anniversary. And, uh, tell him he's an asshole for perming mask before I could log on Aaron today. Um, but yeah, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for chilling. See you tomorrow. Bye, chat.